You know when you can just feel that something's getting ready to crack in your upper back and you can't fucking force it? Mm. I mean, sometimes. Yeah, for us, it's always the level back at first. No, it's, it's around the shoulder blades for me specifically. Like, right in between it. And what is, I'm looking at the dashboard here. I haven't looked at this since the last Sonic Hacking Contest stream. Now there's a start guest star? What the fuck is that? That's tough, that's tough. What is this? Guest star makes it easy to invite, prep, and go live with guests on your stream. You can import guest slots as browser sources and OBS. Hosts up to five guests at the same time. Easily swap guests in and out of your stream. Guests can easily join from a web browser. Any phone verified to which user can be a guest. Microphone required. Camera optional. Okay. Well, I don't think I'm gonna do that better night. <laughs> How's it going everybody? We're gonna let the stream warm up for a couple of minutes before we get things started here, just to make sure that you guys can hear me just fine. You guys can hear the you guys should be able to hear the game audio just fine. It's just the Metroid Dread title theme playing. And you guys should be able to hear uh Jason and the experiment, if you haven't uh, heard them already. Wait, wait. Yeah. Oh fuck, I misspelled things in the chat. I just realized I said the I said thungs. Not things. Huh. Ah well. You know, I actually took the time to like drop five dollars on Twitter Blue because of a typo I made on that Reiko Kodama tweet I posted earlier in the week. You cancelled right after, yeah? You cancelled. Yeah, because no, because she passed away in May. Uh, and it only was made public this week because of a, uh, a mem uh, what was it a memoriam that was revealed in the Sega Genesis Mega Mini Drive 2. Mini yeah, yeah, uh, and, that, and that was pretty much when it was out in the open. So I was like, oh, that sucks. So I made a so I made a tweet about it, but I realized I misspelled her last name, and I was like, oh, fuck me, not on a kind of post like this. So it's like I knew about like the editing feature that was only on like that Twitter Blue thing. So I dropped five dollars on it just to get it, just to edit that fucking tweet. <laughs> How does it feel to give Elon your money? I mean, I'm giving Elon my money no matter what I do, I guess. I mean, because oh. what what does Elon do outside of Twitter? He runs Tesla, right? Uh, Tesla, Starlink, Neuralink, Star. Isn't the that boring that, uh, company? Isn't that that game <laughs> that had like the Star Fox cameos? Uh, yes. But not the same thing. <laughs> no, oh, okay. Starlink's a satellite internet. He acts like company. a tool. That's because this guy's a fucking billionaire. Like the guy probably thinks his normal day is a normal day for everybody. Because I mean, he doesn't. I mean, he doesn't act like a tool. He just is a fucking yeah, I think, tool. Yeah, I think, the, I think the appropriate answer is that he just is a tool. But he's a tool that has a fucking billion dollars more than I will, right? <laughs> exactly, and like that's the sad, depressing thing about it. It's like I, I'm pretty sure he's hurting. I'm hurting his feelings by calling him a tool. All the money in the world and not a single brain cell between them. Mm. Funny how things cosmetically balance out like that sometimes. Yeah, I think it was Emerald Mine specifically, Blue Dino. Yep. So what I meant was, are you going to keep the blue subscription, or are you just going to cancel it? Thank you, Ryan. It's fine. I appreciate it. <laughs> Ends up canceling and charging a bet. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my goddamn electric car, Musk? <laughs> Where, no, where's my self-driving car, Musk? <laughs> that one of those American you promised it five years cars. ago. <laughs> I wouldn't trust. Would you trust a self-driving car? What I fuck? Uh, considering the average American's attention span and intelligence, yeah. So you all right? So you, uh, so we're at a point now where you just trust the general algorithm and AI to take I trust the wheel. The algorithm of RC Pro <laughs> over your average driver. No, because the R, the AI of RC Pro will just suddenly fucking skyrocket <laughs> at three hundred miles per hour with no fucking reason, dude. 
and people don't do that already yeah i know but it's like it's i'm going like, in a but, school but, zone that's 30 miles an hour and they shoot off that's 90. what i'm saying dude the yellow car will do that in a school zone on a monday <laughs> morning <laughs> <laughs> and you want to leave wish. that to the ai come on no <laughs> ais are yellow cars Look, I don't trust AI to do something as simple as much as a three-point turn, let alone the average human being. <laughs> My god, if you got jug handles. <laughs> you might as well just start saying your prayers now. So, uh, now as... To chew five <laughs> yeah, no, like, I was waiting for the, like, the Mario back backwards long jump noise afterwards. But, uh, oh. so guys, just a heads up. Uh, if you guys hear any sort of sporadic laughing or yelling or something thing from behind the scenes, that's Nora because right now it's D&D. &D. And apparently something big is going down tonight when D&D &D on her thing. I don't know about it because I don't really ask for updates on the uh, the campaign and other <laughs> shit like that. But I know she is enjoying the fuck out of herself. So uh, that's good. That's good. I'm going to attempt to enjoy myself too with more Metroid Dread Hard Mode 100%. Because uh, we haven't done this in a couple of weeks. Almost to a month I want to say. Because uh, I've been kind of busy. During busy this month. Understatement. Yeah, I've, and I've, still going to be busy. Yeah, I was like, I'm not even done. <laughs> you know, I have a bit of, I have a bit of a brief, because you know I got nothing major happening this weekend besides this stream, obviously, and just winding down. But I'm still working on the DK64 video, which I can tell right now, uh, without doing any of the major edits, it's already looking to be like 47, 48 minutes long. Uh, and yeah, it's pretty chunky. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty, huh? lank, pretty lanky, you could say. Not tiny. Algorithm food. Yeah. Uh, and I, I really hope you guys enjoy this one because I, I, I'm enjoying the editing process and I think you guys are going to love some bits that I got uh, planned for. It. But, you know, I got I, I got to get this video done before the for next weekend's charity event, which, by the way, that's happening uh, this time. Well, not this time, but like eight hours from this time next saturday november 5th is the beginning of our next 24-hour charity event it's crash team raising we're playing crash bandicoot games for 24 hours 25 hours because daylight savings time always ends in the middle of this fucking event and yeah that is that is next saturday into sunday and uh the, i guess the benefit of uh, uh, this year is that we're not meeting up in the studio everyone's just doing digitally on disco which means uh once i'm done i can just fucking nap on my bed for a couple of hours yeah. and i can come back whenever the hell i want and the benefit of this year is that hopefully no one DDoSes the charity. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I thought that was last year, wasn't no, it? No, no, that was during Donkey Kong. No. It was, yeah, it was during Donkey Kong Online. And you know what? Like, it's only happened then, but since then, Still. I'm now always, like, paranoid <laughs> that something's gonna happen. Exactly. Like, who fucking DDoSes a charity site? Like during the big charity day, like who fucking hey, yo, that, fuck man? this guy, yeah, no, fuck these people, dude. It wasn't me, it was like everyone else running extra life on that thing. Man, Tupac really did say, <laughs> fuck them kids. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'd be reviewing, and well, well, I'll be doing a review of Gotham Knights, man. I can't even do it eventually for that one because I'm not even really interested in Gotham Knights. If I'm being it real. looks so boring, uh, Malicious Edge, that was like, yeah, it's Malicious Edge 52. I'm not really interested in uh, Gotham Knights. Uh, remember the biggest thing for the uh, one. Can't believe how long it's been. Can't wait to see Kick Raven beats ass. Speaking of, if you happen to get to him tonight, John, might I request that you do all this dialogue in your glorious Christopher Walken? Oh god, no, I'm not doing that fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got time for that. <laughs> so it's been a while since we played the game, and I have to. I got to refresh. Okay, we at least went into a new area, so this shouldn't take too long to catch up on what I need to do. It looks like we need to go right. Gotham mids. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, game man, Bayo three thoughts. I didn't play. I didn't pick it up yet. I'm not gonna have time to play it uh, in the next couple of weeks because I'm editing the DK64 video, right? Uh, and that's gonna take a couple more days. And then after that, I got the charity event, right? And then like two days after the charity event ends, Sonic Frontiers comes out. And you're out of your rabbit ass mind if you think I'm playing Bayonetta three before Sonic Frontiers. <laughs> uh, not that I'm saying that you're assuming that, but still, like Sonic Frontiers, when that when that comes out day one, I'm playing that day one, and I have to I have to get that video ready because uh, I'm I'm I'll be out of town for Thanksgiving uh, for a week, and while I can still get work done during that, I'd rather not. So I got to make sure that video, all the assets for that video, are good before I leave. Whoa! What the fuck? You, you see that sound delay? One second. Listen, 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 listen. 
That, that beam sound comes out like a whole half second after I shoot the damn thing. What the fuck? I, gotta I need to I gotta start refresh. your old Yeah, I gotta refresh the card. Give me a second. This is probably gonna freeze everything on the, the board, but that's funny. Uh, I mean, you could always just play Frontiers on your Steam Deck. Yeah, yeah, but I uh I I don't I'd have I don't it. have the dock yet. Oh, fair. I mean, you if it just has buy a, a dock. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. I'm that's pretty what I mean. sure yeah, that the no, game I'm will not, have. I'm not um... buying the official dock. No, uh, I, I know like any. I know <laughs> like any other dock. Yeah, I'm not buying. I'm like, sure that the game will like... have uh, cloud saves. You could probably just play it on your PC and then load it up on your dock or er, deck. That's what I'm doing with a lot of games. Games that don't support cloud saves in this day and age are just weird. Murder. Nintendo, I'm looking at you. <laughs> it's still a bit of a delay. I don't understand that. Why is it doing that? Why is it giving me a little delay? What the fuck is that about? It's just slight, but it's enough to bother me. Is it a delay for you or a delay it's for It's an them? audio delay, yeah. Like, I can hear it. It's like, it's not, yeah, it's not a terrible, terrible delay, but it's just enough to get under my skin. Like it's just half of a second. Hey, like not even it. half a second. It's like maybe like a few milliseconds. Hey, Fonz, so how about that 4chan hentai? Oh, dude. Huh? Oh, God. <laughs> what? Excuse me. <laughs> Look, the, the only good thing about Katawa Shoujo was the Castlevania fan game. <laughs> and, and no, he doesn't go into the fan game. Damn. There we go. Uh, what is your opinion on the slight change of Roger Craig's Masonic voice? If you've already talked about it, I haven't seen it. No, I don't really go into it in the Frontiers video I posted, and I don't think I'm really going to go into it for tonight because I still want to respect the guidelines um, and uh, the fact that I can't talk about the story. I still don't want to do that because uh, some people. Well, no, I can. Nice for that. I can I'll discuss do it for it you. For you. Uh, <laughs> fuck the pain away. My bed is in ruins. <laughs> Oh, you're talking about the song. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, so, I'm pretty sure, like, like that's the end of No Not November, right? <laughs> like... Because I'm just saying it makes sense. Uh, to go briefly into that, yeah, it was the first thing I noticed when I was playing the game. I was like, why is his voice so deep? Uh, from what I understand, it was a deliberate decision on the director of the game to what end i don't know so all i can to do is him, really all i can do is speculate uh my guess is to make him seem hip with the kids oh, i mean he, he's had fucking like 30 years to do that maybe uh, puberty, it's maybe been 30 puberty's, years yeah maybe puberty's finally decided to drop it took long enough yeah oops wait there we go <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting mixed signals here, Roger. <laughs> Sonic's balls finally dropped, and now he can uh, continue the Redfield bloodline. Yeah. Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that Sonic? Uh oh. <laughs> oh, that's what everything's covered in X Parasites now, so everything's like way more fucking aggressive. Dude, so I gotta, I gotta you know what it reminds it. me of? What's that? You kiss one human as a corpse. <laughs> Hold on, wait, no, I didn't kiss anybody. She kissed me. <laughs> Why should this now we just need Sonic punching a rock. Why? I mean, don't you technically have that already with Smash Bros? Roger. No, no, we're talking about the the rock. I don't think Sonic can take on Black Adam. What no, but he can't. He can't take on The Rock in next year's WrestleMania. <laughs> <laughs> oh, go away! Uh, uh, we're dealing with uh, the blue one. Oh. What does does the blue one freeze you? Uh, yes. Uh, yeah. The blue one freezes you. This is purple though. This one has the wave oh, beam. Okay. Yeah, this one uh, can see you through walls. Oh, that is yeah, no, that's probably why. the most obnoxious one for me. Yeah, that's yeah. why you can see like hexagons everywhere on the background. 
Captain Falcon yeah. hit Sonic with people's elbows. On the upside, at least while it's underwater, the counter is a lot more forgiving. It's a little more forgiving, yeah. Because it's a little slower. Yeah. You get like yeah. three extra. We have to frames. do it with drunk glasses. <laughs> yeah, I know, which doesn't sound so good. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're the guy that blows up, aren't you? One second. Y'all ever do that before? What? <laughs> the uh, the the DUI glasses. Oh. Oh, no, where you I, like I just... pinch your pinch your fingers together and look through them? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, pinch your fingers together and look through. Yeah, if you make a really it. tiny hole with your fingers. Are you sure you're just not trying to get me? No, no, I was serious. <laughs> it's like I don't know how to explain it without just showing you. <laughs> what? So you like make tiny like like this? I imagine what it is is you need to cross your fingers just right to make a tiny pinprick sized hole. Can you? Yeah, that, can that you, that's basically. Can it. you post like, a picture? Okay. Uh, um. But, uh... take, so, so, right, I'll tell you so what. I've got it right now. Take your thumb and rest it on your the next two fingers. So that is the index, index and, and the middle. middle finger. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then just like sort of form a tiny triangle with them. Right. And if you get it just right, you'll get a nice little perfect yeah, like circle. Super tiny. We're talking like a millimeter opening. Okay. Yeah. And then if the you no look budget. through that, if you like hold it up to your face and look through it without glasses, you could see fine. Yeah. That's like that's the no budget version. But uh yeah. Think of it as like a little cheat sheet slash reading glass. Okay, with so budget. the way you so so the way you do this is uh <laughs> yeah, the same way, and then you just chuck like five Jaegermeisters in a row. This is supposed to be like glasses? It's supposed yeah, think... to work if you do it right. I mean I can I mean, see my I'm not vision. making this up. This is a real thing. I could sort of see my vision trying to correct itself, but I look like a fucking asshole. What do you but mean? Now... This is how I did my driver's test. <laughs> Known about this for years. It Speaking can of, help. Can anybody pick me up from the hospital? <laughs> <laughs> Gang signs. <laughs> <laughs> but no, that's like the the low budget, no budget version. They actually do have glasses that just fuck your vision up entirely. Yeah, DUI that glasses. Sound right. Yeah, it's like uh, what you wear in uh, Duff Gardens. Can you get oh, out we have of to do place? that. Thank you. At the start of driver's ed, so we can see what it's like, you know, without being behind the wheel of why you don't drive intoxicated. Remember, so folks, don't thing. drink, don't drink and drive, or do. I can't really stop you. <laughs> see, it's about like something like that. They put those um, drops in your eyes that expand your pupils to stupidly big sizes. Oh yeah. It is not fun when it pains to so much as blink. <laughs> Speaking of pain... Yeah, Fonz, whenever he said that, all I could think of was just the Alucard voice with the, uh, the bonus disc. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck! Oh, it's a little mind thing. Oh. Zap. Eh, fuck out of here. Now, John, since you've been getting the parry really well, I need to try Evil Woman 37 after this. <laughs> 37? <laughs> what happened to the previous 36? Don't worry about it. Yeah. Why has it happened to this man this many times? <laughs> Please let me rest. <laughs> no, just, just the one must learn that he must be parried I just want to play the game. <laughs> I see you! <laughs> Zap! Zap. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, can you leave from that area? Why is he hanging out there? Uh, channeling a bit of um, Cam Clark's Dr. Mobius from Fallout New Vegas there for a sec. Uh, Fallout's cool. Excited to fight new, uh, Luke Perry in uh, Fallout New Vegas? Uh, I don't know. I'm still playing too. Oh god, I'm okay. almost to this guy. Um, shit. All right, I gotta charge a shine spark. I hate this guy. This is probably the boss that I dread the most. Oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you can't take it back, man. You already said it. Man, this is really a boss, huh? Oh uh, yeah. Actually. No, I think it's just <laughs> He said it. He said the thing. Yeah, this boss is, this boss is not good. I actually don't like Wait, this boss. Which? 
Uh, the it's the it's the insect boss. Lightning <sighs> bug. Yeah. Lightning oh, bug. Oh, yeah. It's annoying. Well, I'm sure I'll remember it when I say it. Yeah. Um. So we're going to. Well, first we're gonna kill this door. The fuck is it? All right. Fuck this door. Yeah. Fuck this door. <laughs> door kill my family. The baby. All right. Then we gotta. No, no, don't do that. Well, I guess the the insect boss could be worse. Okay, I think they count it. Oh, it's this fucking thing. Nice. First the insect try. boss could be immune to um power bombs. <laughs> Fuck. Now I remember. I'm getting secondhand uh jibbles. Oh, you know, like, kidding. when you're in a tense moment in a video game and you kind of, like, convulse your body a bit? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm getting, like, secondhand whatever that is. Dude, look, look how much fucking damage pattern. he does. Just he does a lot of damage, shit. but the pattern is easy. It's just, it takes so long. It's so punishing. Do, like, yeah. two, two hits. Uh, I should be stressed, cycle. this is also, we're playing in hard mode, so he's doing double the damage. Uh, so, But even, like, in normal mode, this guy is not fun. I hate this guy. Uh, mm. And what we're doing is that we're doing a shine spark so that we can do a lot of damage in the beginning of the fight. Uh, the timing on that's pretty tight, though. Uh, so it's like, it's, like as soon as he like, as soon as he starts to rest inside the arena, that's when you want to let go of the shine spark because once he goes electrical, he's invulnerable. Yep, you have a very short window. God, that <laughs> show, show is show is fast, man. Holy fuck! You just have a very short window to do any attack, and yeah. that's yeah. what I don't like about it. Cause like the the actual pattern is easy enough. You just have to keep moving, but you get so little. And you shred like, you shred him down to like a quarter of health with the shine spark, and it yeah. still feels like it takes too long. Yeah. They gave you more opportunities to do damage. This yeah, boss flash shift does be... make this boss a bit easier, but yeah, still, it's very punishing. Like you get hurt just twice or three times. You saw my health is absolutely just fucking gone. I miss Trev up. acting like he was shot in the ass. Oh, sorry. Hold on. <laughs> I'm killing you. <laughs> we do get a storm missile, though. They finally got the secret missile, right? I got Silk only War. 25 years? Tw no, I'm fucking 20 years. <laughs> Close to it. Uh, well, like 19, because Prime, Prime 2 came out in uh, 2004. Yep. Yep. Uh, November 15th. Yeah. I remember that. I got that. I got the day it came out, and uh, I was enjoying myself. For you've unlocked some foaming torpedo. I found I a copy at GameStop, and it had the reflective, like holographic shit on the box. Oh, cool! Like that's a real release. Like yeah, yeah. I'm not sure how limited that was, but it made me happy. I think that was just more. That was just the first release. Yeah, yeah it was. Release. If I recall, it was also a GameStop exclusive for the beginning. Prime Two what Echo Call. Really? Oh, no, not Prime 2. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I thought you were talking about the Prime Trilogy. Mm -mm. Oh, uh, uh, Prime uh, Trilogy, yes, I think it was GameStop exclusive. My sister got one of those. I, I, I got Oscar's that. Too. I got that week one because I was like, this is going to be hard to get. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's weird because the, the original print isn't as expensive as the second print for some reason. The really? second like. print, really? Yeah, the second print is just the regular. Oh, no, wait. Now yeah, they're both going around 150 for some reason. Oh, never mind. <laughs> We got ours uh, used, but the disc was see. basically brand new. However, Metroid Prime 2 was a bit of a controversial release at the time in Howland. Not for anything in the game itself, but what the game defaults to and doesn't offer an option for. It was one of the very few GameCube games that was 60Hz only. Hey, come back! And, uh, I want you inside because, uh, me. Because not everyone had a 60 hertz TV by then, I know, shocking. <coughs> so I think it was that, the Ocarina of Time pre-bonus disc, and I want to say maybe Zelda Collector's Edition with the 60 hertz only ones. I'm not sure about that last one. But now that we've got storm missiles, where uh, the... we still need we to get a gravity suit. 
uh, screw attack. And we need to bombs, use it power to... Bombs, yeah. Power bombs is a cutscene power, so... You somehow have able to play this game without getting power bombs. I'm actually more impressed than I am confused. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and yeah, and cross bombs. I keep forgetting that's a thing in this game. Right. We you have only to use take it, like, it to three the plant. times. You gotta take it to the plant sector. And then, um... Not, the storm missiles the don't make these guys missiles. an absolute fucking joke, though. I love it. Yeah. Which is great, because I can't stun these guys. Yeah. Especially when you got two of them. And zip the ass motherfuckers. I can't remember. Bird is, looking it the, is it the gold also, ones that have more rip health? If you're colorblind. Yeah, the gold ones have more health. I think golds have more. I think it's operating on the. Um, Are you colorblind, Jason? I'm sorry. The Metroid does. All I said is rip if you're colorblind. I'm sorry, colorblind. <laughs> Which attack are they doing? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is it to the be one fair, I can parry or is it the one that hurts. <laughs> uh, we need to go. Uh, I want to say red, green, color blind is the most common. So I think those folks have an easier time telling red from blue. I think it goes green, red, and blue is the rarest. Yeah. I think blue's like oh, wait, single shit. digits percent in color blindness. Oh, did I not get space jump yet? Or do I just have spin boost? You just have spin boost. You're oh. gonna get space jump soon. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think you. Oh, you might already have it, actually. No, no, actually, I think you I should just only have spin boost. Oh yeah, yeah, you're about to get okay, it. Okay, okay, I was right. Because I'm like, wait, hold on, I remember space jumping. That's when I like when corridor. I was when I was uh, running away from the purple enemy. You guys might know. It's like, why is he trying to skip across the water? He doesn't have space jump yet. I was like, oh, because I thought I had space jump. Yeah, I, I abused the fuck out of storm missiles in my first playthrough. It was yeah. like everything I saw, I made sure to exhaust all of my missiles before I used beams on them. <laughs> but yeah, before I can get the chance to move. Yeah, yeah just bro. don't let it move. <laughs> yeah. Bro, was it was more it was just, oh, okay, this is the main boss tool now. Sweet. How it feels to chew five gum. <laughs> <laughs> also, it's so nice to use against uh, Raven Beak on a stupid black hole move. Yeah. Well, like actually, uh, no, just his black hole move, uh, you could take out faster with just normal missiles. I know there's one of his moves you can kibosh really early if you're fast enough to drop a power bomb. Yep, the sun it's attack. the sun. Yeah. yeah, sun one. I'm not sure if it has an official name. I just call it the sun attack. It's a fucking sun. Yeah, it's just the sun. <laughs> I mean, but, Thanos threw the moon at Iron Man. This guy shoots a sun. What is it? Old sun, new sun, liquid sun, solid sun. I mean, I guess Sephiroth has a. There's a missile. The... Oh no, we got that missile. Okay. Whatever the fuck that is. move safer Sephiroth does. I was gonna uh, say Supernova. the fucking uh, yeah, that's the, it. The sun stand from part three. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Useless thing. Oh fuck! I hate that man. Yeah, right. Laughs sounds, hysterically. It sounds like a B a name. Look, I don't like the sun. Son of a bitch. I'm pale as shit, I burn. Lucid, spamming plasma beam is more than satisfactory. Uh, spamming plasma beam doesn't hurt my thumb as much as using storm missiles, though. Sometimes yeah. it's not a matter of... It's not, it's not a, a matter of efficiency. Uh, it's just what feels comfortable. Ooh, the fog finally cleared up in my area. It actually looks nice outside. Oh, can you actually see the coastline, though? Yeah, no, I actually can see the waves and rocks that are right in front of me. Waves and rocks. Waves and rocks. What's that? Oh, right, yeah, we time travel in about 50 minutes. That's gonna be fun. Excuse me? Our clocks go back in 50 minutes. Oh, God. Well, our clocks go back next week. Fuck. Wait, are mm -hmm. we getting time or losing time? Uh, losing time. Losing. Fuck! Uh, why no, do no, we need no, daylight no, 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 no. I'm sorry, getting time, getting time, because we'll go back an hour. We go back. Okay. Woohoo! Oh, All right, cool. Daylight savings is okay for now. No. Fuck. I gotta go back. How do I go back? So, I guess uh, that's 25 hours stream. No. <laughs> What'd you miss? Uh, the missile expansion missile. right there. Yeah. Now I gotta go back. I think I I'm heading think back this way anyway. Uh, so yeah. it's not the end of the you, world. You so. come back through this portal. Yeah, yeah. Apparently you need cross bombs for them. No, you can just, you can spider ball up that ceiling. Oh, yeah, I didn't think of that. Yeah. Wait, there's no spider ball. No, you can roll into it. Shut up. Yeah. That, you gotta think not... fifth dimensionally. I'm bad at chess. <laughs> John, if wait, you were ain't this game is too, wait, this game is 2.5D. What the hell? 
If you just were thinking of five dimensions, you would have just fallen through the map already. I'm three parallel dimensions ahead of you. <laughs> Watch out, don't lose. If you die, you get sent to the next dimension. Oh, are you going to do the speed booster funny? Uh, what speed booster funny? What do you want me to do? Uh, the, the shortcut uh, to the right of the teleporter. Oh, wait. What, you mean here? What, is there a speed booster panel here? Um... Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, this oh, is a this oh, is a shortcut oh, to early grab oh, your suit. Oh. Oh. Oh, I know what this, this is. Yeah, I know what this is. Oh god. This is like the most obnoxious speed boost chain in the game, I think, if I remember correctly. Yep. But if you can get more. it right, it's really fast. Yeah. Yeah, I know it probably ain't that bad, it's just that, you know, when I when I think something's no, bad, it's, it's often annoying. think, yeah. <laughs> Wait, where the fuck That's is it? it? I'm drinking water. Hold on. Am I high? Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Or was it just that thing? You grab onto the ledge oh, right um, in that little area and speed boost. Because uh, there's this really tiny area that you don't think that you have enough space to speed boost through, but you can. Jesus. Oh, I gotta start here, don't I? Uh. You got it. No, no, no. Oh, wait, fuck. Oh, shit. So, wait, I gotta go down here. And then I gotta go down here. Wait, it's not here already, is it? Oh, fuck me. Oh, no. <laughs> <Don't> <laughs> really. Oh, bad. Now okay. you remember? Yeah, yeah. Hold on. One second, one second, one second, one second. One second. I, gotta, I gotta start. Why am I doing this? <laughs> Everything hurts. Every it's <laughs> fun. Everything's gonna hurt. <laughs> Everybody hurts. Figuring this out on my own felt pretty satisfying. I don't wish that pain on anyone else. Uh, I was hitting both of the shoot and jump button there. It didn't go off. So oh, congrats. Uh, I think, oh, I'm proud of you, man. You're holding a direction. <laughs> uh, no, I, I wasn't. Uh, I was letting go of the analog stick. Fuck me, dude. You weren't. <laughs> no, you weren't. No. <laughs> uh, actually. <laughs> God. Oh my god, hold on. Let me get a let me get an idea. <laughs> okay, so I slide under there. I uh start, start here and this is where the speed bus is, right? Okay, 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 okay. We got this. 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 Yeah. We just gamers. don't forget the store. We got, we, got the, we got this. We got this. The last slope. We got this. We got this. Oh, it's zero emissions level we of got obnoxious. This. We got this. Joy. Ah, zero mission is worse because the timing is yeah. even Yeah, fucking three frame window yeah, on one of them. This is a Ridley. really forgiving shine spark. I know exactly which one that is. Fuck that one. What do I fucking. Uh, Jason, I'm not holding down direction on the analog stick. You're full of shit, dude. Well, that time you just. Yeah. Jumped it's just. Too low. Yeah, no, no. There's like a. Uh, I'll, I'll fucking mash the button, dude. We, we got this. We got this. We got this. Fuck, no, we got you did a short fuck, hop. The fucking, to, the fucking door closed on me. <laughs> now, what do I do? <laughs> yeah, you gotta do it as you're following. Make sure you use the half A press to do the half we jump. This. We got this. They call me half A press. Cause... Yeah, uh, this time, actually do a full hop, not a short hop. <laughs> we got this. We got this. Oh, no. Okay, we got this. We got this. We got this. Oh, oh. We gamers. Oh, we gamers. There you go. We are gamers. Easy. Bump, ba dump, bump, 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 bump. Wait, we are gamers. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 <laughs> All right, I'm messaging Silva Gunner right now. <laughs> See, John, it was easy. No, 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 it wasn't. <laughs> it was painful. Never doing that again. Anyway, I'll see you. Next <laughs> I hate it. Yeah. Anyway, see you guys next week. Oh Thank wait, you. did you wait, 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 wait? Did you, you get the Did you get the uh, missile tank at the end? Yeah. Oh shit, yeah, you're supposed ahead. to break another bomb <laughs> or break another wall at the end of that. Oh wait, hold on. Well now you tell us. Sorry, I thought he knew. Oh, okay. That's no that's cool. That, 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 that's what's right here. You did it once, you can do it again. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna backseat. Gamers. 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 See, I'm allowed Gamers. to backseat because I have a Gamers. license. Gamers. I don't know what kind of license. Gamers. Where am I going? Where am I going? Is it here? No, right. it's not here. Where's it you, going? You don't need Shine Spark once you get to the end of it. Oh, okay. Uh, it's just a breakable, uh, what the fuck? Breakable Hold on a block. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> what the fuck?
What? One second, one second, one second, one second. Oh, no, fuck. I have to unload the thing. I was going to say, it's like, normally the game is pretty good with hiding, like, the obvious fake block, but the, 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 the black and foreground of this fake block clips a little far from the wall, so it just looks yeah. like a black square. And it kind of just took me out of there for a second. I'm forklift certified. <laughs> wow, there's something that just cracks me up about forklift certification, and I can't put a finger on it. I think it's just the word forklift certification. Yeah, maybe. Oh, wait, I got a space jump up there. Wait, did we do the sequence break just now? Wait. But well, we went a, a different bit. way. I don't think I know. I don't want to call it a sequence break because we have to get the gravity suit. It's more of a shortcut. Yeah, more of a shortcut. Oh, it's a shortcut. Oh, see, I thought it was the normal way. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> There's a harder way? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I mean, most people would say that this is the harder way. Yeah, yeah. No, that's what I mean. It was like, I like, remember on a regular say, oh, there was, a, there was there's a more difficult way. Oh. <laughs> uh... Oh, it was more. Oh, there was another intended route, so I must have taken uh, the uh, short version by accident on our explosion one. beam. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, it's been a while. Just drawing a blank. All right, hold on. I think I caused some collateral I mean, damage. That's funny, Trav. But also, you have shit like. Check this shit. <laughs> I love that video. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> That's the demon core. Demon core. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if there's any game where Samus can swim. Smash. Smash. Mm -hmm. Closest oh, she's okay. got. Yeah, no, she's not even swimming, it's treading water. Closest she. <laughs> uh, closest to that is Prime 2, I think, but it's more like jet thrusters. I love the jet thrusters, though. Yeah, they're cool. The gravity feels like a real too. Yeah, basically a third jump, but it's like a third jump that's like go so high up. Also, you get the gravity suit after you're almost done with all the water sequences. I mean, is that ever? I mean, the only the only time that's I ever every think, game. I, no, the only time I ever think they've done that right was Super Metroid. Yeah, uh, because you get gravity suit where you have to do all of Meridia. It's like they give it to you just so that you can backtrack out of the water section without it being a pain. Yeah. I show this one guy who actually managed to get through the wreck ship on his first playthrough backwards. Nice. Uh, no, Blue Down is also right. Uh, Prime is also pretty good about it, too. That's true. That's true. Because somehow he managed to get through bloody Meridia's underwater section and take the shortcut lift to the back take end the of the jump. wreck ship. Take the shot. <laughs> Almost that time where I can play my favorite video of Mariah Carey's, uh... <laughs> I don't want a lot. I just like the idea of Mariah Carey thawing. <laughs> and it's a threat. <laughs> Wait, have you seen the animation where she's, like, an atom bomb? No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what the fuck? Give me a sec. Can you, can you share that on Twitch? Yeah, no, okay. I can do okay. On Twitch. Oh, oh, I thought you were meaning, like, would it break TOS on Twitch? Mm -mm. Uh, where's, where's our chat? Boy? That is hey, a chat. Hey, fucker. There we go. Oh, wait, oh, it's it's all the Christmas miracle. Christmas. I'll post it on Twitch I chat. I really want a lot Christmas. <laughs> All I ever want for Christmas is blue. Was, was, was to live. We should create an SCP document for Mariah Carey. <laughs> Give it another hundred like years it. after the nuclear fallout. Plus, War yes. never changes. Okay, I did post the video in the, in the right chat. There you go. All I want for Christmas is a bottle of Jack and another bottle of Jack. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> all right, this place is frozen. It's over. two things every year that absolutely pisses off. So I want to, I want to, I want to, I want to follow up on something someone in the chat said. 
uh, because okay. they got stuck here. They got they got stuck in a room that I was in earlier because they forgot that the invisibility thing was a, a maneuver you can do. I got stuck here for an embarrassingly long time in one particular area, and I want to see if you guys know what area I'm talking about. Because uh, maybe maybe you guys also struggle with it too. Oh shit! Mm. Uh, what were you saying, Jason? Uh, all I was gonna say. Well, one thing is. Uh, the items you can get in this area, I yeah. kind of got ahead of time. While Samus is like, I'm dying! <laughs> <laughs> right, because you're freezing to death, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can get a couple items ahead of time if you have enough health. <laughs> you can't and can abuse um, the X parasite absorption of like doing it from afar. Like mid rooms, because you can carry them between rooms. Um, but no, all I was gonna say is that it's either Mariah Carey that gets everyone pissed off, or it's you know, Fate Stay Night that gets everyone pissed off. Why Fate Stay Night? There we go. Oh, okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. I heard this before. I've heard this before. Yeah, that. Hi, Hatsune Miku. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> It's just uh, fate, uh, fate fans being unbearable. Yeah, pretty much. That that being said, I will the happily change my. Uh, oh, duh. Hmm. All right. You know history, right? I'm out of right? the loop here. Wait, what? You know what? You know history, right? Holy Your history. Uh, Fuck. The concept of history, yeah. No, just like important people in history, like Leonardo da Vinci, all those people. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Now imagine them like anime girls and fuckable. Ah! <laughs> How much damage did that jet stream attack did? Like, God All damn, right. was that like five or six fucking tanks? Uh, let me post it in the uh, the Discord chat, and I guess I'll post it in the uh, the sub Discord chat. Oh fuck! But I'm still gonna change the uh, the sub Discord again later this year. Oh no! <laughs> what to Mariah Carey? I don't <laughs> no. Uh. The. Remember, I commissioned a Pataru Pataru version of you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hell yeah. No, that's too much effort. It doesn't look generic, though. <laughs> Damn. It needs to look generic as hell to be an actual Pataru. I blame Shade for putting in work. Wait a minute. Hold <laughs> on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. How Hold dare Shade do minute, work? Why do they give you this area? Is there somewhere I can spy a shine sparker? Yo, shout out to Shade. She's talented. Yeah, Shade's cool. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I was just threatened at right? gunpoint. Was I not supposed to say that? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> um. Hold on, they gave you that grapple beam room. Why the hell did they give you that that much real estate? Is it for a speed boost? Oh, wait a minute. There is a speed boost part here, if I remember correctly. But I don't know if I, I can do it now, or do I have to wait until I thaw this area? Ooh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is that a fucking horse in, like, inhaling helium? What the shit was that's, that? That's how it feels like when I stub my toe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here it is. Uh, fuck. Uh, oh, I'm think... gonna pre. Yeah, there we go. Hold on. Do it again. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> no, no, no. I was looking for the speed booster, dude. Yeah. I was also doing some foreplay. <laughs> Oh, okay, we did it. We gaming. No, we're not gaming. Fuck. <laughs> gaming denied. No, 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 no. We're, we're still gaming. We're gaming. We're gaming. We're gaming. Hurry, Thomas Edison. Oh no. Ah! Okay. What's up good. with fur? What's what's up with furry Thomas Edison? I don't play Fate. I just know about it because I have roommates that play things. Wait, it's a game? Sadly, yes. Ah! Uh, it's, it's a, a VM as well. Yeah, it's First a game, and anime, <laughs> uh, a gotcha, fighting game, erotic roleplay, everything that you want it to be. Oh, of course. First and foremost, it was a VM, though. 
and then it kind of snowballed. Yeah, fate is a lot of things. Yes, yes, it is. Have we got those spot? No. I don't want to talk to you, Adam. <laughs> Damn, okay. Well, it's a good thing I'm Raven Beak. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you made me say it. I think the best thing that fate's given up is the quote, people die when they are killed. Yeah. <laughs> that is a good quote. Oh, and... I guess kind of getting on a different topic here. It's kind of crazy that I think this Dungeons and Dragons movie that's coming out is going to bomb hard. Like the Warcraft movie? Well, wait, wasn't yes, there? exactly Come like on. the Warcraft movie. And it's like, wasn't there such... already a Dungeons and Dragons movie? Yeah, like forever ago. It had like, like um, I think it was Marlon Wayans. Ever. And uh, this guy. Jeffrey Irons. It was from like 2000. Yeah. Jeffrey Irons, really? Yeah. Uh, yes, it did have Jeremy Irons in it. At the cast. Uh, Jeremy Irons. Uh, somehow I knew what he oh, meant. I said Jeremy Irons. Yeah, yeah. We almost had a fucking another Tom Brady moment again. Tom Brady. <laughs> I mean, I he just said, I, did, line I, I, I made Tom Brady, Tom Hardy, for fuck's sake. I did it again. I did it twice <laughs> with two different Tom people. Holland. Bum, ba da bum, 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 bum. <laughs> B17 Baumer. Baumer. Tom uh, Holland's <laughs> off lane 14 I, and now is into insurance. I don't. Mm. Wrong one. Ah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. I never actually put it on my Steam Deck. I just click on it on the side. Okay, your so, Steam Deck? <laughs> believe it or not. Uh, Stream Deck, fuck. Believe it or not, believe this was not. the room I got stuck in for the longest time because I saw the missile pack and I never got the fucking idea to bomb this area right here. And I was stuck here for like 20 minutes going back and forth, wondering why the hell is nothing working. If only I had the X ray scope. I mean, you got the pulse, but it's also you got like the touch. I didn't even think about using that either. You do not want a 14 live action adaption. That <laughs> the ad was proof enough of that. Yep. Uh, outside of Sonic, my faith in any sort of video game related adaptation has been absolutely murdered throughout the years. And even if it was animated, I fear that'll be like the Dragon Quest movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! I mean, I, 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 did, I didn't even I didn't watch that even after playing Dragon Quest Five for myself. I mean, the Dow the uh, the Dragon Quest anime is pretty all right. Have you seen the movie though? Yeah. John? I don't like to talk. No, I've not. Not at all. Okay. Um, you need to see the movie. <laughs> okay. Damn. Just set aside a little bit of time while something's rendering, and it, it's something. <laughs> no, see, I can't watch something while something's rendering because I'm going to be constantly eyeing the render and making sure it didn't go through an error. Yeah, same. <laughs> Dude, that's how I spent, like, all day uh, a couple days ago. Uh, turns out this uh, plugin I was using really hates GPU encoding, hmm. and I could not figure out for the life of me what yeah, was going on. It's apparently a bug. Are you, are you I'm assuming you're using Premiere? Yep. Yeah, it's a Premiere one. You when you use an H two six four codec with GPU rendering, it, it it's very likely yeah. it'll cause an error. So you have to do software rendering, which takes like twice uh, as long. Unless you have an Intel CPU in which you can use QuickSync. Yeah. Um, well, the reason the Ace Attorney movie was actually really good is because actually done by the Japanese. Uh, you say that, but uh, I, I have recall, not heard good things I about recall it. Elliot showing me a Dead Rising movie. This was like 15 oh, fucking I know years that ago. one. Yeah, and yeah, it wasn't, that wasn't was good. A... No, it was shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to be fair, Dead Rising was never good after two. Damn. I know um, Vegas has a similar encoding issue in this pop. I want to say version 14. One of the um, MP4 encoders has a bug in it that just crashes on render unless you disable it. Did you have you heard the fucking theme song for Dead Rising? Chop to your drop. No. What? Hold um, on. Those aren't words. <laughs> yeah, they are, sadly. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm getting ready to fight this guy. Blue man. Wait, no. Is no. this copyrighted? Yeah, this is Big Man. Does not seem to be copyrighted. Alright. Big Man. There we go. 
Big oh, no. man in a suit of armor. My coworkers are asking me to stay. How about no? Yeah, just say no. <laughs> don't even answer. Leave my read. See ya. No, don't even look at it. Because if you'd be seen on scene, they're going to at least know you looked at it. And I was like, why are you fucking answering? Uh, luckily, there's no read receipt. Okay, thank the, God. Uh, I want chat. you to know that I saw it and yeah. said no. And I deliberately ignored you. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, yeah. There's like meetings. I will. They will send the meeting in an email with like a read receipt on it and a, uh, uh, like an accept thing. And I will actively deny it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the Dead Rising Wii game was just Dead Rising 1 running on Resident Evil 4 engine. Just right. very neutered. I still have not oh, played one. and beaten any of Dead Rising games. I've only played the first one to some Same. extent. I didn't really, I didn't even get very far. Love of God, uh, never play himself. That was one of the first games I saw on the 360, though. And I remember like being so narrowed by like the graphical leap from like the PlayStation 2 to Xbox 360. Did, did you see it on a CRT or did you see it on a proper HD TV? I saw it on a proper HD TV. Okay, because if you see it on a CRT, you can't read any of the subtitles. Yeah, because the fucking text is so tiny. Yep. <laughs> Don't do it, Dad. All right. Nope. All right. Congrats on getting a roll. Oh, this guy. Right. Love this guy. First time there in a bit. <laughs> oh, we have a a thirty minute meeting tomorrow. Tomorrow, how about I don't and then put in vacation time in the meeting time. Oh <laughs> yeah. Also, what the, uh, is it barfing? Pure energy. Um, blue, not blue. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> so how about that colorblind? <laughs> uh, I'm not colorblind. I'm word blind. Uh, well, I got it now because I mean, duh, I'm an idiot. Where's the money? Give me the money. Where's the money, Lebowski? <laughs> <laughs> I was just watching it a couple weeks ago, too. Hey, I like I know. No. Fucking the I, spreading Donnie's ass believe... still kills me. <laughs> I can't believe the fucking Chainsaw Man intro has all those fucking references, and one of them is the fucking Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when I saw that, I thought it was, like, fan made. I didn't think that was real. <laughs> Are you going to attempt the um, quick kill? Yeah, um, when he does the speed boost thing. Be hit or see if he didn't. I mean, the Chainsaw Man OP has a Whoa, lot of Whoa, holy shit! That does so much damage in hard mode. Yeah, he's hungry. What the fuck? Damn! Lemon. 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 Holy wee. No, it's a switch, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, shut up! <laughs> I was like, "What the fuck are you talking about?" What are you talking about? Man, what is he talking about now? I don't know, Anthem oh, yeah. Hero. I think the worst kind of like waifu turning is the actual horse racing one. The fuck are you guys talking? About? So when you Don't talk about, about horse it. racing, Wait, I'm thinking about one? the funny anime uh, horse races. Uma Musume, the one that's like an idol like horse racing anime. Okay, oh, yeah. based oh, off no, actual horses about, from the Yakuza. What the what? fuck? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I like listen, yeah, no. man. I'm I'm ignorant to this sort of shit. So when I, I hear words and I have to question the words that I'm hearing. Yeah. So Uma Musume ago. is a gotcha done by the same people that done Grand Blue Fantasy. Uh, mm -hmm. It got an anime uh as the japanese tend to do they tend to draw porn of said anime the problem is they those horses were actually owned by the yakuza oh boy oh and the uh the producers was like please don't draw porn <laughs> please don't draw porn of these actual horses <laughs> i keep thinking he's going love. to do his speed booster attack and i um uh, that anticipation is going to be hit Either way, I don't oh, think I'm sorry, for boy. I didn't know that. I didn't know they were from the Yakuza. I only played the Yakuza game. Don't know actual Yakuza. Yo, Yakuza are real. Yeah. Well, Holy the shit, only real Kiryu Yakuza real? is the chicken. <laughs> yeah. I heard they're like dragons. Shut up. Right, they're I'll like I'll a see. dragon. <laughs> what? All right. I'll see <laughs> Why? Wait. Hold on. Why? I wasn't paying attention. What hit me? He oh, did the. Up. He did the laser attack in the center. I didn't even he see a laser. It straight down first. You got hit frame one, bud. Oh! <laughs> Laser go burr. 
<laughs> I didn't even see the laser graphic. Frame one. <laughs> no, because normally I'm I, normally I stay in the center there and I use secret missiles and I, I, I shoot his arms and it's normally just fine. I know like my mentality's gotta change. Uh, John, that's not thing. safe on block. Hey man, can you shut the fuck up, please? <laughs> <laughs> you know, there comes a point where you kind of come off as kind of obnoxious, my dude, and I don't want to. I don't want. You know, I just want to say, it's like, come on, dude, don't be that guy. Don't be that guy. John, it's not safe on block. Um, actually, <laughs> you, you gotta move. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. I. I the video I posted the other day, been doing pretty well. Yeah. But I've been getting so many comments that were just like, "You're playing the game wrong." Um, actually. Yeah. <laughs> you can ride on the rocket. I didn't even review that part of the game. If anyone tells me I that, know. it's just like <laughs> you didn't watch the fucking video. <laughs> I already told one guy, just like you'd know the answer to your question if you watched the video. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, that's a lot of bits. Oh, th oh thank you, Robo. Uh, give me a second. I can't fucking read bits. You don't know oh, if John's point of course goes I, I just like said that impulsively. I didn't mean to put you on the spot. Pancreas. No, dude, I'm streaming. <laughs> <laughs> you so, one thing no, I, I wasn't I, really anticipating was this guy having much more help in hard mode. Yeah, look at that. Hold on a second. Remember, don't go in the center. No, like I like I shifted a bit at that time, but the laser also didn't come out nearly as fast. Gotta keep you on your toes, bud. I don't have toes. Let me walk. <laughs> Banana. <laughs> Hey, you got the speed strap. So I got, um... I got invited to play... Uh... This... Indie arena shooter. Which there's been a lot of, so it's been harder for them to get, like, <laughs> interesting and unique. Like, they're, they're having a harder time standing out. Yeah. And this yeah. one wants you to slide around a ton. And the way that they did that is they gave your character a chainsaw that comes out of his knee. And it's actually pretty fucking awesome. Wait, why does that sound familiar? Uh, it is called Turbo Thanks, Overkill. Oh, it's true. We never do get the the speed the uh, the guy's power up because the X parasite falls into the lava. I mean, but if you look at if you look at the maneuvers the guy was using, it's really nothing that comes to mind. I mean, he has a he yeah. Has what a, would he have? He has a fucking laser attack from the mouth. He has the crescent beams when you're doing the speed booster sequence. Oh, Mega Man X5. And then he just, uh, I think that's about it. So I don't even know what the hell you get. He had the wide beam. Hmm. I mean, but the wide beam. already wide. Yeah, the wide beam. Yeah, uh, I mean, yeah, spa oh my god, uh, no, Spazer. It's Spazer, yeah. Spazer. Uh, Can't say The wide beam and Spazer are pretty much one and the same. Spazer. G17. <laughs> Spazer. <laughs> Spazer. You can shoot the blade beams when you melee counter. Melee counter? Uh, yeah, that would make it like the, the green uh, armor from Samus Returns. Yeah, I, see, I was thinking more of the Master Sword from Zelda. I don't know why. You can only do it at full health. 17 Spazer. I don't want to talk to you. Okay. <laughs> no, not you. I was talking to, I was talking to Adam. My name Adam. Named yeah. Hello, but if I, but if I was Metroid, then who was Adam? <laughs> uh, I can go this way, I think. This is safe room. Oh it's no! Not a safe room, I can tell you that. Yaka, <laughs> <laughs> yaka, yaka. Samus, how does it feel to chew five gum? <laughs> <laughs> I was fucking around with the voice mod myself a couple of days ago with my raid buddies. Any good ones? Any highlights? Uh, nah, just just basic bitch ones. I was actually kind of uh, taken aback by like like the voice mod. I'm assuming we're using the same program, Trav. 
Uh, yeah, voice mod. One has like one is called Bob, or at least Bob yeah. Beta and Alice Beta. Mm -hmm. Bob, do something. Yeah, those ones are interesting because uh, the Beta ones currently are doing real time text to speech. So it's not exactly a voice changer. It's just saying what you're saying through their text to speech. Yeah, I, I guess that makes sense. It's also kind of auto tuned though, because I was testing out both, and like I, I I raised the octaves a bit on some words I was saying, and it got uh, like pretty auto tuney. I love it. Like I was on a rack with like doing like that glue clip. <laughs> glue. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> My favorite is uh, uh the narrator that makes you sound like Morgan Freeman. I almost said Gordon Freeman. Um, <laughs> oh so yeah, you so you just you don't, don't, don't yeah, you don't say anything. Yeah. You don't hear anything. <laughs> <laughs> Auto tune, you say. Uh, Anthem here, it's it's called voice mod. I think it's a one time payment of like twenty bucks. Yeah. But the, you get a lot of options, like and you also get a lot of customization. It goes north. Something happened. Somebody died. Let's go. Murder. <laughs> I'm assuming that's why she's laughing. Thank you for the bits, by the way, Chaos. Just, I just uh, noticed them in the chat. I appreciate it. I'm gonna thank, uh, I'd like to thank some subs uh, my next elevator sequence. Because I got like 30 minutes afterwards. Also, stay hydrated. Mr. Freeman. <laughs> Mr. Freeman. I can't feel my legs. <laughs> 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 should probably put some socks on, my guy. <laughs> I heard your gravity gun can gravify some things. Can you pick me up from the basketball game, please? Amogus. Uh, do you... Yeah, just go up here. You can get this really early, if I remember correctly. With uh, some nifty sequence breaking. I know I can head down there, but I think it's. Uh... No, nah, that's all he was saying. There's no point in going down here now. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep going this way. Uh, we only have a couple of things left to do, though, in the game, I think. Because we got the screw attack, and I think that's the last thing we need before the cross bombs, and then the power bombs. Yeah, and I it's think not, that's, that. that's not terribly long before we get to Ravenbeak. But the problem is that yeah, there's not, not much left to do. There's not much left to do, but we also need to get every item, so we may not. Yeah, if you want to go for a hundred percent, then yeah, I mean, yeah. We still gotta, be here for a while. Yeah, we still got a bit to do. The Raven Beast could be like Grand one of the last things cross. we do. Thankfully, we don't have to. You know, you don't have to do like post game shit. Like at the tail end of it to get everything. You know, it's not like it's not like the walls are blocked by crystals that only a baby metric can eat. Nom, nom. Yeah, once we get power bombs, we're in clean up. But having the screw attack is divine, and it's way better than fucking Samus returns. The only thing I hated about Sanders turns the screw attack is like, it's like you feel like you couldn't kill anything with it. Well, Sanders returns makes you feel like you can't kill anything. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh yeah, we still gotta get the wave beam uh, from Emmy. Right. I feel like we're so decked out in power ups now that you kind of forget that. I don't know your beam still can't go through walls. One thing I love about 100% runs, though, you get so many missiles. And in Dread, that means all the storm missiles. You can just play with reckless abandon. I don't have to worry about practicing for a race. So, wave beams, the purple Emmy. Alright, time to introduce him to the magic of Sunny Day. <laughs> Oh, he's full of that purple shit. <laughs> I see you. So what was the purple stuff? 
I no, always assumed. All right, so like the the obvious go to answer is probably grape juice, right? Grape juice. Yeah. But they label it as purple stuff, so I'm gonna assume it's purple drink, the shit you get from Kool Aid, like at a dollar store convenience, like a corner market. A fabuloso. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't drink it. Why? Why is that shit in the fridge? <laughs> Am I missing Why do something we keep here? The Tide Pods in the cupboard. Yeah, but you know you don't have to <laughs> fucking refrigerate it at the very least. Like, am I missing some sort of active ingredient that needs to be refrigerated to activate that shit? This is a genuine question, actually, because I don't know. Uh, can we? There's nothing else we can do here. Ah, oh, fuck. We're just gonna wait until we get power bombs. I think we can take the warp here now, or do we have to go left? No, no, I think we can just keep going to Gavin. Oh, yeah, yeah, because there's um there's a screw attack box and there's storm missile door that we have to break. Look, I'm not saying Fabuloso should be drank, but why does it smell so good? It smells f fragrant e, fragrant e. It smells just enough like chemicals to know that you're not supposed to put that shit in your mouth. It's way better than Pine Sol. Why was Pine Sol trending a couple of days ago? Did anybody else see that shit? No, I deleted Twitter. No, uh, fair enough. <laughs> I got more reasons to delete the Twitter, so I'm happy about that. <laughs> Pine Saw is okay. Like, it does its job. I just don't like a, I don't like its smell. I know we need cross bombs for this, but I'm pretty sure I can. What is your favorite air freshener? Uh, Febreze. Oh, no. I can get what, this. What kind of Febreze? Uh... Well, I'm not picky, but... If I had to pick one, probably Lennon. I like Hawaiian Breeze. Hawaiian Breeze is okay. But then you get dipshit saying that you, uh, your fucking fragrance has paid off. <laughs> oh my god, people, man. Brinstar fragrance is something I don't even want to think about. Uh, how the fuck would that even smell? Well, I imagine one whiff, you just keel over. <laughs> you don't even have an air freshener, Mr. Matt. Oh, man, I need an air freshener. Especially, I got cats. Uh, I got, got cats, and that means I got Kaler. And that shit stinks after a while, if you're not uh, up to speed on changing it. I mean, Thanks. it could be worse. It could be dog odor. Oh, I mean, pets in general. Especially wet dog. Especially. I think I could just no no I think I can do a speed run inside a not speed run speed boost in the boss arena itself. Yeah, I th it, this should be fine. Oh fuck! I had to wait to turn around actually. I mean, I'm on the guy got another chance because this is a. Uh... Oh, fuck. I fucked that up. That's fine. Oh, God. Oh, that's much faster in this. Or am I, am I just dumb? I will make on the mic. Uh, second worst boss in the game? Uh, this guy, this guy's just kind of nothing. Like, I kind of forget he's here because I keep forgetting cross bombs right now. There. He turns around too fucking fast, too. This is the boss? Yeah. It's the guy that gives you the cross bombs. Mm. 
Normally, if you're able to store a speed charge before you enter this area, you can like hit his ass with this uh, shine spark, and it cuts the battle in half. This thing's making me nervous, though. I think if it hits me once, I'm dead. Based on your current health, more than likely. Yeah, yeah. So, like, we play it better safe than sorry. I should also be using storm missiles. I don't know why I'm not using storm missiles. I mean, it's not like you're oh, short of ammo or anything. Wasn't expecting the... No, I didn't account for the, the second uh, wave. That's fine. Yeah, you can shine a uh, shine spark in the room during the phase transition. But I think I did just that uh, in the dread race I did with Trav for the charity event. Uh, it's just that I'm woefully out of practice. See, that's what I was trying to do earlier. Because now I think I can do this. Yeah. Yeah, there Fuck me, dude. Yeah, so close. Better luck next time, loser. I <laughs> I deserved all of that. <laughs> I I was hovering to the right so hard because I was panicking my ass off. Look how fucking fast that thing turns south. That is that is incredible. Oh wow! Really? Down here, want to kill you? Fuck! <laughs> I don't. I don't know. <laughs> you got this. That storm missiles also fucking annihilate X parasites too. Yeah, the cores. Yeah, the cores are absolutely shredded. <laughs> <laughs> I heard Raven Beak is shredded. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys were doing all that shit last session. I was dying with some of them. <laughs> I heard Raven Beak has a 12 inch cock. <laughs> Uh, what was the fucking Aeon Pulse? Oh yeah, just hold right in the deep end. Yeah, so this is Cross Bombs. This is such a inconsequential ability that you get so late into the game. Because we're, we're, almost, we're almost to the point where we're getting the Power Bombs, too. And it's what, like, did you say Aeon something? Uh, what? I don't know why, but I just had like the weirdest memory of Aeon Flux. I heard that Raven Beak had to get a suit upgrade to contain his cock. <laughs> it's that huge. <laughs> I heard that the Chozos back home call it the Hyper Beam. <laughs> <laughs> Colors galore. <laughs> color blind, you only see two colors. I think what's the big deal? <laughs> it just keeps going. <laughs> I like how Johnny used the scan pulse and still ignored the missile tank hit in there. God damn it. All right, hold on. We got to go back. <laughs> I left my keys. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. I got to go back. I left my keys. Got all oh, time out. Time out. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, kind of sucks they they quick kill they 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 quick them off here instead of making them a great current. But I don't know. It's like I mean, what a what a what a hell of a first impression though. You know, like if he had to go out the way he did, you know, I think that's the way to do it. Raven Beak is a fantastic villain, but he doesn't. I don't think he necessarily needs to be reoccurring. He, he, I don't. I don't think Samus really needs like a Ganondorf or Bowser outside of Ridley. 
Yeah. Not really. You know what she needs? She needs a love interest, says all the Dojin writers. No, no. No love interest, no. I mean, I'm not saying that Samus yeah. can't love, but it's like... It's not really a story I'm interested in. Say it can't. I'm not give, saying it can't work either. Give her love interest two golden pistols. Yeah. And make him a whiny bitch. <laughs> yeah, I going absolutely hard. hate oh, actually, how long on. the loading times are. One second. Yeah, because we got another, we got another loaded screen actually. So I'm gonna. Good sign to thank some subs here, because uh, I can do that now. Oh, thank you. <laughs> uh, let's start uh, from when I went live. So let me see. Mr. Powell, thank you very much for the resub. Uh, Emil, you as well. Loyal Paladin. Uh, Remy the Magnificent. Uh, Omega Persona. Mystery Man 39. Pog the Irish. John at Dawn. Uh, Hell X. Uh, Mick. Uh, Mick Yeager. Uh, Arsa. Was he? Res. Res Arcana. Re -ar Res Arcana. I don't know what the fuck that is, but thank you very much. Mr. Mad Trios. Uh, Pixelator. Uh, Chaos Jester. Uh, Shadow Wolf 1999 and RS Ray. Much appreciated, guys. Thank you very much. Well, let's see if it counter is it this time. It's not. It's from yeah. Mario Odyssey. It's just Mario. I mean, we can't go see if we're gonna right? Just Mario. Just Mario. Samus. Just Mario. I've been told that Raven Big managed to beat Superman in a boxing match in Alien prep time to beat the entire Justice League. Also sounds like Michael Ironside, which has nothing for combat, but it's still so damn cool. <laughs> I heard he beat Super Mario 64 in only one sixteenth of an A press. <laughs> Samus, you have no way of financially defeating Raven Beak. He has <laughs> 30 Ethereum in NFTs. <laughs> huh? Quickly, Samus. You must go to his blockchain and free his monkeys. All his apes <laughs> must be gone. You must slurp them. So, what Raven did you say? I don't right know, dude. I fucking lost the narrative when you said free his monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know what that means. Raise Diamond <laughs> hands, Samus. Diamond hands. <laughs> Raven Beak right clicked your piss NFT. You are no longer able to piss. Oh, <laughs> uh, the fuck? I just want to make sure. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going to freeze. Raven Beak doing a birdly face. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> okay. I see what you mean. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I man. heard Raven Beak but that, were, that bird app. That would require Raven Beak's helmet, though, to be expressive, which it's not. It's a helmet. You know, would you fucking draw a smile on Raven Beak's helmet? <laughs> a sharpie? Fuck yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what, you want me to fight? No, I just want to draw a little smiley yeah. face on you, thing. Bye. <laughs> Actually, no, yeah, I gotta screw it. <laughs> and you too. Alright, one twenty seconds till time travel. Alright, Remember the airship in Arkham Knight that had monkeys in cages for Riddler trophies? What if Samus needs to rescue them? <laughs> I don't even remember that, Mr. Matt. It's been so long since I played Arkham Knight though. That was the uh when you're facing when you're finding a uh, Croc, I think. I think he's like one of the DLCs. Well, no, because Mr. Matt says airship. I'm, I'm assuming they're talking about the blimp. There's two. Oh, was recall. there? Oh, was there two? I think so. It's been a while since I played Arkham Knight. All yeah, yeah. I was trying to run Arkham City today, but it kept crashing anytime I used the uh, fidelity. Apparently. Fidelity. Uh, I meant Nvidia GameWorks. Anytime like it, I did Nvidia Physics, it just not worked. Uh oh. Bombs. You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough mm, Ethereum. <laughs> the 
fucking guy is revealed to be Elon Musk. He's like, shit, man, fuck. The happy NFT salesman. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm not happy. <laughs> <laughs> That intro part where he like shakes Ling, like, what do you mean all your apes gone? <laughs> hey, Miss Bob, thank you for the best. Any plans to attend Fan, ne uh, fan Fest next year? I would love to go, Mr. Plow. Uh, but that entirely depends on my financial situation, and I, it's too early to say what that's going to be for FanFest. So FanFest is next July, I think? It also requires going to Vegas, and fuck Vegas. Um, I mean, I could just ignore Vegas, though. I could just, no, like, I, I can crash it. I mean, you're probably right. But I mean, Vegas always, Vegas always crashes for me. Right, Uh, but still. Like, I can just crash at my hotel room. But Ow! <laughs> But then, John, you can play the new Persona uh, real game. That's an actual slot machine. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? There's a Persona 5 slot machine. Oh, well, I mean, that's not yeah. surprising. There's a, there's a slot machine for everything. Well, yeah, it's like Sega, crazy so it makes sense. Sega did start with slot machines, after all, in the 40s. Wait, as early as the there. 40s? Yeah. They started in 1940. Service games in Hawaii. Nope, standard games. And then it became service games. And then service games was abbreviated to Sega. You just gotta peel back the candy coating and get to the juicy innards. And then give it a electric shock if you know what I mean open up I'm also dying we all are I didn't even know they were I mean we we start dying the moment we're born there we go Mr. Mad saying that they didn't even know that say goes around that long yeah they've been fucking up their shit for decades <laughs> it's amazing they're able to stay afloat <laughs> Pachinko tends to be very popular in Japan, so I guess it's a given Sega's being involved with it. I mean, I don't know exactly what, like, the gambling scene is like in Japan compared to here in the United States. Hawaii. Well, hmm. gambling is illegal in Japan. That's yeah. why Pachinko exists. Yeah, it's there's a legal loophole. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wait, what's the... Wait, explain that. Uh... The easiest way to describe it is Japan, uh, gam like regular gambling is illegal, you can't gamble for money. Okay. What you can do is, Pachinko is technically a game of skill, because you do time uh, whenever your balls drop. Right. So whenever you, like, you know, your voice goes low. <laughs> I mean, he's not, he's, not, he's not wrong, that's the best way to describe it. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, but like, uh, you, you know, you time the ball dropping and you can decide when it's the best time to drop it. So there's technically that part of skill. Plus the bonus is a pressing a button in the machine or some shit like that. Uh, so you redeem your balls for prizes instead of actual money. So you didn't really win money. You won like a teddy bear or some shit. Which uh, usually means like, hey, there's a pawn shop like nearby that buys it for money. And that's how yeah. they check it around. Money goes in but not out. But there's mm -hmm. ways of pulling money out of it <laughs> if you try hard enough. Yeah, I mean, basically... Um, Sega started um, in Hawaii um, during World War II, and then like as soon as the U.S. outlawed <laughs> slots in most territories um, in like the 50s, that's whenever they went and branched out their slot machines to Japan, and then Japan <laughs> outlawed <laughs> several forms of gambling, and that's why you got Pachi slots now and shit. Yeah, they go way back. I don't think this is the most ideal place to get this guy, but we'll see what we can do. And um, we have time shuffled. Yeah, no, they started in Hawaii. Well, why else would John get flown out there? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you just want to like visit the uh, nice scenes from Sonic Two, the movie? <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah. No. No, not at all. But um. Yeah, I mean it was a fun time. Oh. Honestly, the worst part was just the fucking flight. Yeah. Uh, cause I left here. My flight from here to Adelaide over in Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, my flight here left at eight in the morning, and by the time I got to Phoenix, it was like uh, it was like nine in the morning over there, cause you know time zones and shit. Uh, then I had a two-hour layover, and then the flight to Hawaii itself was about six and a half hours. Yeah. <sighs> And I didn't. I I managed to sleep for like two hours on that plane ride, but I, the rest I was up and I was cramped and I was sore. I was so fucking miserable. Were you in like business class or regular? Oh uh, no, uh, fucking economy, dude. <laughs> no. You should have asked for a uh, trip out to Japan on a AC one thirty gun ship. <laughs> well, I uh, I would love to go to Japan one day. I just don't know where they the do hell daily I'd go. flights. Yeah, like I don't, I don't know where the hell I'd go though. Uh, Kabuki Cho. What was that? Uh, you go to Kabuki Cho and just say there. You reviewed Yakuza. Okay, cool. Yeah. I am the Yakuza. Sad you didn't get a Spirit Airlines experience with Sonic. Sad. What the fuck? Fuck you. <laughs> 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 no, it was just the, it was a, it was regular ass American Airlines. They gave you a couple of free drinks, and then they try to fucking push this credit card on your ass. Like, God damn it, leave me alone. What? Uh, at least your flight, like, you know, there was some, you know, flight, food, a movie. No, not really. You, you gotta buy the food. Uh, oh. Like, the, for, like, a longer than normal flight, your ass gets two free drinks. Because the thing Pretty is, much. and I never fucking understood this, so... When I'm normally like, visiting family and shit, so I go, to, I go to Georgia to Pennsylvania. That's about a two-hour flight. They give you one complimentary drink, right? But they don't give you the whole can. They just give you, like, half of it in that cup, and there you go. I don't know where the rest of the other can goes. <laughs> I'm assuming in the trash, to, because you're yeah, not I'm worth it. Yeah, I'm assuming to a better place. But when you're riding a flight that's three hours plus, they give you the whole fucking can. Uh, it has to last a little longer. On a flight to Hawaii, they gave me two cans. I mean, like two cola cans, not like a bird, <laughs> but uh, still. Yeah. <laughs> but food? No, you had to pay for that shit unless you were like first class or some other shit. Even the first class rarely gets food for free, though. So you're saying talk about a low budget flight? <laughs> food and movies you have to pay for? I'm out of here. Oh fuck, I can't go anywhere. I'm in the sky. Yeah. I mean... Again, John, the best experience was uh, them kicking you out of the plane just with a snowboard. Yeah. <laughs> Kicking you out of the plane? No, he, he took over the plane. <laughs> We're no survivors! He's taking out everyone on board on... What? <laughs> <laughs> you know, because Sonic... Sonic is cool enough where he can jump out of a helicopter with an impromptu snowboard. My ass will do the same shit, but my I jump out of the plane and my ass gets immediately sucked into the engine turbine. <laughs> and there you go, like roll credits. <laughs> That's how my story ends. So how did Sonic take everyone out in the plane? Probably just, especially uh, what, homing attack, dude. Weren't they military spec though? Sonic matter. speed, nap snack. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Well, I mean, how do you think he's taking out everybody on board? <laughs> he doesn't have much room to work with. He needs some distance to gather some speed. So uh, I, I got to be quick and efficient with this. Right, well, good old neck snap. <laughs> do the trick. Just <laughs> <laughs> fucking making the MGS noises. <laughs> hey, and it's Sonic, so, you know, he can spam that shit really fast. Well, don't worry. I got the chaos piano wire. You're gonna spin dash to a man's torso. So he's now a donut. <laughs> oh, okay, I was waiting for Lucy to call me up. <laughs> Nap snake. <laughs> Yeah, it's the uh, it's the fourth snake that nobody <laughs> talks about. <laughs> yeah, it's like a fucking uh, liquid solid solidus and <laughs> nap. <laughs> the geriatric snake. Yeah, <laughs> this is nap snake. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, uh, Liquid didn't decide not to put that in the Patriots, uh, <laughs> Hall of Fame. Yeah, we just put him in the retirement home instead. <laughs> Spins all his days asleep. I'm getting some frame slow down here. Alright. Alright, I gotta be really careful with this fucking jet stream attack, though. That shit hurts. What was the Archie Sonic frame that had Sonic spin dash with a space in the middle? I know what you're talking about, just... I wouldn't be able to tell you which fucking comic that was. I love this shit. Let's, just, let's take the fucking best bit from Revengeance. Just sucking up with a little hand motion. I love that. <laughs> It's so badass. Get man. all! Yeah, it's like, I, I, that's so badass. I love that shit. They need to give Samus a blade beam. Are we talking blade beam from like 7 or uh, just. Like a fucking Mega Man Zero Blade Beam. Oh, okay. She can only do it at full health. Remember when Metal Gear Rising was going to be riding, like, going into Area 51? No, I don't remember that. I just remember... So that was, well, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. That was originally going to be the original plan for Metal Gear Solid Rising. Right. When it, was, canceled, when it was supposed to be like an in-between game between Sons of Liberty and Guns of the Patriots. Yeah, when it was still running off the Fox Engine. Because yeah. that was originally going to be the first Fox Engine game, but then uh, the first one FIFA. was, I think, yeah, uh, winning. Or fucking... <laughs> <laughs> FIFA for whatever reason. No, it's not, P it's not FIFA. It's uh, Pro Evolution Soccer, but for some reason the European name is like winning. <laughs> Soccer Starring game, Starring Charlie okay? Sheen. <laughs> Yeah. I, I don't give a damn about the name because they're <laughs> sports. <laughs> but yes, it was Pro Evolution Soccer. Not to be confused with Ronaldinho Soccer. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta isolate that lab. Me and I isolate that lab. It's so funny. <laughs> it's like you're about so to read a title screen. A Steam Deck dude. Intro. You're, you're, you're just about to read a title screen, dude. What the fuck are you laughing about? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I know I, I, I'm all about positive attitude, but Jesus Christ! Never thought in my life like an N64 bootleg would become a meme. <laughs> right. Fun fact: If you bypass some of the Chozo soldiers, then go back to fight them after unlocking the power of suck, you'll absorb them instead of shoving a bunch of plasma down their throats. And, yeah, because I'd, I'd imagine it, it's probably just a reused animation. That's all it is. Oh God, I gotta talk to them. <laughs> <laughs> you know what oh, that, you so you know what that is i'm gonna tell you exactly what that is this guy's mic was muted for like the first few seconds realized it hit the unmute button and then tried to save face by laughing <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hey, it could be worse. You could have fallen asleep and be like, oh shit. <laughs> and then mute your mic. Fucking yeah. Square Enix E3. Oh, okay. See, I thought you were going for like, you can, you, can, you can fall asleep in the middle of a stream and let the moon fall and kill everybody in terms of <laughs> the, Whenever uh, the Square Enix translator fell asleep during wait, uh, E3. What? Wait, when did that happen? What? Oh, I know what you're talking about. Uh, let me get it here. Uh, this is the way to Ravenbeak, so I don't think we should be going this way yet. I think it's time for cleanup. Yeah, it yeah. was E3 2015. Oh, boy. All right. Um, I think it's time for cleanup, ladies and gentlemen. This is how the story wakes him up. This is All right, I guess we're going to start. I guess we should start with Gavorian. Because we have everything. And I don't see any... Oh, wait. There's um, there's something over here I missed because the room is glowing white. What the fuck? God, what oh, wait, wait, was no. that? Wave beam, John. I don't know. Every time I think of like, like weird E3 moments at the fucking Konami press conference, 
with like with the guy just staring at the guy's like neck. Uh, Fuck you. Uh, all right. So it looks like I need. What do I gotta do here? Wait a minute. All right. So I have to. Oh, all right. Wait. I gotta. I gotta. Start from here. Oh, yeah. That was an absolute horrible one to fall asleep in. Uh, that was the seven remake. Uh, trailer to fifteen. So I gotta break that. Was that, that for he... seven? Yeah, that was for seven. For seven remake? Yeah. Uh, I don't recall any of this. Alright, hold on. I got E3 2015, um, uh, one of the, the higher ups what? in Square. It's just like talking on stage, but you don't hear any translation. <laughs> and, then it, and then the trailer for the game starts up after he walks away, and you hear a snore, and then someone say, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So I guess the translator <laughs> snoring woke him up. Oh, shit. oh that guy's fired. <laughs> oh man, I don't have enough time for that. All right, I'm obviously approaching this the wrong way. I'm trying to think. Or do I gotta use a power bomb? And just barely get... no, because uh, hold on, let's see this. Yeah, that's crazy to think about. Seven remake was fucking E3 2015. All right. That'll shut off. Fucking. There's not enough room to speed boost here. You have to take the door here. And then it didn't release until fucking 2020. If you go from the other direction, you have more time. Uh, oh, um. Oh, okay. You know what? No, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. The other direction? When they announce, uh, oh, yeah. oh, oh, you mean from in. the uh, from the other door, right? Right, right, okay. But it at least I mean, makes sense that it, it took seven remake that long to come out because I mean, Nomura was working on like 18 different games at one time, <laughs> okay? So I gotta go all the way fucking around, Jesus Christ. Yeah. It, jump oh, around, yeah. Jump no. Around, jump oh around. my God. I, yeah. I remember when Seven came out. Like Seven came out, and then the store that I was working at that time, uh, like the cops came and they had to close it down for the week. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> well, you remember that store? It's the one that refused to close down because they were thinking they were an essential business. Oh, yeah. Right, during because right, right. Seven right. released like right uh -huh. as COVID started. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, right, but yeah, because it was um, was that right after or right before everything was on lockdown? It was right, it was right after, after everything went into lockdown. Yeah, because I canceled my physical pre-order and bought it digitally because I didn't want to like fuss around with GameStop's shit. <laughs> no, wait, I can't do it that way. Now nah, I gotta go all the way back around. Yeah. Because like uh, cause Cheyenne is uh, talking about it, but like whenever we went to pick up her copy of uh, Animal Crossing, because you know that came out around the same time, the dude at the uh, at the GameStop, what, he, we couldn't go into the GameStop. They hand you the game while they barely open the door, <laughs> and he had like his hands in, in store bags holding the game. Yeah, oh my god, that was. Well, looking back at it now, it was crazy that that actually happened. Yeah. GameStop not caring about their employees enough to give them PPE? Hmm. <laughs> you can tell it was fair, a think... very, very, very fucking long time at the, when this country had to do with the pandemic because of just how fucking miserably sloppy the, our precautions were. Not well, lack of precautions, but just our measurements of taking care of uh, COVID-19 predicaments and shit. I don't even think it was just sloppiness. I think it's more so just Americans not giving a fuck about each other. Yeah, because they don't yeah. want to be inconvenienced. That's, that's literally the entire thing. All right, so it's it's easier to speed boost from here because I have more leniency and I have more time. But there's a layer of bomb blocks that I have to get rid of. But am I supposed to am I supposed to speed boost as a ball downwards diagonally, or do I just uh, have that's to what worry? I do. 
Or do I just have to, like, go all the way down? No, because there's, there's an additional set of speed boost blocks on the right. Uh, yes, I remember right before the pandemic, there was a new small game that came out that was very funny. Everyone laughed about it, that it was a walking simulator. Then 2020 happened, they were like, oh god, Kojima did it again. <laughs> <laughs> the post office is the only thing that <laughs> is allowing us to stay connected in America. <laughs> that would never happen. But... <laughs> so, it's all fine there. Alright, let's go to Gavora. Are you telling uh, me we live yeah, in a world up where there is, like, we have to go there anyway? So, in a world, in a world where Norman Reedus is the only person that actually is able to handle mail. What was like the most unnerving? Like, when did it take you guys to realize, like personally, that this this was actually happening? Like when the country was going on full lockdown. To me, it was when Wawa closed. <laughs> <laughs> because <laughs> Wawa was supposed to be a 24 hour delicatessen right and they closed that yeah. shit down completely and then even after when they started to loosen up some of the restrictions even like everyone was still having to go with, like batten down the hatches wear a fucking mask sanitize everything they they, uh, they canceled the overnight shifts so seeing Wawa close that night was even more <laughs> dest uh, destabilizing but to me personally like, I, I Non shit post answer. I think when I was attempting to go to like uh, a, a local shop, right? That's a grocery store in Philadelphia, or on the East Coast anyway. Uh, and the windows were boarded up, and there was a line outside because they were only letting people in like two, three at a time. Yeah. And uh, at that point, I felt like, like, dude, I feel like I'm in a fucking post apocalyptic movie. Like, this is so... It, it, it's not even scary, it was surreal. The craziest thing that happened was, right before everything was in lockdown at my mall, there were still some shops that, like, were just slightly open, but, like, most of the big shops were, like, closed. Yeah. And then I remember just recording, like, and I'm glad I did, because it's just a log of, like, that mall being, like, close to being abandoned, pretty much. Yeah. But that was the only thing I can remember. Like, oh. oh shit, this is getting really bad when, like, even the big stores are closing down. Yeah. When the Sonic movie advertisement stood up in theaters for several months, most released. Yeah, like, you're absolutely right. What was it? It was that in, uh, like, uh, Doolittle? Doolittle? The ones that were up there? Yeah, that weird, uh. Iron Man? The guy who played Iron Man? Robert Downey Jr. movie? Did he do that? Yeah. I don't remember that. This is probably a speed booster. But um, I think for me, it was like two instances, and they were both kind of work related. And like the, the the first one was just the fact that they offered forty hours of um of vacation time without eating into your vacation time, just so you can like um take care of your kids if you had any, because you know you can't get a babysitter and the schools let out. <laughs> And then the other thing that um, really made me think, wow, we're really in this, was when I was right about to go on vacation Yeah. in, I think it was like April, like tail end of April. And I was right about to go on vacation, and they're like, hey, did you want to join this pilot for um, work at home? We're planning on rolling it out for um, for everyone in the, in the Enterprise, at least giving them an option. And uh, we know you're tech savvy, so we want you to be involved. I'm like, holy shit, you're actually sending us home to work. <laughs> In corporate America. <laughs> yeah, it's bad. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I remember for me, it was when the Goodwill I was working at closed mid shift for context. We we're in New York State. We had, we, I had almost feet plural of snowfall forecast for the next day, and we stayed open. I. Because of COVID, I am never working retail ever again. I'd imagine. And literally because of all the shit that happened to me while working retail. Being spat in the face. Uh, being threatened, like, physically. That was fun. Oh, all because we couldn't let people in without face masks. Yeah. We've only shut down the office three times from what I've been told. Once was whenever we did get a confirmed case of COVID at the call center. 
Once was from an active shooter because someone was stupid enough to say what state, you know, the call center was in. It's yeah. not hard to figure out. <laughs> it's not hard to Google a location. And then the other time was 9-11. Yeah, just this small thing. You know, it was bad when Disney, when Disneyland and Disney World closed. Yeah. Who spits at Who people? Spits some Incon people, Incon assholes. Yeah, uh, inconvenienced assholes. Uh, some nameless punk. <laughs> yeah, you mean yeah, some? Yeah, retail. Customers. I haven't, I haven't worked retail in a very long time, over ten years at this point. Uh, but I've worked seven years of retail before then, and yeah. you meet some real fucking entitled assholes. Yeah. Who just but look, also who at just the look same down time. at you because you work minimum wage and because they find that you're beneath them yeah but at the same time you know uh the kind of person that would spit on someone is some nameless punk yeah. <laughs> 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 so it's kind of, I'm, starting to, I'm starting to see the problem of being named this <laughs> uh, i have to head down like a, yeah yeah that felt Light, bad, and right? i think there would be positive connotations <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, I wait, felt no, bad no. For her. She didn't really get to enjoy her senior year in high school. No, I gotta hurt this one. Oh god, yeah. Yeah. Same for my sister. <sighs> Sucks, dude. Just watching all of your friends just like, oh yeah, like we're graduating. Yeah. All through PC. <laughs> Over Zoom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Compromises must be taken. Oh, I can't go this way. Or is this a way I, I remember can go? Oh yeah, screw it. Yeah, when they right, still yeah. wanted a in-person fucking graduation ceremony, yeah. and then someone got COVID right before the graduation ceremony, it's oh, like, ah, uh, yeah, <laughs> you totally weren't expecting that. Uh. Hey, uh, Shay, thank you very much for the right party of eighty, my dude. Hope uh, Sword of Kings is certainly an item in Earth. Sword of Kings, you were actually oh. going for that fucking thing? Ah, uh, a man of culture, I see. No, <laughs> no, no, no. Why would you do? No, I, 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 I humored the thought of getting that weapon myself for my review. Just what to, the fuck like, is Pooh gonna do? Use just, his bare hands? No, give him a sword. Yeah, but where do I get the sword? No, you know, it's just a fucking cosmic chance of a drop from this thing. You know, I was humoring the idea for the review just to make a like a three second joke about it. So I was gonna waste five hours of my time for a three second gang. Oh god, you but would have those done. I, then I, I decided not to because I got other shit to do. Can I not? Can I not I, go back down from here? See, the last time I did Earthbound on stream, we actually got the Sword of Kings first fucking try. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Wait, but like the, the Sword of Kings has a better drop rate than um. It's one one twenty eight. Uh, you can enter the teleport room. Uh, yeah, but uh, the drop oh. rate's better than the Chrysogrim. All right, Jason, I left you something in general. Yeah. The Chris doesn't. Well, at least like the schmooze fucking or whatever. Were they schmooze that drop it? Yeah. Yeah, like they fucking die in like oh, one hit, and it's not an RPG. I see, I see. Well. Yeah. Yeah. Part. Yeah. I don't mind backseating when I ask for it. It's when I don't ask for it is when I get snappy because, you know. Well, the Crystal Grim is a uh, one in five eighty eight. Yeah, but again, one takes a second. The other one takes a couple minutes because it's an RPG like. Yeah. Fight. I always get the Crystal Grim though. I love that fucking weapon. I love uh, getting two. Hey. Yes, how's it going? Hey, String, how's it going? Hey, Strang. Going. Fair enough. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, hold on. Um, I have to... I gotta do this, because I didn't know you can do this for the longest time. I didn't know you can fucking freeze these things. Don't yeah. do that! <laughs> oh, but no, seriously, String, how's it going? We are talking about, like... When the pandemic was just starting and things were on lockdown, like at what moment in your life Where were you? Did you realize, huh? This shit's actually happening, and this is something that's actually like just should be taken super fucking seriously. When my fiance was in Hawaii, and there were serious talks about the uh, the borders getting shut down oh, at man. the during that time, and she had to go into isolation for two weeks when she got back. 
That's that's probably when it hit me. <laughs> <laughs> Just a small thing. <laughs> I still I still remember like the week before like. And honestly, probably shouldn't have been at the time. We were kind of just like talk, like joking about it at the time, like, "Oh man, there's this thing happening. Oh, it's it's gonna be, you know, well, it's it. Or I wonder if people overreacting, and then the pandemic was announced. Like, oh, oh crap. Oh, yeah. This is real. I think this is actually happening, Jimmy. Yeah, this is oh, this, man, this is actually very concerning. I wonder and it if was this just... is gonna be like that swine flu thing. It yeah. was worse than swine flu. <laughs> And all it was was just one weekend. It was like on Friday, no one was worried, and on the Monday, it just like it hit everyone. But Jason, yeah. don't you know COVID has a ninety nine point nine percent mortality rate? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's bad. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, no, no. It, well, it's, oh, there, my good sir. That sounds really fucking lethal. <laughs> I was thinking this, this pandemic might actually help you great. It's fine. It's fine. In America, grandma must die for the economy. It's okay. <laughs> I mean, that, I wanted it to be a mortality. <laughs> I mean, that's just the economy in general, really. <laughs> Fonzo's a certified naps next month. <laughs> <laughs> look, I may or may not I'm be not drinking. Ju- like I'm not judging. We all have all those fucking moments. In fact, I might have look, three I more. Look, I may or may not be like two or oh. three like years in. <laughs> what time is it? I got like nine thirty. I mean, I'm not stopping anytime soon. I was more sure I drink them. <laughs> Don't stop me now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a gotta time. have a good time. <laughs> I'm, I'm having, having a time. time. <laughs> yeah, I, was say. <laughs> <laughs> I caught that too. It's like, I'm having a time. Having a time. <laughs> I'm having such a good time. I have this ball. <laughs> uh, I mean, lockdown sucks. <laughs> Hold on. I'm trying so to give see. Me a call. Where's this? Uh, <laughs> Please stop me now. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. This thing going off. Is there something? Oh, I hear something. What's that? What is that? Oh, speed booster, of course. What do Did I gotta remember charge? When celebr- remember when the celebrity started actually doing something? What do you mean? Please stop the spread. <laughs> I'm having <laughs> such, such a, a bad time. time. <laughs> Three weeks in bed. <laughs> <laughs> No, the, the the whole reason why they're saying, "Oh no, the celebrities are at it again," because of the whole uh, when they sang "Imagine" by John Lennon. Oh yeah. God! Like they were trying to have a "We Are the World" from Michael Jackson. I was like, "What the fuck are you numbnuts doing?" While they fucking uh, sang that, and they're like multi like million dollar yeah. mansions. We're in this together. Yeah. And talking about being so <laughs> bored. Yeah. <laughs> it's like fuck you. Um. The, the thing I I remember very very well is uh whenever all the verified accounts got locked out of tweeting, oh, so they were like just the fucking, liking tweets that have letters. Because of the fucking in crypto them. scam, yeah. <laughs> yeah, where a uh, Twitter employee like got their account accessed, and that's cool that they can lock down fucking verified accounts like that across the board. Do it from here, so I have a little more time. Uh, Winger, you mean oh, uh, Elon Musk founded Twitter? He doesn't own it; he found it. Ah, <laughs> uh, just like how he yeah. founded like, Tesla. Yeah, yeah. Yep. <laughs> a lot of people don't know that he did it. I hate it because even in Grand Turismo Seven, it says like founder Elon Musk. I'm like. God damn it. No. Yeah. There are some Rivian employees that are very pissed off right now. <laughs> I can't go back down that way. Or do I have to? No, I don't have to go. I, I can't believe there. Elon Musk invented social media. The dude's a genius. I can go through that too. <laughs> yeah, I can go through No, I can't go through that. And, and that's broken. what I find absolutely hilarious whenever people like, I show them the uh, like the Rivian cars. Mm-hmm. And oh, uh, the, well, the truck. And then they're like, what's Rivian? I've never heard of them. And I'm like, you remember whenever Tesla was good? 
<laughs> it's those guys. <laughs> My roommate actually has one pre-order, and we were actually able to test drive it. That shit's actually really cool. I had it a good really to drive. Is. I've, just, uh, I've only been yeah. in a Tesla twice, uh, and it's just weird for me. Because you have, well, I'm talking about the Rivian. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm talking about. I thought we were talking about Tesla because my kind of my mind kind of drifted. But uh, it's okay. No, what's a Rivian? Uh, another Rivian another is electric. a company that was formed by former Tesla employees after they were pissy. Yeah. <laughs> Once I wonder why. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh. And uh, their vehicles are pretty much just Teslas, but better. <laughs> <laughs> the, the problem is that they're just fucking pricey. They're like eighty thousand, and they go up to like a hundred thousand. God damn. Yeah, that's the because they're more a relatively small company. Yeah, they're out there, so at least that's better than some fucking like startup electrics. Yeah. yeah. I mean, hopefully they get like cheaper soonish rather than later. Yeah. Kind of needed to be. <laughs> for a for a startup, that's actually fairly good pricing if you consider things like you know, the fucking. Uh, F-150 Lightning is th around that price. Yeah, but I don't trust electric. It's not a man's car. It's not a real car. <laughs> I need my uh, I need my Ford Raptor to go uh, to the office. I like a car uh, to me unless I'm killing the atmosphere as I drive it. <laughs> I, I need I need to drive in a suburban. <laughs> I need to drive in a suburban area with my uh, Super Duty lifted. I don't want to see the kids. I just want to run over them. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Cyber truck in the car. Every time it, though. there's a bump. Eighty <laughs> percent items. What are we missing? What are we missing? Yeah, the that's Cyber okay. truck is one of those vehicles that you drive where, uh, if you ever want to rear end someone and murder them, <laughs> perfect vehicle for you. <laughs> Oh, dude, I love I loved it when, like, there was the whole thing with Tesla's, like, auto-driving, like, can't register a kid, uh, so it just okay. runs them over. Yeah. Nope, nope, I can't go here. The Cybertruck 2077. I mean, Elon Musk is in Cyberpunk. Is he? I don't know why. Is he? Yeah, he, yeah, he makes a cameo in Cyberpunk. Oh, my God. I mean, it's no different than Conan being in Death Stranding. Uh, yeah, Conan but, and uh, Jeff Keighley. Yeah, but people like Conan, though. So. And Jinji Ito. <laughs> I was going to say. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we have to go... That's a missile plus type we have to get. And I think we can just get there by going... Uh, okay. Uh... Yeah, so believe it or not, this is actually my first time 100%ing Dread. I never 100%ed it until this uh, playthrough. Because, um. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I, just, I just normally just do any percent stuff. Oh, you did a free review, but maybe I'm, I must be misremembering. No, I just did a regular uh, any percent mm. review. <laughs> did I get that one already? Yeah, I got that one already. Oh, wait, wait. I went past the room. Hey, feeling, by the way, experiment. I haven't asked you for a bit. There's your answer. Okay. <laughs> he has now died. It was a pleasure knowing you, experiment. <laughs> oh, whoops. I'm Mike Bespuses. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> uh, no, I'm fine. You're fine? Uh, That's good. Uh, okay. Looks like we have to all go sorted. back. I still need to, to set the Xbox up for next week. Uh, mm. uh, I'm going to do the same, actually. i get my Xbox up for next week. Yeah, uh, we're... Crash Team Racing is happening next Saturday, starting at 12 p.m. EDT. It is 20, technically 25 hours of Crash Bandicoot goodness, because daylight savings time happens in the middle of it. Uh, and uh, we're getting ready to have a getting ready to have a time <laughs> here. Have this ball. <laughs> it's a time. It is certainly a time. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what the fuck? When did this happen? What? Low Roar passed away. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, who? What? Um, he was in um Death Stranding soundtrack. Oh, 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 so a musician. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry, I don't know who that is. <laughs> so I feel like about about a touch. Yeah, the the main guy's uh, Ryan, because he just, I, he just passed away. Jesus Christ. Um, he's uh his songs were the 
you hear him on Death Stranding. You, he, he's the one who did the trailer soundtrack. I've not the one seen that all trailer in, the, in it, so it's, long. It's the first, it, yeah, it's the first trailer. It's just a lot of... It just, his Shit. music is really good. Like, it... it fuck. Damn. Oh, well, I'm sorry to hear that. It looks like we have to... Go up the screen area. Okay. Well, then I'm just starting to retrain our hands to get back to work. Oh, how are your hands uh, doing, by the way? Uh, well, the surgery hasn't fixed any of the um, prior issues. Did it at least alleviate any of the symptoms? Nope. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah. That failed. Uh, the other thing is, is I'm being asked to travel 200 miles for another issue. Uh, anything Why you can you... share or want to share? Uh, some weird skin mutation on the feces. That, and this is not like the X-Men mutation where you're secretly getting a superpower. I know, it's just the skin keeps growing faster than what it should be. So. Oh. Mm. That and they found some electrical cabling inside the foot they want to try and get out. Uh, oh wait. Damn, at 40. Damn, that's young. That is really oh, young. Oh fuck. Oh yeah, Mr. Matt, so we just did the ending theme. The... I think the actual like credits theme for Death Stranding. Oh, I know what I'm booting up tonight. Yeah, same here. Uh, the only other thing you missed, String, was uh, I'm missing four to five hours out of this move. Sorry. Um. Well, we had the um charity meeting at the start of the month, right? Literally joined that. Everything after that is a complete blank. I woke up several miles away in the field about four or five hours later. And by the time I got back, everyone was gone. This is literally a plot point of heavy rain. Like, fucking Ethan just blacks out and thinks he might be the origami killer. So I think I, I would stay away from the police for a, in the meantime. I did, I did speak to medical people about this. And they went, was anyone there to verify? And they went, yeah, I had like double digit people in the place we were doing this call. I went, did they hear nothing? They went, no. They said it was non-responsive, and I went, is there any CCTV? And I went, it's the fucking countryside, what the hell is CCTV? <laughs> I can't, I and they went, know how to fucking respond to that. <sighs> and they just went, well, we've got nothing. We can't help you, dude. <laughs> um, I don't think they're too complex, Jay. Uh, because, you know, I, I've, in this very stream, like, I've... I've I had to do a couple of attempts for a couple of shrines for puzzles, but the the solution is is easy to figure out. It's just executing it. The the one exception being this one shrine spark that I did uh, just I think like 20, 30 minutes ago. Uh, I had to approach it from another side, and I wasn't sure if I had the shine spark down because that was it. it normally, the way shine spark blocks work is that you you can only break ones that you actively touch with your shine spark, but in that one's case, it causes a chain reaction. Uh, and I wasn't expecting that because normally that's not how shine spark blocks work. You get much more leeway in this game than you do. Yeah. Fucking zero mission. Fusion? Yeah, or zero yeah. mission. I zero would mission. say zero. Never forget the fucking missile tank and zero mission that requires a three frame jump. Yeah. Uh, we're at ninety three percent. I don't know what item I'm missing. And I don't see any glowing white rooms, because that's normally how you can tell there's an item in the room. So it has to be a room I did not explore. It, uh, it, it has to be a door I did not open. Or it has to be, or maybe it's an item that I'm just, it, I just, I just don't see. I think this game has a couple rooms where you need to warp in from another area, and it's like restricted to just that, like it's on its own little corner. But I. Can tell you. But the like thing the, is, like, um, shortcut areas and fusion. Actually, oh, yeah, someone mentioned there's an unvisited area in the center of the map below the, I think, maybe. What, I mean, worst here? case, didn't you pick up the, um, yeah, we got the little... scan pulse. The problem is, is that where the fuck would I even use it? Besides everywhere. everywhere. Oh my god. I'm trying to think, like, I'm looking for, like, maybe a door I ain't open or some other shit. Uh, right below the map room says Game Man. Which map room? Well, that's a save station. Well, uh, Johnny, you gotta use it like the helmet upgrade. 
every two feet <laughs> you use it. That little blue highlighted area there that has nothing in it, maybe. Like right here, because that's not yeah. a, that's not a door. That's a that's a that's a magnet rail. Uh, I guess. But do you have to power bomb that little crevice at the bottom there in that left? Maybe. Room? Okay, we can try. Uh, Oops, I mean, it's better. Like I have nothing else to go off of. So, uh, all right, we have to go. Best thing about shines or puzzles in this game is that you can solve most of them in at least two ways. One is usually a lot, uh, uh, a lot uh, wazier, though. I'm sorry, BTS. If you do a typo in the uh, <laughs> chat, I have to read the typo. <laughs> Minor spelling mistake. I win. It is kind of annoying that you have to charge up the power bomb because that, that's like a cold over from other M, I think. When uh, in other games, you just uh, hold the button. Yeah, hold the button. And let, yeah, let it go. And that's about it. Look, at least this one doesn't have that obnoxious whoosh noise from Fusion. Oh, <laughs> the cappuccino machine. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I've only my way better around the Nintendo Music 2000 player standard. I'd replace it with something else. I don't know, maybe a fax machine noise. <laughs> oh, wait, I have to go this way. Yeah, 10 days until Sonic Frontiers comes out. And, um, I mean, obviously I'm getting it, but. Power bomb explosion with Ridley. Oh, no, I've got a better idea. I'll just replace that with Trap Screaming. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, yeah. let's like, uh, head down. Uh, Sonic Frontier's got leaked, apparently. Yeah, um, so, word of warning for those, I mean, we're not gonna say anything, uh, cause I don't know anything myself, and I'm not looking to fucking spoil that game for myself. And uh, you legally can't. Yeah, um, yeah, I also can't, legally. Um, I would make it a thing right now to mute Sonic Frontiers and any other related keywords. And Ragnarok. And Ragnarok. Oh, and God of War, really. Ragnarok also broke Street Bait. Oh, man. Oh, geez. Is that all today? Because I don't remember hearing Frontiers got leaked. Uh, to, yeah. I think Frontiers was today. Yeah. It was bad to happen. No sport. They're probably just to be lost to the forest. That's badass, man. Probably be, yeah. Yeah, look, there's a room here. Look at that. What is it, power? I like your funny words, magic man. <laughs> I love man. your funny words, magic man. <laughs> For God's sakes. Got one job, cross bomb. <laughs> this is the this is the whole this is the full extent of the cross bomb. Alright, hundred percent. Awesome, 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 awesome. We did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. No, it's oh, okay. Wait, give me a sec, I got you. Uh, I guess we go to Berenia next. Because it's the closest elevator, I think. No, there's a... No, it's a network station. Yeah, okay, we're going to Berenia next. When I saw all these chrono blocks the first time, I really thought they were going to bring back the phase shift, the inability from SR. Crossbomb's a little lame, I feel. Eh, yeah. Um, uh, we were talking about it earlier. This game doesn't have a spider ball. So in a way, it kind of no. functions like... The spider ball and how you're like you solve certain items and shit, but it doesn't feel yeah. nearly as good. Uh, also, hey, line. you guys are watching Bird Up, <laughs> the worst show on television. <laughs> All right, so when you guys said forces got leaked, like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> that game came out like five years ago. <laughs> you guys are talking about like what it was new. Okay, I didn't immediately process it that I way. It was forgettable, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like God <laughs> damn. I mean, the funny part is uh, when Bayonetta got leaked, I was instant day one play. But when Fron Frontiers got leaked, everyone's like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> okay, um, we're going to Berenia next. Did Mania get leaked too? I mean, I think everything at this point just gets fucking... I mean, the g games leaking or breaking Street States as a story is all this time. It's yeah. just If that, it comes out on Switch nowadays, it gets leaked like a week beforehand. Yeah. 
Because it's so easy to just that, upload it and that, emulate it. Like, what does that stem from? Is that just because it all takes us one store breaking street day and somebody uploads a, a dump, like, well, no. online? You can usually, like, force the uh, eShop server to send you the information nowadays. Surprise, yeah. um, Advanced Wars didn't, I, I'm surprised Advance Wars didn't get leaked, because I know someone got it early somehow. Mm -hmm. My understanding is most of, most of the time it's because it's, it's so easy to dump Switch games and emulate them. It's just that's how the most of them get leaked nowadays. That guy doesn't yeah. have the Dreamcast problem. You used to be able to brute force Nintendo servers, but they fixed that a few years ago. You say that, John. It's actually not that far off from the Dreamcast situation, considering it's yeah, yeah. But that the killed, first batch of consoles can that, dump it. But that helped. That, but that that helped killed the Dreamcast, though. The Switch is still very much successful. Yeah, you know. I feel the Dreamcast was itself not so much a parody. Issue, <laughs> it was a, it was a problem, but it wasn't the yeah. reason. I'd I, say. I I believe you. I believe you. I believe you. <laughs> All right, uh, we are heading. The PS2 killed the Dreamcast at the end of the day. Yeah, Piracy yeah. just didn't help. <laughs> and even then, the easy piracy most people remember now didn't come until like just a maybe a later. few months before the system was killed. And you know there were yeah. attempts to do additional. Anti piracy on the Dreamcast at that point, but the problem was, was is beam. by that point in time, the software development kit had been leaked. In which case, oh, oh, you're looking for the thing? Yeah, we're just going to use the same tools you did. Oh, look, there's the thing. Oh, hey, we have the scramble tool. Is GG. there any version of the Dreamcast that isn't Bill CD compatible? Yeah, the so second gen, one, isn't it? There's... there's three versions there's the VA0, the launch units, the VA1, which is the most common, and then it's the VA2, which was the last ones they did in the US and Japan, and it's those they got rid of Mill CD support. And you can't, and also, that way. you can't do it that way. Speaking of privateering, uh, don't forget, it's very easy to mod the 3DS. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> what? <laughs> I still gotta do mine. <laughs> Miyamoto said it himself. <laughs> it's easy to hack the 3DS. I mean, eShop closes in like four months. <laughs> it's also yeah. it's you can't it's put any money it's on already, it anyway. It's already impossible to put money in it. I had to, you know, when, when I was um when I was making the Donkey Kong Land video, uh, because when I, I knew I was gonna emulate it, I at least wanted to own like a digital version of it. So I loaded up my 3DS and I'm like, oh fuck, that's right. I can't put money in my account anymore. So I had to literally buy an eShop card and cash it in the Nintendo website uh, to put it in my funds and buy it that way. Um, you can't put yeah, funds on the Switch. Wait, wait. wait, you can't put funds on the Switch and then Use it back because you can it, do that, that on. That didn't immediately come to mind. I just, the website was easier, and I don't think my Switch was hooked up. Yeah, because uh, that's what I do when I bought a PS3 games. I literally had to put them on my P put funds on my PS5, and then retractably like buy them. It's depressing. It's What's happening? A war point. I wouldn't be honestly, Fonzie. I wouldn't be surprised once the 3DS and Wii U are taken offline, the PS3 is soon to follow. Even with that controversy that I had last time. Oh yeah, no, I I am I am not without a doubt. Thinking like the the PlayStation Store is gonna get removed from the PS3 because it fucking sucks on PS3. It does. It's terrible. I hate it, but it still shouldn't be removed. <laughs> did yeah. you see the pitch demo for the original Shantae was released last year? No, I did not. I literally went right over my head because I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't know to actively look for that pitch demo. No. Yeah, a proof of concept. If yeah, you yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what it is. It's just that I'm trying to think. Have I even seen an inkling of it? And it's like, no, I don't. I don't think I have. Also, PS3 privateering is extremely. Um, it shouldn't be as easy as it is. <laughs> oh, it's the same situation as it is on the Visa. Did I you literally, go all this way for and like it works basically. I, I to, it, it works the same that. as it used to on the 3DS and still does on the Wii U. Oh, hey, you have your title keys. Hey, neat. I'll just put so them in an um, XML file. Someone in chat mentioned the uh, Black Edition Dreamcast for Sega Sports. The best version was the Hello Kitty one. Only because it was translucent. <laughs> yes, exactly. It has that 2000 aesthetic of the uh, 90s. It's literally just a case of take uh, a game's title IDs from someone's account or, you know, your own. You throw them in an XML file, you throw it into the right app, and it's like, oh, hey. Yeah, we don't have any server checks on our own. We only trust the clients, which from a security perspective is a huge no-no. It's like, oh yeah, sure, you're the G yeah, come on through, yeah, oh, you are down this, yeah, sure, I'll take as much as you fucking want. That's literally how it works. Like, I'm fucking leaving the job tomorrow anyway, come on. <laughs> no, like, it's so bad that 
So I think it's like the official RPC is three Discord server. But you can just take the title ID for the game, put it in the um, the chat, the Discord chat, and it will automatically forward you <laughs> to an address for Sony servers. It'll just automatically pull the updates for the game. Yeah. I Most mean, it's not as bad as like the 3DS, and where you can just put an app on your on your uh, on your console, and it'll download the game straight from Nintendo servers. Yeah. 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 Makes you wonder, <laughs> it's what pretty it bad. A uh, string about that. There's not one but two apps for that on the PS3 and the Vita. Yeah. Oh, PK, uh, PKJG, right? Yeah, oh. package J or no. PS3. Yeah, I forgot there is one of the Vita actually. Yeah. Retro yeah, Fox. I've... What really makes you wonder? What does it take to gain Sega at their feet if they're struggling, especially the Sonic games? I don't think Sega struggles. Sega, Sonic's not Sega's bread and butter anymore. Sega's fine. Yeah, Sega's absolutely fine because it's not even fucking. It's not even really the video games that are the main source of revenue. It's all the arcade shit and the uh, pachinko shit. Merchandise. Yeah, merchandise. and, and I mean, merchandise. Yeah, merchandising. There's even apps on the Switch that can just go. Oh, you want a game for your Switch? Oh uh, yeah, choose from this nice list we have. Okay, it's downloading this. Oh, you want the updates? You want the DLC? Oh, yeah, sure. Go right the fuck ahead. It's not from Nintendo servers. But go Sega's right the fuck struggling. ahead. Yeah, Sega's struggling to hold all this yen that the Yakuza series is bringing in. Heyo! Yeah, I mean, Sonic has not been the main bread and butter for Sega in a very, very long time. They're just their mascot now. Yeah, it's just the mascot. That's, That's all it is. It's the first time they actually put a pretty good budget behind one. Yeah. Since Unleashed, maybe? Probably. Did Generations not have a budget? And... It had a bigger budget than, like, Colors, but it wasn't as big as Unleashed. You yeah. can tell it was rushed. It's that a good game, thing, silly. but you can tell it's rushed. Silly string. That was the DS games. <laughs> oh, was Forces full price? Because if it was, why? No, Forces not full price. No, it was, it was It was 40 bucks, yeah. Honestly, I think the last Sonic game that was full price was Generation. No, even Generation was 50, I think. What was Unleashed? I can't remember Unleashed. Unleashed was 60. No. Wait. Oh, fuck. I don't remember. It's been so long. Is there any way to check the actual MSRP for a game? When it was uh, released? Eh, there'll be records. Unleash MSRP. No, colors are uh, colors are fifty bucks. Colors is a Wii game, and uh, so, Wii games were never sixty bucks. I mean, well, technically that's a full price Wii game. Yeah. Gee, I think oh, it was full price. If I remember correctly, standards. the Wii and <laughs> PS2 version were fifty dollars, and the Xbox 60 PS3 version was sixty. I think. It looks at Brawl being like eighty bucks. What <laughs> Brawl was seventy, I think. Wait, it was too damn high. That's yeah. what it was. <laughs> yeah, it was too damn Especially high. Especially on into like 2013 and Brawl was still that much. Like, what the fuck? Well, that's like, you just blame Nintendo though for that one at that point. I uh, yeah. gotta pay for that dual wait, wait, disc. Brawl? Brawl was 80? I remember buying it for 60. Like, you get the game, you hyped as fuck for it, you've seen all the previews and trailer shits on the website, you stick it in, you wait, oh, it doesn't read the disc. I mean, GTA 5 being $110 on launch here. Oh my god. Good times. Bro, no, you're lying. <laughs> but, uh, uh, I mean, did you, have you ever seen like those like older magazines that had like old SNES games and you see the fucking price of some of them? Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, like hey, like old Funko Land. Sonic things. 3 and Knuckles, yeah. man. How much uh, is that? Sonic 3 and Knuckles, like in 1994, yeah. was I think 70 or $80? Yeah, it was like... It was either 60 or 70. It was pretty atrocious whenever you consider the fact that you have to buy both for the full, yeah, <laughs> the, yeah. the full game. <laughs> Which, I mean, no, you, you say that, but it's also you can also make the argument that would help it because the releases were staggered. You have more time to save for the second part. You know, it's not like you I had guess. to buy both at once. If you were buying both at once, yeah, for holidays, <laughs> because the because little Timmy knew that, oh, no, they're only giving us half of the game. <laughs> and I'm I mean, not going to play half of the game until I get the full release. So, uh, Grandpappy, uh, please give me uh, the full side three knuckles for this Christmas. It's okay, Timmy, but this is coming out of your fucking trust fund because this shit was $300. I get what you mean, <laughs> but I mean, if Sonic and Free Knuckles came out as originally intended, it would have just been one batch, just one game at $70, probably. Maybe. 
I don't know I because game. this uh, this fucking game. What the hell was it called? I, I I I bring it up in the Sonic Three video. It was like a 3D game for Genesis. So I found a uh, I found a magazine print. Pretty, from the the, the, uh, the uh, Oh so yeah, the that. virtual racing thing. Yeah, that game yeah. Uh, was sold at a premium because of the shit that was inside it. So if yeah, they did that be because of the technology inside of a cartridge, you know for for a fact they charge a premium for a game that's technically too. So, yeah, because uh, we needed, um, what was it, two to four megabytes of ROM space, and that was hella expensive at that point. Yeah. So I found some prizes from an old Toys R Us from the 90s magazine. Uh, we're looking at uh, the Super Nintendo version of Street Fighter Alpha 2, $70. Madden 97, $60. Donkey Kong Country 3, $60. So, like, 60 was the average back then, it seems like, for, like, SNES. Yeah. Yeah, for my sake, it was a, like a, just a bad, no special chips or anything like yeah. that. Yeah. And, and, mm -hmm. and an important thing to remember is you have to adjust for inflation because sixty, seventy dollars in the mid nineties. That's like it's like one hundred and twenty, hundred and thirty dollars yeah. today. Yeah. Um, so games were fucking expensive as shit <laughs> for a very long time in the nineties, uh, especially for uh, especially cartridge based games. That, that's another reason why the fucking PlayStation did as well as it did because CD yeah, games are and, cheaper and, to yeah, produce. and then you, and then there's the PlayStation area where like all of them are ranging from forty to fifty bucks. Yeah. So like Crash Bandicoot one, forty two bucks. Yep. Uh, yeah. Jet Moto, which is oh, a great game. I remember Jet Moto, yeah. Uh, 47. Uh, we're going to have... So a $60 cartridge from 95 is now over $120. Yes. Well, 118 CD era price crashed. HD era prices slowly crept up. Microtransaction era price, prices really <laughs> crept up. Yes, and now in a way you couldn't see it. And the 70s for PS5 games. <laughs> yeah. Let me think. Alpha on Super Nintendo was one of the few games they used the SDD one chip. So that was a dedicated compressor. So they could fit the goddamn assets on, because if they hadn't done that, yeah, that port wouldn't have been doable. Damn. Did multi-disc cost more? Um, I don't remember. I remember Final Fantasy VIII being pricey, but I don't remember much. Final Fantasy yeah, I think it was just the same price as uh, 7 I think it was like 60 yeah. bucks. I don't say. So. That was, a, was 8 4 disc or 3 disc? Uh, Eight is four. Final Fantasy Eight is four discs. Yes. Wait, what? I'm surprised I didn't okay. jack it up for the extra discs. Keep in mind I guess about this. Was so cheap. Miles Morales is releasing in a couple weeks for PC, and yeah. it's it, it was already a budget title for the PS5 and PS4. So this is a budget re-release at fifty dollars. Oh yeah, it's on PC, so uh, cough up the money. <laughs> Yeah, Look, you're just gonna buy a Steam key. You're, you're just gonna buy a Steam key anyway. <laughs> okay. I, oh. I'm honestly thinking at this point, Sony's gonna try and make their own PC store. I think it's gonna be any day now. I know oh, gee, I hope it goes better than their fucking mobile attempt last decade. Not salty or anything, bastards. <laughs> mm. Trying to think of a PlayStation remember. store. PlayStation prices in the I UK. I presume they just try and port like the PS5 store, like not maybe not port, but you know okay. recreate uh, it. To I, PC. I found a okay. I found one for that has Final Fantasy VII listed. Uh, Final Fantasy VII was going for fifty bucks okay. at retail. So yeah, it's roughly thirty four quid here at the time. It's so hard to find prices for games that are like older than twenty twelve. <laughs> The CDI, yeah. like the most expensive console in the mid-90s? Nope. That would have to go to something like the Neo Geo. The Geo. Or, I don't know. 3DO was up there. Yeah, 3DO was up there. I think the most expensive I could think of was the Pioneer Laser Active. Oh, dude, Sonic Extreme was going to be a $42 game. As you can see, even back then, Sonic sucked. Oh my god, today's Saturday. I don't work tomorrow. <laughs> Man, it took you that fucking long. You're, you know, it's gonna be Sunday in about two hours. Uh, long with Geek. <laughs> also, my 39th B day is Wednesday. We're hitting the limited run games physical store, in, uh, and I'm assuming that means North Carolina. And the Lost Ark in Greensboro. Such an amazing set of stored. I don't know what that means. Oh. Well, we've limited run and price. I, 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 I reckon that they're gonna try and get rid of physical next year. Yeah, next generation. Make it Can I get to talk about my story about my fucking uh, limited run experience? Do you, do you honestly? 
I don't know, because I felt if they wanted to go a whole digital library, they would have done it by now. I mean, I know, I, I know, they, I know, I know. They they're definitely testing the waters because you got the digital only versions of the PS5 and the Series S, but I felt they could. I felt they could have pulled the trigger on that already. I reckon they were about to until yeah. Xbox put a disc player in their one because I reckon that disc based PS5 was very last minute with how slapped on it is. Okay, uh, I found two things real quick. Uh, one that has some RPGs, and then uh, the other one has some stuff. So, Earthbound, the very expensive Super Nintendo game, yeah, ninety dollars. I would have bought that in a heartbeat. Yeah. What is the what is what's the year for this? Uh, looks like ninety six. Ninety six. That's right around the, when the game came out. Ninety bucks. Oh wait, no, 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 ninety five, ninety five. Because uh, 95. they're advertising, yeah, they're advertising DKC two, and that was eighty bucks. Coming late ninety five, yeah. Fucking Earthbound was ninety bucks back then. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Jesus they tried Christ. with the original Xbox One, and we saw how that went. But like, almost every single game you buy nowadays requires some sort of several gigabyte patch. Or uh, look at fucking Halo Infinite, where it was only like I think not even a quarter of the fucking game that was on the disc. Yeah. The, the, the highest price I see right now is Illusion of Gaia for ninety four dollars and ninety five. I, I mean, RPGs in particular were more expensive. I think it's because they ju they justify like how long it takes to beat the game or some other shit. But damn, like ninety bucks. Like, I, I, I'm thinking like it's the promotional campaign they kill Earthbound. No man, because that bitch was ninety dollars when that shit came out. Damn. Uh, let's see. In the um, uh, Modern Warfare 2's disc size get revealed recently, and it was like only 42 seven, meg. Seven, uh, it was 17 megabytes on PS5, 40 megabytes on PS4. Which I presume is literally just the assets on the dashboard. That's all it is, I reckon. <laughs> what, should, what, what should just be the first frame of like their 4K opening video or something? Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, so I, I found an inflation calculator. So 97 bucks for Illusion of Gaia. Uh, that would be a almost $190 today. Jesus. My God. So imagine spending that much money in a game that you've probably never heard of. And that's probably... You know, Illusion of Guy isn't that expensive anymore, is it? Uh, it's Let's still see. one of the more pricey ones, isn't it? I want to say, because it's still kind of obscure. Uh, Guy. Ness. Not the Fallout 76 release. That was a uh you can get a you can get a copy for about ten to fifteen bucks. Really? Wow, okay. That's a lot less than I thought it would be worth. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, no, I, I think that we'll eventually go full digital. And I think the only thing that would be somewhat holding us back is just Nintendo. But even Nintendo's slowly starting to get to that point, especially with developers not wanting to pay to have larger cartridges i reckon so this, just... i reckon nintendo are, are pretty keen to move on as well i reckon the, i, I mean, hate it but i reckon they I mean, are they're selling switch games that require download like there are some games yeah. that don't like like even you can get physical versions of games that are just a download code and that's it <laughs> I'm out of power well, so <laughs> what i mean is like la noir because um they didn't want to spend the money on, I think, like a 16 gigabyte. 32. Uh, 32? Yeah. But either way, it's just <laughs> they didn't want to spend the money on it. So it was like an 8 gig download that you needed. Yeah. So all you got was the first case in the in the game. Hmm. But I remember hearing like, and I hate that this is a like, hey, this is a case that it, like the PlayStation is like one in five games sold are physical. Yeah. And it's just like, yeah, I reckon Sony are willing to go, let's just go all digital, and if we lose one yeah. in five I mean, I customers, we'll probably make it up on the costs from distributing alone. I, I'm of, I don't know, like, how I feel about it, because, like, I'll be the first to admit that I'm I'm, a, I'm an all-digital guy for the Switch. Like, I, I only have maybe a handful of physical games, and, like, two of those I think Same were donated. Here. You know, all right, I, I'm back. What I miss? Uh, we're talking about uh, the eventual the death of the, the, physical, the death of physical, physical media, the death of physical media ah. for video games, and how, like, when I think back, like, if we are going to an all digital landscape, I don't really mind it because I've been slowly shifting to all digital for over at this since the Wii U, 
actually, yeah. because most of my Wii U library is inside the console itself. Um, I guess to give my two cents on it, the only real reason that I'll have an issue with an all digital landscape is if it starts going to like cloud. Yeah, that's but I would agree have with an that, issue yeah. with it. I agree, but, but like, I reckon okay, that, cloud yeah. is disaster. That we we should never go to cloud. It can be like, an option, even, um, but never the exclusive. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but even with stuff like Steam, where it's like you know, technically you need Steam to play your games, and if you lose connection to the servers, sometimes you can't play your games. But I still have There's access to all that. the files, yeah. and worst case scenario, I can just crack my own games. <clears throat> yeah. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. Right into my <laughs> Meanwhile, you know, with the Stadia, you're you're fucking. <laughs> Completely mm -hmm. out of luck. Yo, yeah. you're out of luck. It's I spent gone. twenty dollars on Stadia games, and I'll never get it back. I paid nothing. Well, actually, no, actually, hold on. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you give you a refund and Google Play credits. Oh, that's true. They are. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> the screen tilts gray. <laughs> Just you wasted. Would you like to buy some like, oh, fucking fun bucks? <laughs> <laughs> <There's always coffee. laughs> uh, oh shit. Wingser, I'm sorry to say that GOG is moving away from their DRM-free, um, tag, uh, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, because they were pushing, uh, GOG Galaxy, right? Yeah. 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 And on top yeah. of that, GOG, they've been losing money on, uh, CDPR has been losing money on GOG for years now. Mm hmm But, uh, Trav, I think for Google Hi. Play credits, I think you can use them in apps like Uber Eats. So if you just want to, like, oh, fuck get, yeah. like, Dude, oh, I bought stuff, Doom and do now that. I got food?! <laughs> you no, you 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 would think, you would think, but no, I have over about like thirty bucks on Google Play Fuck credits. Fuck you, Fonz. And, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm a realist. <laughs> Doom food. <laughs> hey, you can buy Sp Doom on your phone. It's true. I love, I love the fucking. You please watch your children's candy. I've been finding Doom inside the candy bar. <laughs> Uh, oh, thanks for reminding me. I wanted to do a picture where it's like, I am in your candy, and it's just a picture <laughs> of my face. Uh, okay. Um, oh, oh like, crap. I I to uh, to the top left. Did you see the Twitter post? Uh, what Twitter post? Rip and tear oh. until the candy is eaten. <laughs> uh, check Kojima's Twitter. I know you played Death Stranding. Oh, I saw... Oh, the, the musician that passed away? Composer? Yeah. Yeah, rest in peace. That time. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, John is really upset about it. <laughs> that did kind of sound like a whale, yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh. A low roar, even. Shut up. Uh, just give up. <laughs> this is gross. Oh, well, thanks, Ray. No. I don't care about anything else. I don't give a shit about anything else. I, my programming is just get that fucking guy right now. Oh, he's running? Oh, back up! No, it's just... Until I get you. I think my favorite version of that is the Vince McMahon is like, Where is he? Where's that son of a bitch? Yeah. <laughs> you stay here with 70. You stay here with 70. Where is he? Yeah, you can, um, fucking... You can isolate, like, Vince McMahon's commentary from, like, the 99 Royal Rumble. That's when he had everyone sick on Steve Austin. Uh, or at least, no, I think it was, like, the first blood match against with Kane. And Vince McMahon was on commentary, so, like, every time it's like, Royal Rumble, Royal Rumble, he was, like, fucking, like, you, you, you can just, like, overlay that with, like, Doom footage as you're using the chainsaw and some <laughs> other shit. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh. Neat. I didn't and really you can just me, isolate man. him uh, when he when uh, him and Shawn Michaels fought uh, God himself. <laughs> oh my God! No wait, I'm wrong. It was Vince McMahon and Shane McMahon versus uh, Shawn Michaels and God. You made that up. No, he I wish I did. Talk about <laughs> no, the time he, he verbally masturbated on air to Gary Strider. <laughs> <laughs> God, who came in here? It's me, Austin! <laughs> God. <laughs> no, just me. Uh, it was me all along, Austin. No. You mean he pulled the mystery? Why are you going back to the first boss? Yeah, I was going to say, um, I'm not sure if there's any. No, there's anything because the room would be going away. Oh, wait, there's a guy over here. What are what? you doing here? Get the fuck out of here. You don't belong here. 
I'm gonna blow you up. Don't say glowing white after you talk about masturbating. <laughs> well, if your comm is radioactive, Garfield we got tunnel. We got <laughs> you got tunnel. you got bigger problems if your comm is radioactive. Let's go to the hospital. That, ima yeah. that imagine <laughs> man, that imagine dragon songs hits different after you like nut like radioactive cum. What? Radioactive. <laughs> Radio. Radio. <laughs> Oh, that's right. It did happen to Peter Parker once. He did have radioactive. Come, he fucking killed yeah. Mary Jane with that. She gave her cancer. It was a. Uh, yep. It was a. Uh, spider come. Spider yeah, I think come. That, <laughs> I don't remember what spider come. God. He <laughs> <laughs> really did kill the radio stuff. God. Video killed me. <laughs> <laughs> so you're on your deathbed. Superheated room. Man, they're still here. Old man Peter and radioactive spider. Holy fuck. Were they expecting me to get this shit immediately? Damn. Thank God the... I waited. Yeah, no, That's always how of... I get that missile tank, too. Yeah. It's like, I don't even think to go in that room. Things are There's better left off, Barry. That's right, wingers. That's why we're going to be watching a Buried Alive match. <laughs> What? <laughs> hey, sorry, they're for, for the tier one. Wait, go back. No. So, like, you can see the stupid frame rate trick there in the background of the lava. Yeah, where they have it render at a different frame rate. Yeah, like three frames. <laughs> Looks like we are going. The we're fact only, that it's so fucking prevalent on Switch games really just show that we need a Switch Pro. We're only no, but we need it as an even bigger OLED. Oh. <laughs> we have updated the screen to Thanks, seven. You got a Steam Deck, right? Steam. I have mm -hmm. one. I have a Steam Deck. Yeah. yeah. I am terribly out of date with mine. I gotta, I've been meaning to go back and tinker with it. I've I got to get a fucking mouse for it because I can't do desktop mode <laughs> just the, with the, with the, with the yeah. pads. It's, not it's, right. it's a pain in the ass. Give me your Steam Deck, I'll do it for you. What do you need to get no, the desktop yeah, mic for? Uh, I'll just fucking add emulators and, <laughs> and uh, shit. Ah, yeah, yeah. of course. Uh, you know the thing? I fall down. I want to go down that way. Okay. I should also probably save the game. I haven't saved it in a while. It runs Switch emulators fairly well. Yeah, my, I've my been favorite, trying. But it doesn't, it doesn't run... Does it run Switch games better? Uh, it runs Breath of the Wild better than it does on Switch. Damn. Yeah. So it, 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 it's a case by case basis. That's, that's it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you, you that's kind of the case of emulate the switch emulator at the moment. Some games will just work flawlessly. Some just won't because it's just still early days. Like uh, like I'm like I know Bayonetta three just came out, but it was uh, running better on emulator right before it came out too. Oh man. Mm. Look up Retro Game Core on YouTube. He has the best Steam Deck. Guys. Sorry, I'll keep that in mind. No, you won't. No, you're right about that. Absolutely. So the the easy thing about installing emulators is that uh, you literally just need to go to this page that runs a program that installs all of the Switch optimized emulators all in one package. Then it's just a matter of like dropping the appropriate stuff in the folder, right? Or... Yeah, like at that point, yeah. like if you need a BIOS, just drag and drop, and right. then with ROMs, it's drag and drop. Yeah, see, that's why I need a mouse because that shit is just a nightmare to do with a. Uh... No, yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah, I, I put it on an SD Jesus card Christ. so that I could just drag, take the SD card out and just do it on my computer, so I don't have to mess around with it on the Steam Deck itself. I um, I did it all just with the Steam Deck controls, and I I hate myself, I guess, because I didn't mind it. Also, I, I think I'm kind of going a little crazy with all the, the custom boot videos. I have <laughs> oh, 63 God. now. Why? Do you <laughs> well, the future I'm one, and I'm like, I want that. <laughs> Why do you have 63? I just keep going back to the page. I'm like, ooh, I like that. Download. So good. Ooh, I like that. Download. Ooh, I like that. Download. Nathan, is there like a program where you can randomize which boot video yes. you get every time you turn on day? Yeah, yeah, it is randomized. Yeah, uh, Case was thinking for the tier one. Oh, no, Jason, what thinking. you need to do is what that dude did and just install the entire Shrek movie. What that so dude you're forced do? to watch it before. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, yeah you can't yeah. skip it. <laughs> Why are people the way they are? 
Yeah, you know, want to play a game of uh, Mario Party on my Steam Deck? Great, let's go play it. Okay, let's watch a two-hour Shrek movie first. Huh, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, wait. Yeah. I gotta go all the way. Wait, do I? I just uh, don't know why Just a lot. it's just a lot of sitcom intros. I don't know why. Oh, fuck, I have so much work to do tonight. Low five beats, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let it way over your head. I, I, that happens to me a bunch, especially when I get tired. I, like my, uh, I let my mind easily weigh me down with shit that I need to do. It's like, oh, dude, you know, you, the only reason yeah. why it's so problematic right now is because you're overthinking it. Dude, it's like I have so much to do, which makes me worry that I have so much to do, and then I don't get shit done because I'm worried. <laughs> You know what so the nice you know what's the worst songs. fucking part of feeling that is when I'm writing a script actually because like I can already be seven to eight pages in and then what will constantly weigh me down is like I haven't talked to the, I haven't talked about this part yet or I haven't got yeah. to this part yet and it's like uh and it's like for some reason that just it, it fucking weighs me down despite the fact that dude it's just a, it's it's just one or two paragraphs away yeah I I totally get that I. I... I mean, you've been doing this way longer than I have, but uh, for me, it's like I get into this zone where it's like I like this Zen area, I guess, where yeah. it just it works. Everything I'm writing is work and then I'm not really putting too much thought into what I'm writing. Yeah. And then I just like I hit this hitch where I'm like either I forgot to mention this part in a previous paragraph or I know that I'm about to talk about something that I'm not exactly sure how to talk about yet. And I just zone out yeah i feel that okay yeah, the, there's so many good custom boot videos especially for you downloading some shit. right now <laughs> here i'll make the you jack one and right dexter now. one's one of my favorites wait is jack and dexter one yeah oh i need to find that you just want it's like the uh the naughty dog logo but it said it says steam deck steam deck yeah mm. yeah wait i have an idea for you then have like the crash bash opening I didn't mean to kill that thing with the crossbow, but I did. Oh, you know, that that's a interesting question that I'm sure you've been asked a million times, John. Mm -hmm. um, what do you do to help you focus while you're working? Like script writing or editing? All of the above, I guess. Uh, when I'm script writing, I put on music. Because uh, I can't listen to any sort of spoken word while I'm writing a script because it distracts the shit out of me. Um, I usually, you know what the fun, my, my go-to script music is, no matter how many times I write a script, it's Final Fantasy X. Final Fantasy X mm. soundtrack uh, puts me at ease uh, to write scripts. Uh, outside of that, maybe I'll, I'll listen to some jazz or lo-fi. Uh, when I'm editing scripts, uh, when I'm editing uh, videos, I'm in the compositing part. Uh, that's no holes, but I can listen to anything. Uh, podcasts, right. movies, and other social like that, because I already know what I said in the video. <laughs> All I gotta yeah. do is put <laughs> yeah. the appropriate clips on it. Alright, so this is a shine spark. Um, where the fuck yeah, this one's Why just the spoken word in general? Because, I mean, uh, the Lord said... Bitch, stop editing and listening. <laughs> yeah, bitch! Oh, wait, 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 hold on, wait. No, maybe I'm overthinking this. Uh, I just gotta do it this way. All right, one second. Jason, what was the, what was the, um, site called with all the, the, oh, the videos on it? Steam Deck Repo. Thank you. So, if I remember, there is a, uh, at the end of that hallway that you just shine sparked into, there's a little notch you can shoot out and climb yeah, into. Yeah, I see it, okay. It's just Steam Deck repo, and it's really useful. Thanks. Yeah, I've been on there before. I just couldn't remember the the site name. Yeah, there it is. Also, do you uh, do you also not listen to song with lyrics? No, while I'm writing scripts, absolutely not. Anything that has a spoken word uh, will distract me. Even if it just go eh. No. I mean, if it's like I thought it... you were singing the Mystic Ruins. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is why I just like I write a string of A's and yeah, E's <laughs> in the script. Like, this, this is just incomprehensible noise. Anyway, I fuck with it. I don't hate it, <laughs> but I don't understand. Yeah. I mean, what, like I sometimes I just have these moments where it's like I, I've hung out in this stream while writing my script sometimes, but I it's really a case by case basis. Like I can never force myself to.
This is awful. Yeah. First no. area, like, it's kind of weird that I'm only just now exploring this shit. Like, like, look, I, that's one of the first missile packs I saw in the game. I'm only just getting that shit now. You said you uh, oh. you haven't 100%ed this before, right? Yeah, yeah. So just kind of get bamboozled. Question. Hmm. Since I'm not sure if we uh, talked about it in, like, the full, full detail. Um, what's y'all's thoughts on just all the growing changes with YouTube? That uh, I feel it's kind of generalization. Like, do you want to talk you be more on, specific? Yeah, yeah, keep more specific. The price increase that slated the for premium talks for about premium? yeah for premium. I don't care. Yeah, I I don't because I because I actively do use my premium subscription just to. Uh, um, I'm on a I'm on a family plan right. with my house, and it's the family plan is going up five bucks, which is manageable for me. Not for all accounts, five dollars. Not for all. Wait, what? So new people right now were seventeen ninety nine, and they're going up to twenty two ninety nine. People like me, who started out on YouTube Red family, were fourteen ninety nine, and are now going up to twenty two ninety nine. Ooh. I mean, I, I understand the. Is that per month big, or is that big per year? Price per, per month. month. Okay. Just, uh, get and then, um, like Google Play Music Premium subscribers also got grandfathered into YouTube Premium family. I think they're paying like ten ninety nine, and it's gonna go up to twenty two ninety nine. Yeah. I don't. I so, honestly got uh, Rad Record so, to consider premium a waste because, like, to me, I I, as a as a content creator, I don't feel right about using AdBlock. You yeah, know, um, same here. Like, I same. I refuse to use AdBlock. Yeah. Um, I I want to support. Uh, creators that I actively watch on the channel and I feel if I can do that with premium and ignore as and I'll do it that way and like without getting like too much into my financials um, I, I a, a good size of my cut does come from premium subscriptions um, yeah so it, a lot it, of people do use it well not just that is. you make more from premium subscribers than ad watchers yeah by it's far true. yeah just all the time and at the very least with the price increase going up for family uh subscribers that will at least give a little bit more back to content creators because i think it is just a straight 50 50 uh, split with the revenue uh i must say my piece about youtube premium right now i've been using it right before the 2016 election and i've never looked back yeah. Yeah. If it means never, if yeah, it means that's a very never, watch, yeah. if it means fair. never watching those fucking like ads again, I will pay whatever money. Yeah, I I agree. As soon as <laughs> I, I, once I learned, so but strangely enough, it wasn't the idea, uh, it wasn't the feature of skipping uh, skipping ads that convinced me. It was that I could listen to YouTube videos uh, in the background, in the background, by turn, the background. Or with my phone, yeah, on with the phone off, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, <laughs> if you ever want to look into whether you think uh, YouTube Premium is worth it or not, just watch TV for 30 minutes. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> just watch it for 30 minutes and you will never look back. Not just background play, but YouTube Music is actually a really decent music app. Like, You mm. can actually make playlists with a mixture of actual songs and videos, and it works well. Especially if you listen to a lot of like video game music that's not on... Yeah, but Google Play Music was better. <laughs> it was, better. but you know what? Whatever. I still use like I still have downloaded songs. So, so we have to and um, speed boost, fly shift. But yeah, I mean, I like the the downloading and background videos because whenever I worked Dollar General, you barely got reception in the stores because of the the way that they were constructed. Um, and so I would just many times have whether it be uh, La Noir with SGB or like the late crash stuff. I would have that downloaded and just listen to it while I'm working the the store, almost like a podcast. Oof, no, I don't have enough time to do that. Um, wait, hold on. Can I? S no, I wouldn't be able to do that. Can't you like stop and keep the charge of the? Not US? in a ball form. Not in ball form. Damn. Uh, I'm trying to think. This is a toughy one. Oof. Just barely. God damn. 
Okay, yeah, it was just incredibly tight. If there, was, if, if there was an easier way for that one, uh, I, I would very much like to know the way of that one. Well, you see, you got to go in yeah. a third person. <laughs> Here it is. Cheat. <laughs> Don't clip. Yeah, there, there you go. 93%. I'm still missing. Google Play Music. I've never used it. No. It was, uh, I've used it a couple uh, times. I just hear it's better. It was better back then. I remember, I remember there was like three different generations. There was the original blue black ground, oh, background, which was really good. Then it became the orange version with like the Play Store integrated, which was, yeah. And then there was the final iteration, which was just try to be everything, but flopped immediately. Yeah. And then it just became YouTube Music. Yep. Well, they had YouTube Music and Google Play Music going at the same time. Yeah. And so eventually one had to give. But then again, that's that's nothing new for, for Google, seeing as they did their Google TV cable service and then started up YouTube TV God, and were yeah. running both at the same time and then killed Goog Google TV. Not Google. <laughs> Not Google. Just making sure. I don't think there's anything here, otherwise I would have highlighted it. Yeah. But that shows how Google really doesn't think things through yeah. with the fact that they became an internet company and then were like, we need to sell cable just like the other internet providers. <laughs> no, Google. No, you don't. <laughs> go back to retirement home, Google. <laughs> go, go home. But I live here. God, this is my house now. Uh, is Google's Google Fiber please. still a thing? Are they still doing Google it? Google Fiber is still a thing. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll... and oh my Google god. Fiber. Yeah. That's Are so they still like actively building it though, or is it just a well? We've just got to keep selling the cable as is because we've already built it. If they're still putting out more um, Google Fiber to some areas, uh, but I think they're talking about Google Fi. Yeah, and that's what I don't like that name: Google Fi and Google Fiber. Google Fi being the Google Phone service, the the cell service. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I don't know I only use Google Fi once and that was so I could literally just unlock my phone <laughs> <laughs> well I mean it's technically a use so it's all that counts because to unlock your phone uh, at least at the time with AT&T you had to put in this, a sim card of another company that's in. yeah that's still the case sometimes and so, even if I was going to stay with AT and T, I just bought the Google Fi so I can unlock the phone, flip it real quick, and then buy a new phone. <laughs> Don't wait, Devin. Remember, remember when, when Google, Google was, was a search engine? I remember when it was a better, reliable <laughs> search, search engine, and not just fucking like, here's the Wikipedia article. Yeah. There you and go. Now Google's just a fucking ad company. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Do you remember Ask Jeeves? Remember back in the day? What? Jeeves. Jeeves. Yeah, yeah. Jeeves. Jeeves. <laughs> Sorry, I was eating chocolate. <laughs> Probably Thanks, pronounce Jeeves. it as Giffy, yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> Ask.com. Yeah, yeah. yeah, now it's just Ask. What happened to Jeeves? Jeeves died. <laughs> and then Ask died. Yeah. Oh, wait, let's take it there. What the fuck? Man. <laughs> Ask Jeff. Hey, <laughs> Jeff. 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 What search engines are left over? Just like Google, Bing, and DuckDuckGo, right? Is it Yahoo uh, answer still open? Mm, are you still no, open? that's gone. I thought that, that was, was murdered whenever they were bought by Verizon. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, that's the way they were bought by Verizon. I, I never knew that. Holy shit. I remember that was around the time I think Verizon took Tumblr offline. And, and by AOL. offline, I mean got rid of porn. Yeah, they bought Tumblr, uh, Yahoo, and AOL. And rolled them all into one. And then realized that was a horrible idea. But it's it's annoying because like Yahoo was already trying to get into some sort of like um, monetization scheme by having like annual plans so you can get rid of the fucking ads in Yahoo Mail. And now I keep getting Yahoo uh, emails asking me, hey. Do you want to get a, a Yahoo uh, cell phone plan? It runs <laughs> off the Verizon network. 
No, 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 Jason. They're asking you if you want a Yahoo chocolate milk. <laughs> Yahoo! That's, that's, that's Yahoo. Yahoo. Yeah. Oh. Um, oh my God! It's not chocolate same. milk. It's, it is chocolate. Milk. No, it's it chocolate is chocolate drink. It's chocolate juice. <laughs> it's chocolate hey, it's drink. Like, they legally like, cannot call it chocolate milk. Wait, and really? Why? Why? Yeah. Who has why? Got, who's got the patent on milk? <laughs> oh. Well, no. Yeah, so there's there's uh, legal distinctions where you can't either call yourself chocolate milk or you can't call yourself milk chocolate. Bro, that's if I put chocolate in chocolate kind of milk, I'm still going to call it chocolate. Hey, you know, there's some milk. porn star out there that's like, fuck. <laughs> I was really hoping I could be called milk chocolate. <laughs> that's why you have some chocolate bars. That's why some are just called chocolate bars. Chocolatey bars, not what the milk heck? chocolate. I'm... Oh, yeah, that's like American cheese slices. Oh, my God. Where it's I mean, like made uh, from before cheese we, before products. Before we convene, I got to take a break because uh, we're in this for a long time. We're, 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 Are we're, you finishing the game today? I think I might finish the game tonight, yeah. Because it's been so long since I streamed Dread, and I know you guys were waiting, but, you know, and I'm also... I'm you also are not, very close to the end. I'm also not tired, uh, so I think we're going we're gonna to take a small break, maybe five minutes. Five, ten minutes. Maybe eleven. You also need a warm-up for streaming very long periods of time. True, true. <laughs> no, because normally that, that's not really a big deal for me because... Uh, my mind will just force myself up. <laughs> uh, when I, when we did Pac-Man Fever a couple of years ago, I was up for that entire thing. I did not nap at all for that. And I did not mean to do that, but my mind just did it. So it's like, I don't think I'm going to need that much practice for it. I'm not even playing a whole bunch of games for that. I think I'm only playing two games, technically. I, th I, I think I am also doing two, too. Caucasian chocolate. The Carcassian is this bitch. <laughs> the the Carcassian. Right. Right, I'm going mute. Uh, Calm just still hot though. It's called Caucasian chocolate. Uh, I'm I gotta go have some lunch now, so I'll probably hop off for a bit. All right, take Bye. care, String. Bye, Bye String. I love you. Love you too, guys. Uh, too. It's Mark nice Henry's to see that Twitter is. Mark Henry's yeah. name was Sexual Chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, he was known as the uh, Sexual Chocolate Mark Henry. Man, it's Don't nice to, to see Twitter become an African and American owned business. Wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, Elon Musk is South African. What? Yeah. Yeah. Is he? Yeah. Like he found, his he found family it, got he wealthy it, uh... because he had an emerald mine, or his family had an emerald mine in South America. Yeah. Don't you know he founded South Africa? Oh. <laughs> Just Thanks. like he founded uh, Tesla and Twitter. Tell me more about this guy. I mean, don't. I don't I'd care rather about it. Yeah, I'd rather not. <laughs> I don't I'm really You should learn about it. it. You should Dude, learn about it. I his used dad. to be an Elon simp, and I haven't forgiven myself. Elon Musk invented racism. <laughs> 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 but, no, so Elon, his nationality is African. His ethnicity is. <gasps> and <laughs> Trump couldn't. Understand the difference between those two <laughs> in the damn um, congratulations <laughs> letter. <laughs> it's just absolutely yeah. fucking hilarious. Though. Oh my god! You, you know the funny part? A lot of people don't realize there's a decent amount of people from South Africa, and they don't realize because, like, the creator of uh, Dice Keisha Watari from Guilty Gear is South African, also. Yep. Same really? thing with uh, yeah. Same thing with Freddie Mercury. <laughs> Wait, Freddy? Yes. <laughs> Pretty sure. I think he's. Hold on. I know. Let's see. Freddy, Mercury, not soul bad guy. <laughs> I love how you specifically. No, not soul bad guy. All right. He was technically from Zanzibar. <laughs> All right. Cool. Metal Gear Solid reference. I'm out. I'm done. I'm out. Bye. That wasn't Metal Gear. That was uh, Mario. No, that's not what no, he was talking Zanzibar. about. No, Zanzibar. Zanzibar ones. Yeah. I thought that was like the Mario's just teleporting. Oh uh, no, that was no, no, that's no, not was, what he was, was talking about. Trav. That but was we're me. talking about he was born yeah. in Zanzibar, and Zanzibar land is in Metal Gear. Oh, 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 oh! I just heard the brrrr sound effect. That's I just not heard. the references, you guys. It's Gray Fox. He was from Zanzibar. No one understands <laughs> these games anymore. You know what? You know what? When I come out to stream it, later he's going week, nuclear. <laughs> Go why? I'm wild. I'm breaking. Inside. Oh, a heart oh, of. Travis, <laughs> I never showed you that edit. Okay, okay, the one you showed me last night. <laughs> yeah, 
<laughs> I can check it in a moment. I'm I'm running away from geckos. Hold on. Yeah, no, okay. I can show it to you after the stream because I need to like it's it's a private video. Don't run from geckos. Piss on the geckos. Oh man, those are also a Metal Gear thing. No, I'm playing Fallout. Oh, almost heaven. It's okay. It's the Do uh, those the, the old. Move? No. Do they, they do glow they, though? Do they? Bleed? I fell asleep next to a dead gecko and I started getting radiation poisoning. Dude, that's why you <laughs> eat it. <laughs> that's why, in a nutshell. Did you find the uh, the Doctor Who reference in Fallout One? No. I thought it was. Uh... I did find the cow room though. <laughs> hey. Let's go! Oh my God! What's dropped on my lap? Oh, that was me. Sorry. Why was oh, you? Why are you wet? Oh my God! That's wet. That's wet. That's wet. Why, why are you wet? wet? <laughs> I ask myself that every day. <laughs> What's happening? Why are you what? <laughs> why is everyone talking no, about? No, Gorestein. Come on, why is everyone talking about South Africa in the chat? What happened? Don't worry about it. Elon. <laughs> what about Elon? Is Elon from South Africa? Yes. 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 Oh, okay. Yeah, but I, I made the joke of it's it's really nice to see that Twitter is now owned by an African American business. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I hate how that's technically right. <laughs> hey, give it time. Parmer's gonna be the same. Oh, oh my that's like God, my favorite. Christ. That's like actually my favorite fucking debate. It was like this. Yeah, this white dude from South Africa, and they, they and some and someone was stutter. I was like, dude, that's racial profiling, motherfucker. You were thinking there you had to be black to be uh, African, technically, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> like I got you. The worst part is that they roll it back. It's like, oh yeah, I'm not gonna say African American. I'm like, wait, hold on. Why aren't you gonna say it? <laughs> Tell me. Tell me. Why aren't you gonna say it? I mean, he's about as African American as I'm Hawaiian. <laughs> <laughs> Just because we're born there doesn't mean we're that ethnicity. Okay. Uh, that sounds like a fucking shit Family Guy skit. Yo, is that cool you're drinking? <laughs> oh, Cataracts, there's so much shit. Oh, we're only at 28% in this bitch. I almost thought you said cataracts. Cat no. <laughs> I thought you were talking about that for a bit. Oh my god. <laughs> Can't uh, see uh, shit, this bitch. No, 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 no. Uh, I'm gonna go to the left, because I think I, that, that, that's only a teleporter. God, where the hell are we even go? You Jason go that was way. born in Hawaii. Yes, yeah, so I was born in the same place Markiplier was. And the rock. Hey, how's it going, everybody? My name is Markiplier. <laughs> yeah. Hey, In everybody, fact, I'm Markiplier. Yeah. I was born in the same building as Markiplier. Bro, does that mean something? I don't know. Oh my <laughs> god. <that> means... <laughs> oh my god. I know what that means. It means you're Broly. You were born next to him, right? Yeah. Holy shit, it's Broly! <laughs> Mark I'm of Wire! Mind the age difference. Yeah. <laughs> yes. You just hear Fonzie going, Mark of I can't believe it. Was Jason the birth of 87? <laughs> 97, but okay. <laughs> the birth of 97? <laughs> no, it was the birth of 83, dip shit. Dip shit. <laughs> should have seen it, it's so obvious. There was magic everywhere, man. <laughs> I thought it was the King of Fighters 94. Wait a minute. <laughs> the dream birth. <laughs> I thought it was NASCAR Heat 3. I refuse to believe I'm close to Jason's age. Dude, like, that's the thing that fucking trips me up is when I, like, I, I learned the actual ages of you fuckers, and it's like, I'm like 15, 10 years older than you guys. So it's like, what You're the like fuck? You're like three years older than me. Yeah, yeah, but, you, 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 but I'm not talking about you then. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was just like, god damn. I remember when I first learned about you, because Jason and I, we met years ago. Uh, I was still in high school at that point. Yeah. And I'm like, I don't want to go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> now the world's like, I'm going to jail. <laughs> Dude, like, I, I'm afraid to interact with people who are minors just out of fear that they're like gonna try to trap me and something. Yeah, that, that's like, always... Like, I'm not saying like they try to lure me into shit, I just like, I say something that could be taken weird out of context. Yeah. Yeah. Which I realize saying that out loud uh, does not sound assuring, but... <laughs> and which I just say... I ain't talking to anyone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bold of you to assume I wanna fucking talk. 
<laughs> I don't want someone to hear me say come in a chat and then be like, aha, got him. Bad influencer. You telling my kid to do drugs? <laughs> yes, yes, I am. You got yeah, that out of come. Jason. Most you know how much fucking Jack drugs I have to do to actually survive through these reviews? Come on. Wait a minute. Why did they give me so many missile blocks here? What do I gotta do? Oh. But Jason, uh, isn't there a lot of miners in the sub shack? Yeah, and you see, I don't even enter the sub shack at all. <laughs> <laughs> I let other people handle that for me. <laughs> but that's also why we got a really fucking strict policy when it comes to like NSW shit. Yeah, for that very reason. Sweats. <laughs> Soul Kevin. Oh, God. <laughs> Well, no. It's only a number? I, I, well, you can count the numbers on these bars behind the gel cell. <laughs> uh oh. God. Uh, there's only one time that that was an actually, like, really awkward moment. Hmm. And that was, um... I won't say who the guest was, but we had a guest... Oh, I know who you're talking during about. ...during one of the, the okay. streams. And, um... John had already like left out or whatever because it was a uh, one of the charity streams. Yeah, right. And they're like, "Dude, your voice is so deep. You should get into NSFW voice acting." Whoa. And I'm like, "I just turned 18." <laughs> no. <laughs> and, and then it's just this awkward silence <laughs> for the next several fucking minutes. And then and he did. Like, Jesus Christ. I like awkward silence too. How it feels mm. to chew five gum. Exactly. Uh oh. Which have you seen the it, it was so weird to see five gum ads in um Spider Man Web of Shadows of all fucking games. God. Uh, I forgot what other game had that. I wanna say Tony Hawk. How I know that Transformers Four had beer ads. How often are people told their voice sounds like it fucks? Uh I get that from time to time was it? Um, specifically when I'm sleep deprived. Yeah, same. Uh, my voice right. gets same. in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm Impulse. tired, when I'm tired, like I'm talking maybe, let's say 15 to 18 hours plus without sleep, uh, my voice reaches an octave that I wish I can get to naturally. Hey, I can't do it. Yeah. Uh, and I absolutely love the sound of my voice. Uh, when I'm when I'm when I'm that deep. I wish I could read scripts in that uh, voice, but I can't. <laughs> but I've gotten a lot of compliments saying, it's like, dude, your voice is so silky smooth. And I was like, damn. I, I mean, thanks, but it's not technically my natural speaking voice. Um, Meanwhile, I just have a high pitched voice, and I'm like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I tell people, my voice isn't that deep. Come on. Your man. voice is pretty deep, though. Yeah, it's pretty. Yeah, it's definitely too. the deepest, the deepest out of us, uh, out of us all. Um, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can't go this way. I gotta go around. I mean, that's fine. I gotta. I gotta yeah, comb everything. The English anywhere. script of ghost stories. The English script of ghost story. I don't know what that is. That is an anime that was. Uh, I think of Samurai Pizza Cats, but a bit more uh, raunchy. Like dubbing quality. It was never gonna work between us. Not because <laughs> you're a rabbit, but because you're black. black. <laughs> Man, school principals always look like lesbians. <laughs> what? what? I've never seen this, and now I'm kind of captivated. <laughs> I, oh, Is that I'm also not. a line from it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Good lord. Alright. Uh, I'll find the video if one of you guys play it. Gotta go this way. Gotta go around. Oh my god. <laughs> I still remember the one episode where he was just like... God, there's an 18 minute compilation. You know what? I'm just gonna find the rabbit one. Yeah. <laughs> there should be the white one, or the, uh... There's a couple, that's why. Touch me. Touch me harder. <laughs> <laughs> oh, his reprimands. <laughs> Like, some of the stuff in there obviously did not fucking age well. <laughs> how old is this dub? Like, how, how long is Uh, mid-2000s. Oh, okay. That's not terrible. Nah, I say that, but it's fucking, like, 20 years ago. 
Hey, why are you? Hey, why are you crying? It's because these pajamas are gay. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Let me scan the room just in case. I don't hear, I don't hear the buzzing. And that room is not glowing white. All right, then I'm just gonna go backwards. It looks like a ghost show. Yeah. Power. How hard can this be? All means it broadcasts to all the school, and laid means I'm horny. <laughs> I've explained it six times, and Sakata's waiting. Do you have this down yet? Yes. At four thirty. Hit all. Got it? Ooh, that reminds me, I've got something hard and bent waiting for me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, Mr. Matt is, uh, got, got to request, uh, what is that? It's a YouTube link? Let me see here. Here, let me look at Oh, yeah. Oh, it's oh, a scene. <laughs> yeah, I was like, damn, that's topical. Uh, it, can you turn it up? God! When that wonderful president finishes stacking the Supreme Court, we won't have to. Don't forget what I told you about premarital sex. That's when the story got it. <laughs> this, is like, like yeah. adult, this is like an adult swim shit. Like, what the fuck am I listening to? Oh my so, god. So, want to uh, does anybody want to explain the story behind why it's like this? <laughs> right, uh, we don't know the actual story, though, because unfortunately, theories. the guy that always says the story is a known liar. <laughs> oh, really? Damn. Yeah. Because he changes uh, the story all the time. So the, the the theoretical like answer is like the the company that did the dubbing AD, ADV films I think it was. Mm -hmm. uh, they kind of just like gave him the story. All he had to do was like go ham but keep the names. I think that's all it was because I think ghost stories didn't do well in Japan at all. But they just had the the rights to it. Yeah, the the dubbing was so bad that they just said like we don't care. We we need to finish this contractually just do what you want uh for the it has to start and end the same way as the japanese script and the names have to be the same as the They're japanese same. script that's the Ow. only thing that stays consistent between the two <laughs> it's the same company that did evangelion and uh super milk chan but like the other person on chat that probably knows what that oh, is damn. oh my god you say milk How chan yeah milk chan, chan yeah I that Fonzie. sound that sounds familiar. Can you post a, a, a picture of that actually in the Discord? Uh, I can post the Adult Swim trailer, which is annoying as hell. Sure. Maybe, maybe that's why I know it actually. Uh, uh, let me uh, fucking go. Oh wait, I have to go that way anyway. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go this way then. Actually, no. I think I know what to find. The Belgian waffles one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually kind of hungry. Uh... Oh, you could tell it's good because the quality is shit. Happening. What? You okay, Trev? Uh, I just got a random encounter in Fallout of a bunch of exploding cows. <laughs> oh yeah, no, that that can happen. Um, that would have been cool if it didn't permanently just kill my companion. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Soul Kibble, I know what you're talking about. It's not just an English dub. It is this. It is specifically a BBC dub, done in Europe. Oh, I think I know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Moo, motherfucker. This way. Go this way. Uh, I post the Belgian waffles thing from Milk Chan if anyone wants to play it. That's Fallout 2 for you? Yeah, apparently. <laughs> I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna eat. No, oh, all no I've, I've never seen this. No. It's, uh, it's like... It was like very rare in Adult Swim, but I remember watching that. Uh, 
Uh, actually, no, that'd be faster. Yeah, no, I have to go. Let's see how other places at dead end. I'm not at a point where I'm just looking at my mini map more than I am looking at the actual screen, which is why I'm just like running on the walls and shit. Your secret Yatsura is interesting because it's the same manga that did uh, Ramna and a half and um, Inuyasha. Oh, Ramna. Yeah, that was one of the first. Uh, one of the first mangas I ever read. Which one? Mm -hmm. Manga. Uh, Ramna. Ramna. <laughs> Ramna. <laughs> manga. Yes. Manga, manga one half. Yeah, manga one half. That was which the first one I read. Yeah, which one? Favorite. Manga. manga. <laughs> Yeah, Rama's old. Like, it's really old. I think it's 80s. Yeah, but Ursa Yatsura was before that, and it was like 70s. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it just got a new uh, anime done by the same people that did the JoJo anime. Yeah. Wait, Wait really? Yo, I like mm -hmm. JoJo. So, no, me, no, I don't know. Drop Art. the Krispy Kreme circle. <laughs> 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 Who is that voice? It sounds like me. No, I know that, that voice. No. Uh, God, I just had the uh the voice actors. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna have another. It almost sounds like I'm a, gonna have, a I'm gonna have another fucking thunder lips moment, man. Because I know that voice. Da, 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 uh. Oh. Was he, uh, was that Leo? Because that, uh, Greg Ayers was in the voice in this one. I swear to Christ. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Some of the fucking lines in this vid. Like. <laughs> Good lord. Yeah, the best one is just the rap, the rabbit one. That one's the, probably the one that's. That's the rabbit one's iconic. <laughs> there was a sweat going down my forehead. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I she didn't even finish that sentence. I was like, oh boy. <laughs> I was like, please don't fucking break TOS. Hold on, they gave You're me a teleport. Every they they give me a teleport therapy. This is probably just for like a sequence break if I didn't take it earlier. Or is it just one item? Oh no, I'm back in Gavron. No way, but I already oh. cleared out Gavron. Oh yeah, yeah, I don't need to be here. Yeah, yeah, okay. I guess this is just if I took an alternate way to get there. I need, to, I need. To, uh, I'm, I'm overdue for a playthrough like that, just to fucking like go a co the completely different way. <sighs> I think my cranberry to vodka ratio is lacking. <laughs> I think it's more cranberry in the vodka than I had to you use. You want a sprite? No. <laughs> no, no, oh no. God. It is not time for that yet. No, it's not, not yet. time no, for was no, that. No. Is that was that only for holidays or some other shit? Yep. Uh, Christmas. <laughs> Christmas specifically. Yep. Okay, okay. I thought I didn't That's realize. What? I didn't realize those were holiday commercials. Yep. I thought but someone just really wanted to make it. like claymation LeBron James shit just to sell sprite. Don't we all? No. I know, running in the hospital. That's middle. Okay. The fucking in Spanish. Yeah, that's it. This is really tight. No calling in the hospital, cabrones. Why don't us be so a niño que luce que esta es la primo grado? No, estupidez. Adios, gracias. Dije que no calling. <laughs> just randomly breaks into fucking Spanish. <laughs> well, at least they were able to you know, understand each other, I guess. To get the conversation going. Uh, okay. Looks like we are no. heading cool. here next. No, you want to go there. Oh yeah, no, that one That one can't be played. That's TOS. Oof. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Koopas. <laughs> they said you can't play it. What the fuck? You can't just say that. <laughs> Sorry, I should have. I should have bought Twitter Blue so I could say Wiggler Wednesday. <laughs> uh, Fonz, was it you in this uh, group that played the original Fallout's? Yeah. Um. So you know the centaurs, right? Those like walking meat things. Yes. 
I had one of them just say in a text prompt, Damn, Fallout 1 was really hard. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like uh, you're in like a, a, a developer sort of area. I'm... I'm... So, with the map, um, you... You click on the map and your character just starts walking and then you run into random encounters. And different sectors of the map will give you different encounters depending on where yeah. you are. And I'm in an area that they told me not to go through because oh. it's really fucking hard. <laughs> and if I'm not dying, I'm getting meme shit. Hey, Geekdom, thank you oh, much wait. for the raid. 57. Much appreciated, dude. Yo. Uh, hope, hope you're enjoying yourself, whatever the fuck it is you're doing. I'm uh, currently three hours on the Metroid Dread 100% uh, hard mode playthrough. What is Coop this place? Up. Oh my god, is this another, uh, it's another speed boost area? Crap, have you oh, played, no. uh, what Fallouts have you played? I'm guessing. Well, I know you played uh, one. I've beaten three and four, and I played through a good amount of New Vegas, but I did not beat it. Okay. And then I, uh, I beat one recently, and I'm already on two. Because I really yeah. liked it. Yeah, thank you for the right. Okay. Uh, I appreciate it, man. Um, I got I got to speed boost this shit for how long? Oh, looks like I do it here. So this is on hard mode. Yes, John is playing on hard mode. Yeah, I uh, have so to in order. Is... I have to in order to unlock dread mode. It's not just some dude. Uh, Falero actually has done some good shit. He played Yamcha in the DBZA bridge. Uh, dub. What? Yeah. No, I was going. What the, what giant happened? How did that not break? <laughs> um, he didn't. Roll down. It's okay, it Fonz. I cared about what you were talking about. Thank you, Trav. <laughs> yeah, the real I'm sorry. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, hold on. No, is this a screw attack block or is this a speed block? Oh, it's a power bomb block. It's just like the old saying, "Life's a beach, and I'm the dune who can't sand to watch our crustacean comrades go unprotected by the long beach island arm of the law." <laughs> What? <laughs> Trav, you have no idea how hard I want to try to under understand that fucking no, show. Don't fucking do that. What show? The show where that came from. The guy that was wasn't like me. the. Oh, was it? That was me. Uh, oh so yeah. This is kind of <laughs> yes. hard to uh, not accidentally go into a fucking shine spark. Oh, I'm sorry. Just saying, anyone who's played New Vegas is technically living in a very better Las Vegas. That's not a joke. I, mean, I, like the look I remember the getting to Mr. House in New You've Vegas. You've at least heard that sound clip before. Because, or not that sound clip, but that <gasps> person before, because that's from the same web series as, uh. I think it's time to order a pet pet pe 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 pizza. Hungry. Wait a minute. How do I. Oh, I gotta put this on the other side. Wait a minute. No. Wait, why were they... Is this like a really long-winded puzzle? Couldn't it just a speed boost it under the lava? Uh, do I have enough distance here, though? That's the Wait, thing. hold on. Let me let me take a look at what this you're This one doing. right here? Yeah, I mean, there's a speed booster box on the top. I can't get them from here. I have to go to the other side. At least I think I do. I think I have to... Uh, yeah, you have to come in from the top. From the other top, yeah. Oh, no, no. You need to come in through the top to the right to move the, the grapple thing out of the way. And then complete, like, the speed boost. Uh, yeah, and thing. then you come back down this way. So you're not, like, going from the top down to break the speed boost thing first. You're breaking the uh, grapple hook. I was about to say lightning beam. <laughs> um, yeah, you, you'll get it. I, I know you're smart. Wow, I, I have to break this. And then, oh, but thankfully, I can just go for here and just... Because I already broke Where's this scores? block Because I already block, uh, broke this block earlier. Okay. I, what the fuck? Thank you. <laughs> um, that was really weird. Trav said, holy fuck. Trav said, come. Oh my god. <laughs> well, yeah, I didn't even did. know what yeah. I was saying. Yeah, I was like, yeah, that, that's exactly what you said. I want to isolate that now. I'll put it on the soundboard. <laughs> <laughs> that's how fucking segmented that was. I'll just say a bunch of word and wor <laughs> word. <laughs> word. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> I'll fuck him. Dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun -dun. <laughs> fuck. 
<laughs> I love I love those edits of the, yeah, the Cyberpunk same. trailer. <laughs> In in, New, I in Night City, dun, 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 dun. in Night City, you woke up. Dun, 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 dun. I will so fuck good. him. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know. Okay, this is actually a real question. If I get Cyberpunk, do you think I'll probably? Do you know. like Who immersive sims? We don't know what you like. Yeah, I, actually, mean, I don't know. I, I, actually, I, actually I feel do like immersive sims. Unless someone's played it specifically for themselves, I can't answer that question for you because I, I never had any interest in Cyberpunk. No, well, okay, allow me to rephrase the question. Since with all the Thank updates you. and stuff like now, do you think it'd be kind of worth it to start playing it now? Yes, just play it. I think I yeah, already bought point, it. I think at this point, just play it. If you want to play it, play okay. it. Okay. I bought it. Play it. Yeah. I haven't played it yet, but play it. Got it for ten <laughs> bucks because. Uh, yeah, I literally found it on GOG for like three dollars. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if it's on sale right now. I I doubt it, but. I don't think it ever, I don't think it'll ever go as well as it did with a uh, when Best Buy was just selling them for like dirt cheap, just to get them because they were so overstocked. You have a computer that could run it. Just run. I mean, wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll run. As he loads the gun. <laughs> In twenty seventy seven, what makes someone a criminal? Getting. <laughs> oh, I know that video. <laughs> yeah, where it just cuts off <laughs> at different points with like fucking image macros. <laughs> oh, that, yeah, that's a good video. I like that one. If I need your body, I'll fucking. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I love how that's been making the rounds again. <laughs> Oh, yeah, because of the fucking anime. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, Which I've heard good things about. It's a yeah. pretty good watch. It's uh, Studio Trigger, so same people that done Kill a Kill. Okay, Panty, well, they're going to be doing the new Panty and Stocking, so let's go. Yeah, since they now got the rights back. Uh, yeah. Mr. Bad is asking for a link if you have it. I think I think it's a Twitter post or is it a YouTube video? I found a random YouTube call video. Call him A, call him B. Looks like we have I think it was originally a Twitter post, though. Yeah. You're that's right. how I saw it. I saw I saw it as a Twitter post. So who knows where the fuck it may have yeah. originally come from? Source? I don't fucking know the internet. <laughs> Source? I, I saw it in a dream. <laughs> <laughs> what a thrill! <laughs> oh, fuck! I can't fucking unhear the Better Call Saul version without fucking hearing the trombone. Just. <laughs> <laughs> I hear Tesla, Tasmanian Tiger. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't mean, was just right there. Ooh, my spine. You don't need it. You're right. How do you critically <laughs> miss? <laughs> <laughs> so, um. I guess yeah. I want to preface this with, uh, if y'all don't want to hear my weird Fallout stories, just let me know. Go right ahead. But if you want to hear one, I got a pretty goofy one. Go right ahead. Um, I, uh, so I found out that if you li give your companions drugs, <laughs> they will take them. Yes. Because um, I, I wanted to have my companions hold on to drugs so that I could sell them. Uh, when, uh, when I next find a town, because I, I use drugs once in this game, and I still have the addict debuff, and it won't go away. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't oh, even hard. the funny part. I think maybe I figured it out. Maybe you just gotta eat some cold turkey. Eat I've, cold. There's turkey. no turkey. <laughs> eat cold turkey. Wait, what did, um, what did he get addicted to? Rat X. Uh, no, it, it was Jet, which I found out is the only drug that you can't just get over uh, yeah. naturally. <laughs> I need to find a doctor who can Oops. cure it. <laughs> doctor, uh, but, I need to get rid of this addiction right now. Okay, here, take, take these pills. <laughs> so, uh, so that's not even the funny part. So um, I, uh, I was addicted, so I gave my companion a bunch of drugs to hold on to <laughs> uh, just so that I could uh, barter them next time I can. I get into a random encounter with a bunch of raiders. Uh, so, for context, the drugs that I gave him are ones that give him a, a more move action points per turn. He takes one of those drugs, gives him more shit to do during his turn. So he takes another one. He takes three jet that turn, runs forward two spaces, 
and then gets critically shot in the leg and loses three turns. Oh my god. <laughs> so he just took a bunch of my drugs and then just falls on his face. And I was I just cracking I up. I think it's an important lesson. <laughs> like, I fucking, yeah. like, don't do drugs. I fucking love old school. Did you record it? Or... Yeah, I, I posted it to Twitter. It okay. cracked uh, me up. I, I fucking love old school Fallout because of that kind of shit. I'm just, I'm, Are... I'm having like a a come to jesus moment i'm like oh. like i always heard people <laughs> say like the original fallout games were amazing but i just you know they're fucking isometric rpgs and i was like i don't fucking care yeah once you get over that hurdle and that's all a lot of people don't like old school isometric pc yeah games, it's like i totally get, get it that. i was like that it took me years to finally sit down and learn the game but once i did it's like this this really is better than the bethesda games <laughs> But now your next oh game is the shitty PS2 one, Brotherhood of Steel, right? Uh, oh, right. I was going to do Tactics next. So... Oh, okay. Now we're fucking pixel hunting, because I think I'm only missing one more item in this place. But I if don't see like any, the older Fallouts, try any white I squares, and I'm not immediately seeing any sort of crevice that I have not searched yet. Just ask the police for help. Police? I'd rather not. I mean, that's basically the Federation. Hey, Help! I never thought I'd be happy to see one of those things. Hey, put the donuts down! Drop the Krispy Kreme serpent coat! We need your help here! <laughs> yeah, me too, bud. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's something right here. Where am I? Oh. I just heard the... the, the funny... <laughs> Oh, you missed that one. God damn it! <laughs> I can't. Every time I hear that, I just hear Jerbo laughing. Yeah, same. You know, every single time they have to like match the lip flaps for <laughs> for speaking fast in Japanese. <laughs> they just no, no, no. breaking the scatting. <laughs> oh God! Yeah, that's a line that you probably should not play. Oh man, since we're on the topic like old school Japanese anime, you guys remember Kamari High School? <laughs> no, I don't know what that is. Who are you? Oh my god, it's it was like an over the top like anime, just making fun of anime tropes. It sounds like something Ryan would know. Uh, Hang on, let me post a clip for you. We gotta check both anyway. If we're talking about like over the top anime that was like stupid full of references, uh, Baka and Tess would go really good. No choice. <laughs> 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 As I said, it literally gets up so fast he breaks his, his chair explodes. <laughs> oh god, I hate that someone like added me in the server in this uh, a couple days ago in the sub server. Let's check it out. Crack that. <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> oh fuck, right there. Can you send uh, that to me? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, Kendo Kate, I can never forget Sergeant Frog. My, my wife loves that. Uh, oh, I used to anime. love Sergeant Frog. My yeah, girlfriend loves right Sergeant yep. Frog. <laughs> Sergeant Frog, uh, what's that? Yeah. Anime. Uh, it's, uh, it's, the best way you can describe it is a green small frog trying to take over the world, but he gets distracted by Gundam. Yeah, Isn't that just crazy thing. frog? You would think no, uh, yeah. just invaders. No, he doesn't have a penis. <laughs> rating me. Hey, Super Butterbones, oh, thank I'm you. I'm so sorry, I just said that. Two <laughs> <laughs> Hey, uh, I appreciate the rate. Thank you very much. Hey guys, um, hey. some Kobe Hello, Johnny. Buttons. I review games, and I also do Twitch as a very, very, very part-time side hustle. You do? Uh, yeah, that's why I say very, very part-time side hustle. <laughs> <laughs> My wife uh, watched her videos on the the Kingdom Hearts games, and she's like, "Wow, I really agree with her." Yeah, <laughs> yeah she did be spitting. He's a cool and dude. And fucking, uh, near shit. <laughs> so you should probably subscribe to her YouTube and follow her Twitch. Uh, thank you yeah, very yeah. much, uh, Buns. I appreciate it. Uh, is that the last... No, fuck, I didn't get the last item. Where the hell is it? It's probably... Got a power bomb? Maybe? 
I don't fucking know. <laughs> the bread mother. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. Am I blind? I mean, no. I I'm, am. Like, I need glasses. Not. There you go. What the fuck? It was at this GameStop? <laughs> there is an item right here. Welcome to EB Games. Copy that. <laughs> Copy that. <laughs> I love I, that I, video. Oh my god. Oh my god. I actually had a customer try to say try to act to try to like get me to say oh, that. Wait, wait, wait. Is it, I, oh okay, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Oh, is it a is it a shine spark? It's probably a shine spark. It's always a shine spark when we post game shit. Yeah, it's a, oh no, it's not it's just a mistake. Um, oh, never mind. Oh, that's fucking depressing, man. What what, what is it? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's an altar for all these fucking characters that are dead. Oh, like, actually oh, fucking oh, dead. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> right. I didn't realize what it was. I just saw the tree, the girl, the dog, and uh, yeah, because all of those characters are pretty much dead. Wait, 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 Doug. Uh, the guy from Naruto's dead? Yes, Jiraiya's been dead for a long time. Dude, Rest I didn't peace. know that. Yeah. Yo, spoilers! Yeah, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sh shit. Shit, spoilers for something from like a decade ago, man. I can't believe to this day people are still not over Nina. Yeah. They have every right not to be over with, but like, can't it's still... Her, it's like, I feel like I, I, I'm of the mentality that I can only dedicate my time and patience to like one major anime and that was Dragon Ball in my life. <laughs> like I can't I can't commit to Naruto. Just, even if it, it is probably a better show. Don't I start with One Piece. To one Piece. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, and uh, one, I think I think One Piece is probably the 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 obvious answer, but it's gonna like, end soon. I already I, I don't and, and I don't care. It's just that that sounds Ooh. just like an exhausting undertaking. Uh because that's uh, like I, I feel I feel like the 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 big anime that you are committed to just depends on the generation you grew up. When I was a kid, that was Dragon Ball. Like the generation after me, that was Naruto. And I get uh, for me, the, it was all three. For me, uh, <laughs> yeah. I I mean, if if you're if you're a, if you're a person of culture, then the answer is all three. But it's like it was either Dragon Ball, it was Naruto. Maybe you got one or two Bleach fans. Uh, then you got <laughs> One Piece or My Hero Academia. Yeah, I think My Hero, had, my, my My Hero Academia is probably the the other one. Then you had the JoJo fans, which are like sticking around to the sides, and then they realize, hey, this has been going on since the '80s. No one cares. Uh, my first exposure to JoJo was the Dreamcast game, uh, and this was Same. in the uh, Same. early 2000s. Yeah. And then my uncle showed me the OVA of the end of Part Three. The uh, OVA for me from YouTube memes in like 2008, 2009. Ah, yes, Sprite. <laughs> <laughs> uh, go the Super <laughs> Refresher. Wait, can I God, I fucking love that edit. Or just an <laughs> oil tanker for you. Right now, um, was it the Kaguya sama? That manga just ended today. Oh, I can't go this way. Which anime or manga? Can I know uh, it's it's the Love Is War one that's got really popular the last couple Love of years. Crush yeah. to death. The, the manga just ended today, so interesting. Mm -hmm. I feel like I've heard of it. Oh, is that, as, as much as I like that though, like fucking uh, Japanese Dio just screaming World Roller is infinitely better. Roller, roller, roller! It's like Jesus <laughs> fucking Christ. Also, that's badass, yeah. but still, like, god damn. I, I, I love Dio's voice actor, dude. He's yeah. he's the dad in, in Kaguya-sama. He's the uncle in Isekai Uncle, who's obsessed with Sonic. <laughs> uh, Wait, really? Yeah, yeah, it's the same voice actor. He did oh, a ton god. of anime voices. I'm going! They got his eyes! <laughs> <laughs> All right, we need to... now, my, my favorite quote from the JoJo dub is in part four. For the love of God, man, drop the meat! <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Jason. <laughs> God, I just realized what this is. Thanks, Mika. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you and then kill you again. <laughs>
<laughs> going to kill you until you die from it. I feel so sorry for like all the One Piece fans that just got into that part. <laughs> <laughs> like right when they're like, <laughs> and all they see is just fucking dicks. White. That's all they fucking see. Dick. <laughs> <laughs> they cry from Ace's death literally <laughs> that <laughs> night. They <laughs> see white gear to dip everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I can lift you up. <laughs> lift you up higher. So high. No, no the, the, the other one where it was like safe and sound. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm tearing up. <laughs> God, it's, it feels nice to be in a new place with much better internet now. <laughs> I will yeah. say, I haven't watched the new JoJo on Netflix because I hate what they did, and they're just like, here, have a couple episodes. Bye. See you in a couple months. You'll be back. Well, that's <laughs> just how Netflix handles anime in I general, know. and it's never worked. No. I miss JoJo Fridays. <laughs> I, I still miss the uh, Castlevania shit. We're going to get some more Castlevanias to it. Did you watch the other seasons? Yeah, I watched the other seasons. I'm waiting for the uh, next season. Yeah, they did ruin Flaccid Pancake. We got Vimp Biscuit. Which <laughs> yeah. I get it, but it's still not as good. You'll take it, Ponzi, and you'll like it. This is probably another just alternate. Yeah, I don't need to go here because I already 100% it. Um, yeah, I don't need to go here. Nope. <laughs> Netflix needs to drop on? the binge model in general. I don't know. It depends on what yes I'm and watching. Yes no. I guess it like, depends on what I'm watching. Yeah. Part 6... No, Part 6 is about to be finished. They're, I think Netflix is about to drop the final arc. But, yeah. Yeah. It's about to be Dime for Crimes, yeah. D hey, D4C, it works. It just works. God, <laughs> dirty deeds, done dirt cheap. Copyright. No. <laughs> Bill the X. <laughs> done at a reasonable price. Bill <laughs> X and they're done at a reasonable price. No price. <laughs> <laughs> I still love flaccid pancake. Yeah, flaccid pancake makes like fucks me up. The one that annoys me the worst is because I'm actually a fan of craft work. They changed it to arts and crafts in part five. <laughs> Wait, damn. Really? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> God. Let's see. Okay. Uh, Unfortunately, pancake uh, is gone from the anime. Not yeah. the pancakes. No, okay. I, I'm still wondering what the fuck are they gonna do with Bohemian Rhapsody? Like that's like how, like how the fuck are you gonna go to get away with this shit? Ain't fucking Disney. Where's the fuck is Mickey Mouse? <laughs> 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 Oh my god, when that part goes live, I am going to be on that like a hawk. <laughs> what about worst oh, yeah. company? Oh yeah, that's 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 some pretty bad company. Wait, sure. wait, hold on, wait, 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 worst wait. company! Wait a minute, wait a minute. Or, Heaven's Gate. <laughs> 255 is usually the cap for Metroid. No, uh, it's Metroid. Isn't it 230 in this one? Is it? No, it's 255. I'm at 255, dude. Oh, oh, wait, 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 because I did, I did use the amiibo, did I? Uh, so I, did, yeah. I I have an extra 10. So I should be technically at 245, I think. Oh, is this the part where you got to use the uh, the weird thing? What's the weird Spicy thing? Spicy lady. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, like the, the, like the, the bombs, like in a weird way. Uh, well, I got to use the cross bomb, and then I got to yeah. spam missiles. Oh, fuck. I'm actually going to remember, you can slow down time. Soft and wet, too. The cap with the meal no, was no, 285. No, so they, kept, they, the, kept, uh, damn. they kept soft and wet in uh, All-Star Battle. Oh, did they? I think. I'm pretty sure they did. Oh, yeah, Green Day got changed to Green Tea. That one's a good one. Yeah. Uh, Sa uh, Sanctuary. Uh, Oasis got changed to Sanctuary. Scary Monsters got changed to Frightening Monsters. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Frightening uh, Monsters. Uh, Dinosaur. Change the snow mountain. Hey, Jason. Yeah. I need some context for this. Why does this look like whenever I get like soaked with water? What? Um, Excuse me. This like uh, video. This girl who's just like, washing your foreskin. Like, what's happening? No. 
<laughs> you know what I feel I'm gonna like watch full skin Luigi. Luigi. <laughs> oh jeez. Morty? Yeah, this I don't know what the hell it was. <laughs> it made me fucking laugh my ass off. This is how I feel whenever I get touched by cold water. <laughs> Notorious big. <laughs> so it's not big. It's just big. <laughs> Here, I'll post it for chat. So that way God, I, I remember like how hyped the fucking torture dance was. It's, like people were waiting for it. Yeah. How do we like three episodes for it? They did yeah. not disappoint. They did not. Oh, disappoint. No, they didn't. Hold on. What's this? What's this? Yeah, a, just a large ass string of speed booster blocks. I'm still hoping for pussy control, but oh well. <laughs> what the hell? Wait. What is this? I got a fucking... I broke yeah, all Yeah, buddy. Yeah, you know, okay, uh, maybe it's not so bad. Hold on. Yeah. It's not that bad. Yeah, okay. I, I guess I was more oh, flabbergasted than I was. Yeah, the seven, the seven page Muda was also really good in part five. God, it was so satisfying. <laughs> Dude, it's keeping going. Like, stop. No more speed booster blocks. <laughs> Uh, the, the the best scene in part five is when everyone's beating up the random dude and Abakio just drinks his wine, it just puts it down, <laughs> and then just joins and beats the shit out of the dude. <laughs> I, I, I love that. <laughs> Fuck, only because I grabbed that damn ledge. My favorite part was whenever he rode himself into a corner. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, just the ending. I still have not watched all of Part 5. I kind of just fell off of the yeah, series same. hard in the beginning of Part 5. I don't blame I, I didn't have the, the motivation to sucks. finish Part 5. Yeah. I mean, the best part about Part 5 in the beginning is just Jorno, like, drinking piss, but... <laughs> Literally, that's it. <laughs> I liked it when he made a dude spit out a frog. Wait, why didn't they give me all this real estate? It's not until you get to, like, the real villain of Part 5 that it actually gets good. Yeah. It was me, Austin. <laughs> it was me all along. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Ah, <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. Hey, all. Scott here. <laughs> Did experiment leave? Is experiment here? I'm sorry. Oh, okay. No, uh, he's gone. He's just, he's just bearing witness. <laughs> Uh, Bear witness me. Why did they greatness. give me all that real estate for that speed booster? Oh, wait a minute, because there is a speed booster block right up there, isn't there? Yeah. So I have to wait. No, because what that? What would that matter? Because you did it back. Oh, I did it backwards. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Hell yeah. Ah uh, yeah, speed run strats. Let's go. Well, now I'm gonna keep going backwards. Uh, because I can do it backwards. Oh, fuck me. I'm looking forward to what the fuck they're gonna do with Part 7 and all those copyright names. Because <laughs> it's even worse with Part 7, because it's, st it's like stands, and then actual horses' names, like, named after fucking, like, bands and shit. Yep. What was, uh, some of their names again? Uh, Mundara and Zenyatta, which is technically a dub name. Uh, you got Sandman, so you have Andrew. Oh. Uh, you you can probably call him Sand. You can probably call the horse. Well, Sandman, Sandman was changed to Soundman. Oh, yeah, you know, oh, was it? Horse? I didn't think about that. Yeah. I care about that. I care about that. Wait. I mean, the horses are going to be CG. It's pretty obvious they're going to be CG. Yeah. If they even do it. Realistic CG horses, let's go! No, okay. Scary monsters has changed the frightening monsters. Uh, Sugar Mountain changed to Snow Mountain. Tubular Rills just changed to Tubular. Is there a... Just to make sure I'm not fucking... Yeah, I mean, we already discussed Filthy X at a reasonable price. <laughs> part, eight is, part 8 is also going to be interesting. It's like, alright, cool. You have like more Metallica references. Hell, you even got a fucking uh, Lady Gaga reference in there, too. Yeah. Is there a Lady Gaga reference? Born This Way. Oh, okay. I don't think I can... Oh! Wait, do I have the wall jump? Alright, hold on a second. 
No. Oh, man. All right. So I think what I have to do is I have to shine spark off the slope and then jump off the wall. So born was born this way being changed to going underground. Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> what? So <laughs> that, uh, <laughs> that changes it quite a bit, <laughs> considering the context of the song. <laughs> No, that's not the way to do it. Huh. Okay. No, I'm Look Hawaii is also going to be doing interesting. something wrong. But yeah, I think I just got to get up there first. Like, it's... Like, it's it's doable. Like, right there, I just fucked up because I hesitated the last second. So, whenever you go from the ice and metal platform to the upper platform, don't store it. Just... You can but, use that wall to jump around... So you go left to right to left, and then you can store on the platform that you're jumping onto so you have a little more time. That's what I did at the very least. What, like this one right here? So like, you, you see how you have the part with the, the ice, right? Yeah. Yeah, I just run across there and jump against the wall, keeping my boost. Right. That way I can just wall jump off, and the platform that you're jumping onto, yeah. the first platform you jump onto, that's where I store store my uh boost it's hard to do though because um cause... it's hard to do but it gives me more time like right okay so all right hold on i'm not wall jumping off of that wall though that's the thing assuming i'm even doing this the right way yeah it's not letting me wall jump from that wall You can pocket charge at the top of that thing if you do it right. No. Oh, well, I didn't even hit the fucking... <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I didn't even hit the slope that time. Yeah, um, I'm pretty sure there is a much easier way to do this. Uh, otherwise, I think I'm I'm going to keep trying the method I'm doing. I know it's possible. Like, it's just really tight. Yeah, see, like, right there. Like, I'm pretty sure I made that way harder than necessary, but... Like, I, I had a feeling that I could do it that way. Yeah, the talk about it for it to work. <laughs> you know what's funny? That um, one thing that I really noticed uh, in the last month or so, believe it or not. So I've said time and time again that I can't talk and play at the same time. But when I'm describing my actions and playing the game, I have no problem doing that. And I don't know exactly how my mental process works in regards to that. Like, trying to carry a conversation to me is really fucking difficult when I'm playing a game. Because my brain cells are shared between the conversation and what I'm currently playing. Both falter, because I'm only half paying attention to the conversation and only half paying attention to the game. But when I'm describing myself, as if I'm, like making a live stream walkthrough I don't falter nearly as much and I don't know why I think it's because I'm speaking matter of factly that's even a word I don't think it is and I'm wondering if that's like a there's a proper term for that transcending <laughs> Tran transcending to where yeah. my uh -huh. fucking bedroom <laughs> <laughs> Into I mean, your mind. A, there is a stand named California King Bud. So. <laughs> yeah. Another goddamn speed boost block. Don't forget that Jesus Christ is a stand user. Yep. yep. Kind of. Was he the stand the of the first cross? first JoJo. God. No, he, he was God's stand. Oh, he was God's stand. Okay. I thought it was like the cross that he was nailed to with like his fucking stand. It was like, you fucking idiot. You just made him more powerful. Just like thinking of like that one Jesus fighting game. <laughs> Oh, war gods? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I have come to repay your sins. Jesus Christ. We talk about it and it shows up in the fucking recommendeds right now. Is the fucking <laughs> Warcraft movie. 
Hey, what does that have to do with Jesus Christ? <laughs> Don't worry about it. No, no, we there's something that makes you say Jesus Christ. Movie and Dungeons and Dragons movie. There's something that makes you say Jesus Christ. Okay. Love, love, the luck. Man. Is there something here? Is it probably there? Probably here. Yeah. No, it'll something. be changed to like, like extra. <laughs> <laughs> song is this? It is... There's a bunch of rooms Commander Yarmark. I can see King Nothing oh, being renamed to King Gunty. I really hope they do keep I Am A Rock, though. I Am A Rock! I don't know. What's God, Stan is Jesus Christ Superstar. <laughs> 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 Wasn't that a musical? I think that was a musical. Yeah. Jesus Double Plus. Done by the same dude who did Cats. Oh, okay. Let's go! Okay. Damn, I learn something new every day. Well, is this not gonna break? Let's just say. Nope. Nope, it's just a little crevice. For some hey, reason, man, too, I bro. Still love Spanton's theme, man. It's so fucking good. There's a whole ass thing I You just like oh, it because shit. you're a salesman. Yes. Maybe. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I like how Spanton relates to me as a retail worker. <laughs> okay, I thought you were about to fucking play Seabat or some shit. <laughs> okay. It is! <laughs> no. Yes! Oh, yes! That's <laughs> <way before. laughs> now you're a big shot. <laughs> I, I, I was I was fooled into like, I hate how that's becoming the new fucking Rick Roll for the record. Uh, I was I, I was fooled into thinking I was linking a FNAF jump scare and it was just him humping the camera to <laughs> the <of> that fucking <laughs> beat. <laughs> Wait, why are you looking at Freddy in the camera? Uh, because he I'm just not said why. I'm not in charge of what gets posted in the meme channel of my Final Fantasy 14 raid Discord. <laughs> yeah, I link you. Remember, I posted that the other day on yeah, here. That's, that's last true. night on here. <laughs> <laughs> the fact the girlfriend recognizes the thrusty. <laughs> my God, like we, uh, I first so learned funny. of that song. And Nora and I, we went. To, we decided to have a romantic date night at a golden corral. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and I gotta tell you, if you want, if you want the most whelming <laughs> buffet experience you ever had in your life, you go to the golden corral. Uh, but uh, we ended up listening about learning about that song there, and Nora and I were just losing our shit, and people were staring because <laughs> I can't imagine. <laughs> The poor woman that had to deal with two, two years, years of being fucked with that tune playing in the background. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I, I have the actual. Vegeta! <laughs> <laughs> That's the song, by the way. That's why I play on my soundboard every once in a while. That's the song. Imagine, uh, imagine getting rhythmically fucked to this song. I don't like, understand I, the rhythm, though. You have, I, I, the, yeah, the rhythm's right there. I know, it's so weird. <laughs> Have you heard so, the uh, the the KK the KK slider version of that? No, I've not. Please, I need it. Did I post it here? Stop, John! You're turning me on. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're beating the shit out of Vegeta. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> DVZ Super had it for one. Of, they had a lot of uh, that artist songs for um, their bumpers. I have to log into Twitter to actually fucking find it. What are you trying to find? You can't get uh, can't, can't see that, yeah. Okay, I'll... Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's absolutely hilarious, because it's like, fucking... On the next episode of oh my god. Super. <laughs> Is that real? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Dragon Ball Super tonight at 11 on Adult Swim. Oh no. <laughs> and the 
girl is just thinking she's just gonna watch some innocent Dragon Ball Super on Adult Swim that night just has a fucking PTSD episode. And then the guy that, uh, looks to his girlfriend, raises his eyebrow, be like, yeah, I put the Who's the guy that did that <laughs> experiment that made his dog salivate at the ring of a bell? But he, here's the thing though. That was late 2019. So if that poster was a Dragon Ball fan, the timeline matches up. <laughs> <laughs> he, this, he most likely Pavel, heard the you. song from that promo. <laughs> oh, the, apparently the, the song the song also appeared in uh, Workaholics, if anyone remembers that Comedy Central show. No, I don't think I've ever seen that. Not really a Comedy it Central It was like... Show. Yeah, but it was a comedy center show. That's how I that's how I heard about the song before because I recognized the song. Yeah. Uh, did it, I, I'm pretty sure I mentioned that me and my wife did it to the song, right? <laughs> no, nice. No. Oh, okay. now I do. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, All right. no. So I'm so me and my co- so me and my coworker, uh, we we were we were listening to these guys called Internet Today. They covered the news on the internet and shit like that. They covered the Sea Bat Saga. And I'm like, all right, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to try it. My God. She didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, nice. because otherwise she would have just said fucking yeah. no to your face, dude. <laughs> so, so, so what happened was, like, you know, we, we start getting it on. I turn it on. And then immediately I hear no. And then I got sent to the couch. <laughs> 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 Damn the fucking couch! Like <laughs> it didn't even just end it there. Like no, you got banished, <laughs> my guy. Dude, dude, no, 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 like, no, 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 holy no. fuck! I, I, I remember when Fonzie told the story on one of my streams. He actually got got her to come over to this to the actual fucking call, and she said <laughs> no. <laughs> so at that point, what you do is that you just play this, but at half speed and like half the pitch, <laughs> as you're as you're slowly making your way to the couch. <laughs> <laughs> all right it looks like i'm only missing one more item i don't oh, know where this fucking thing is at uh it is pr- also probably actually there's a whole ass thing i did not explore right here it's probably there um okay there. we likely gotta go all the way down there doghouse speed run any percent <laughs> uh well, okay. wait is that a thing i can't find it's the uh, kkc bet yeah, hang on, I'm gonna try and look at the little fi see that. I fucking hate humanity, man, because every time I hear KK, <laughs> like, every time I fucking hear the first two letters of KK, so I'm thinking someone's gonna talk about the clan. Yeah, I was like, no. I, I, was I like, have, like, no. this panic reaction. Yeah, I have, like, this fight or flight reaction. It's like, no, they're just talking about the dog, dude. I'm oh, fucked, though, bro. if the dog is part of the clan. <laughs> Bad dog! <laughs> oh, man. I found it. Here we go. Uh, Fucking gargoyles uh, fell actually, off, that, that, actually, Bill, whenever the, they the, introduced the clan. The spoil that, but like, I'm gonna spoil a joke. That's actually a, a joke I make in my DK64 video because one of the bonus games is Crazy Kong Clamor. It's spelled with all K's. <laughs> uh, so it's, it's, it's a very, uh, <laughs> oh no, not Ku Klux Slider. <laughs> He has no style. He has no grace. <laughs> uh, I, found, I found KKC, but I posted on the Discord. Okay. I'm ready to fuck. <laughs> Is that the thrust? <laughs> yeah. But now he's thrusting, yeah. <laughs> I hate <Yeah>. it here. <laughs> okay, it's not there. Where the fuck else can I look? All right, Jason. I love how like last night we were talking like about like four chan stories, and then all of a sudden that video popped up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. I still haven't watched it yet, but I was just like, I I've been there. I saw the whole entire thing firsthand. <laughs> Is it here? I have like the exe for Tower Shoujo with me still. I still need to play it. It's a fun dating sim. I always went for the amputee. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Slender <laughs> plays worst song ever is asked to leave the island. Nah. <laughs> uh, hold on. 
Wait, what the fuck? No, hold on. I gotta, I gotta actually study this shit because I don't have an, I don't have an actual map of reference, and I don't want to. I want to find this shit myself, or until I give up and ask you guys for the fucking answer. Johnny, it's right there. No, but it's inside your heart. I will in your heart. heart. <laughs> <laughs> you do. <did. laughs> Same idea, different execution. Yeah. Yeah. What is, what is this about amputee? I'm not elaborating. Oh, I have to pee. <laughs> Actually, uh, in fact, I'm not gonna elaborate. <laughs> uh, because John has streamer mode enabled, uh, Vaughn's left the chat. <laughs> Welcome back. Uh, oh, wait, hold on, wait, where, where? Oh, 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 is it just? Oh, monkey. Oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> I don't have my soundboard up. <laughs> no, I can't shoot that from here. Wait a minute. Try it. Wait, wait, do no, it on the top. No, I think I have to do it from here. No, I can't, because I can't reach it there. No, with that, dude. Wait, can you just, like, aim up to the side? Like, at an angle? Like, from here? No, because this thing's too narrow. No, like from the middle, and then just like aim at like the top right corner of the screen or something. Maybe if I like shoot here. Okay. Yeah, like it, I, I would have to take care of that one first. Right. Okay. God, I'm gonna have that song stuck in my head now. <laughs> it was me, Sonic. I made the Manimate Rouge with fewer sexual features so that you wouldn't be horny, reducing your blood flow to make you a millisecond slower. Slow enough for me to kill Elise. Wait a second. Wouldn't sexual arousal draw blood away from my brain and legs? How does that make sense? Chaos control. Love it, doctor. <laughs> Love Kaiser. Uh, Yoink. The fucking reverse slide. Like, the, the original one still makes me laugh. Are right? you fucking jerked Barry off? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, That's never, right. <laughs> did you not hear that one? Yeah, I've never heard of it. Uh, play this one for Linky if you can find it. Yeah. Okay. Easy. <laughs> All right. Um, global marker. What else do we have left? Ferenia. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, just two more areas. Uh, Ferenia. Is there a warp to Ferenia anywhere around here? That's for Galvaron. Oh, right. Oh my God, it's all the way up here. Okay, never mind. No, I'm not going to. <laughs> they play copyrighted music. Oh uh, shit. Oh, you can still post it. I can listen to it. Yeah. I don't know why. You know, I keep um, it, it's actually funny. We we're talking about like copyright music during the Sonic Hacking contest. So Twitch did not flag any of my vods for the Anamanaguchi music. YouTube though was frame fucking one on that upload. Told you. Yeah. Um, and I, I found that so weird. That was very weird. So I think oh. what was it? What was the Sonic VR part? I think it was part two or three. Uh, yeah, monetization was disabled for that one, which is sad. I mean, those videos don't see much views anyway. The Sonic Hacking Contest files never do. But, uh, still. Uh, some pocket change that I'm missing. Oh my god, uh, part okay. Uh, for the record, part 5, I think, should be going live tomorrow. Because I know, like, part 4 is, uh... Look, the, the last 4 were updated uh, consecutively, but part 5 is the odd one out. Yo, what shout out to part, part five. about to come out soon. Honestly, my only regret with the Sonic Hacking Contest this year is that I was clearly so fucking tired by the end of it. Oh, yeah. Like, um... Yeah. I really hope by next year I don't got so much shit happening at once so they won't happen again. Yeah, like the sudden trip to Hawaii. <laughs> 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 well, when you put it that way. Oh, dude, like, I, I still remember that day where you're like, uh, so... I'm going to Hawaii? Yeah, I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah. It's like, oh, <laughs> when? Uh, next week. Oh, really? When? Next Monday. But well, we're doing the the thing now. I was <laughs> You're gonna shocked be... as you are. <laughs> and you had to do an interview? Come on. No, the interview I didn't know I was doing until I was already there. Uh, they they uh, we were in the middle of the gameplay session, the first gameplay session, and uh, Katie 
uh, pull me to the side. It's like, uh, Itazuka has an open spot for Itapi if you want to do it. And I was like, I'm probably never going to get a chance to do this again. So I was like, yeah, I'll take it. Uh, I don't have any so, questions, ready. <laughs> so, but uh, um, first question: uh, What's your sex life? Yeah. No. Like, first question: Can I get a refund for Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> no. Uh, can I get a refund for Sonic 06? No. No. Uh, <laughs> Oh, well, to boy. be fair, I think you're like the only person to actually get like something meme worthy of him with the middle finger. <laughs> <laughs> Unintentionally, so I did notice it while I was editing. I was like, "Holy shit, he's pulling, totally pulling his fucking middle finger." All right, all right, all right. All right, oh, all right. I can all right at least right. play this one for you, Linky. Minded Barry, so quick and oh, yet so these. slow, <laughs> just the same. Have you not realized it yet? I realized what? What are you talking about? <laughs> really? Oh my god. Your arch nemesis is a time traveler and you've yet to put two and two together? Think, Barry, think. What are you babbling about? <gasps> no. You. you no. Ah, you figured it out, have you? <laughs> it was me, Barry. I was the one my who mother. expired your milk. <laughs> <laughs> what a bastard! What a bastard! <laughs> God damn! I love the part later when he's like, "No, you killed my mother." What? No! I, what? No! <laughs> what kind of monster would do that? Uh, how do I get up here? Did you really think I came all the way here to tell you that? You think I would stop at something so trivial as that when you and I both know what I'm capable of? No, you did. You bastard. <laughs> How does it feel, Barry, to know that I forever changed the trajectory of your life? That it was I who Murdered ruined your credit? <laughs> Damn it, Barry. <laughs> it was I. I was the one taking your bills and delivering them a week late, slowly decreasing your credit score until now it is suboptimal. I hope you didn't plan to buy a home in the next five to ten years. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, you got me. That one was definitely, you know, a, a bit worse. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, like, that is life altering. If someone fucks with your credit, <laughs> like, it's hard to recover from that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah like you, have you done yeah. that? <laughs> have you fucked someone's credit? I'm not gonna say yes or no. <laughs> oh, you just—you might as well have said yes. No. Oh, this fucker! This fucker gave someone the GameStop credit card, didn't you? <laughs> dude, that actually did it. Da, 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 no, 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 dude, I, dude, fucking. Like, when we were supposed to sell those things, my boss looked at me and said, we're never going to sell one of these. He sold one of them, and... Right oh, my now, God. Fucking... If only my fucking Macy's employer was that generous. Because I, I, I worked at a Macy's for one whole season, uh, Christmas of 2008 or nine or one of, one of those fucking years. And they, they said, you got to push this fucking credit card on everybody. And I was like, fuck you, I'm not doing that. Because I don't like doing that to... I don't like being the recipient. It's like, why the hell would I do that to anybody else? And that's why I only walked one season at Macy's. God, I don't blame you. Now, imagine no. working at a retail shop where the whole world... Like, the whole shop is based around credit. <laughs> and you had to push it to everyone. Listen, even the, thing, the ones the that, that are... The thing that fucked me up. If you're shopping at a Macy's... A Macy's in Center City, Philadelphia at that... You already likely are a high roller. And most of my customers for while Macy's? working there. Yeah, for Macy's. Yes, but for, for Macy's in Center City, Philadelphia specifically, I, I have to stress that. Because there are other Macy's like in a, like on the boulevard or some other shit. Most of my customers that I've interacted with in Macy's during the Christmas season were buying like items seven to $800 at a time. Jesus. They already have credit cards. I don't think they need another one. I think I'll take this credit card now. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> but no, um, like, to be fair, we stopped doing the whole GameStop credit card things like years ago because a lot of people were basically not happy with GameStop. And I had one customer at our GameStop who actually got so much in debt that he actually had to sell his car <laughs> for it. Jesus. I'll and I didn't. All because of the GameStop card? 
Well, yeah, because he was basically uh, putting money down towards like new systems and all that sort of thing, and he couldn't pay it back. So they basically had to repo the car. If I recall, the interest on those credit cards were fucking stupid high too. Yeah, the uh, uh, the interest, the the APR, uh, especially, uh, Mm -hmm. is what really fucks you. Like it's 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 funny because like you can make like a, a above average payment. Uh, and then you check your statements later for like a credit card, and it's like you, you just get a random fucking one hundred thirty six dollar charge. It's like what the fuck is this? It's like no, that, that's the interest, dude. Like that is just the interest of the card for having that thing. Yep. Uh, I think the, the worst sort of interest right now. I've ever seen is where like uh, a person was like past due on their their cell phone bill, and they're just you know screaming and yelling at me. Just turn it off. I don't care. Just cut it off. And the, the, the way that the, the phones work is that when we do press that button to cut it off, it cuts it off at the end of your bill cycle. If today is the last day of your bill cycle, my line with you's dead <laughs> immediately. <laughs> and that's exactly what fucking happened. And he still had, you know, like $900 left on a fucking phone. <laughs> Damn. So either you pay your bill to get it cut back on or if you ever try to get service with the company or hell uh if you don't pay that pay that bill and pay that phone off within like i think six months it goes on your fucking credit <laughs> so jesus christ good luck buying a house at that point i mean who the hell is buying a house though in this economy anyway although i say that and i really don't want to fucking be renting anymore in my next place because like spoiler warning this ain't my final residence either <laughs> you know but it's like I really at one point want to settle down in a house, but yeah. Yo, I got a house for you, Johnny. I just moved out. You can no, have it. I'm fine. I, I don't want to live in Kentucky. <laughs> I, don't, God, I don't want your no. house. The fucking <laughs> houses <laughs> here. The the credit card that we would give at my work, the APR was like 37. It was my God, stupid high. Yeah, no, because the whole thing we you the whole target for that shop was Hispanic minorities who have no credit. So. But they want to buy fancy shit, you know? That was the whole point of uh, the store that I worked at. So imagine always like getting people who like barely make their ends meet and they're buying like 70 inch TVs that are worth like almost two grand. It's it was awful working there and just seeing the shit that like I sold people because I had to make like the color for the week. Yeah. Oh god. Um not someplace I worked at, but uh, let me get the name of it. Electronics Express. Fuck that company. I absolutely hate it. Uh, quite, quite explain, yeah. They they overcharge you for everything. Like everything. Let's see here. On their website, real quick. Keep fucking doing that. Because like they like to scam you too, and it, I don't know, it just it sucks. So like, don't ever get a credit card. <laughs> a Nintendo Switch, a regular Nintendo Switch, with the Rabbids Kingdom Battle and Just Dance is four ninety. Oh That's fucking! You guys remember the deal. fucking like bundles that I that I had to sell? Yeah. Yeah, and how fucking stupid expensive they were, and how they came with a fucking shit chair. Yep. Uh, that was fun. Yeah. And, like, so they have a Switch Lite. Guess how much the Switch Lite is? For and comparison's that's... sake, what's the regular MSRP for it? $200. Uh, $200. Was it? No. $250? Wait. No. No, it's $200. It's $200. Wait. Okay. Wait, $200 for a Switch Lite? Yeah. Okay, Switch yes. Lite. Switch Lite. I'll take it. Uh, go ahead. So, oh, the yeah, price right, right. for a Switch Lite at a at Electronics Express. Buy it now, by the way. It is currently 20% off. So that brings it down from $250 to $200. Mm. So they try to masquerade it. That's a good deal by making you think you're actually saving money when the fact that the original price is overcharged anyway. Yep. Yeah, that's scummy. Mm -hmm. And they do that with all sorts of things. I saw them do it with a TV, and it was still like 30% over MSRP. I mean, doesn't Amazon with, do that too? It, sellers can do that on Amazon, but Amazon heavily discourages it and doesn't like prioritize them and the algorithm and shit.
in my country, that's illegal. Yeah. If only Not it was America, illegal though. here. Yeah, I was gonna say, illegal <laughs> country has standards. Oh, say, can you see? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> It may be like illegal in your country, but at least here in America, I have the right to be randomly shot by a police officer. <laughs> oh, Just as and God intended. Here's the best part about Electronics Express: the very first fucking thing that shows up on their goddamn website that I see is a credit card. Oh boy. <laughs> Get our credit card now. So it's okay, Jason. I'll buy a credit card from you. For six months promotional financing. <laughs> <laughs> Could you slow down time in this one? Or am I thinking of the other game? No, I'm thinking of Samus Turns. Okay. Because that game didn't have a speed booster. I, and I, love being, I love being stuck in the middle of nowhere. I'm stuck with a cup of noodle, a box of RC... Two bags of Pop Tarts and a piece of macaroni. Are you, are you uh, in fucking college? I am in somewhere, like, I am at the edge of Oregon, like, right in the corner between uh, Oregon and Washington. And the nearest, like, grocery store is about, like, a 45 minute drive. I'd Yo, it sounds I'd, like. I take it. <laughs> if, I was, if I was down bad that much, man, I'd fucking take the drive. Wait, guys? Yo. Yes. So I'm, I'm looking at like information for the card and shit, and they have like these little drop downs so you can see like benefits of it, fairer than traditional credit cards. Da 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 da. Sure. And if you look at the drop downs, it's all in Latin. <laughs> oh, give that shit to me. I can, <laughs> Excuse I can me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so is off behind this? <laughs> what the fuck is the heart of Sabik? <laughs> I am in the west corner of Oregon, so like right at the edge of like where the water is. <laughs> is that Laura Ipsum? <laughs> <laughs> That's literally how it starts. <laughs> that is literally the Fuck first trying to do two the words. Latin <laughs> Alright, where, where, where is this? Where's the Latin? So uh, like click on like the, the benefits of a firm. Uh... Oh, what the fuck? Lauren Ibsen, the Lord de Amir. Yeah, that's just the fucking... That's like the little... Someone didn't fucking film the text box in Photoshop. Yeah. That's like default like, text. Yeah, that's just literally... That's just literally <laughs> that's default text. No one could be... Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah, Lauren Ibsen's like basic placeholder. Yeah. Yeah. It's what pops up every time you, you, you generate a new text box in Photoshop. The text box they shows itself up with that fucking text and shit. Yeah. shit. <laughs> Latin, the land isn't even real in Lorem Ipsum. It's deliberately designed to be fake. Bland Dula. Quere bigur, ultrise, en, nec, odio, conceptor, condinemta. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. It's better. Omine es requiem. Smack the hell of a wooden board. I I still remember some of my old I, I, I still remember some of my old Latin uh, that I learned from my choir group back in when high school. You know No oh my god. Like I, I'm pretty sure I've shared this story before, but my, my middle school was so low budget, our music class was like classic Beethoven and fucking indie underground rap albums. Wait, what the fuck? Really? I'm not kidding. I, I am not kidding. And it's like, I enjoyed them. But it's like, it's one of those things in retrospect is like, man, they really didn't give a fuck about us. <laughs> Damn. All I want to say is that they don't really care about us. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's like, yeah, at least give us that one. At least, so, you know, just, just say it outright. I would respect the honesty. <laughs> <laughs> Any you can remember off the top of your head, I cannot. Or it was so long ago. Middle school for me was in 90. Was It was uh, between 2001 and 97. 
Ah, oh, the best, the best era of King of Fighters. <laughs> High school for me. High school, um, computer science two. So you know, advanced computer science. Yeah. And we pull out a fucking book explaining the magical worldwide web will change everything oh three to four years from now. <laughs> Man. <laughs> This book is right. <laughs> on your mark. Get, can you put that on? Can you put that on actually? On your mark. Get set. Riding on the internet. Cyberspace oh, no. set you free. <laughs> Hello, virtual reality. What song is this? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so. Oh! <laughs> no, 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 no. It, it, it yeah. sounds familiar to me, but I'm just trying to remember what it's from. I grew up on the thing like virtual insanity. <laughs> no. <laughs> Did you real quick? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm about to say, my third grade, we did not use recorders. Uh, yeah, we're playing to the end, Doey. Uh, because we're almost done with the cleanup, and all we got left is uh, Raven B. I love recorders. They're my, they're my favorite thing to do in uh, in Ghost of Tsushima multiplayer. Every time you win, celebratory hot crust buns. <laughs> John, this is for you. On the mark, get set. Okay. We're riding on the, on the internet. internet. Cyber set you free. Hello, virtual reality. Interactive appetite. Searching for a website. A window to the world that you get online. Take the spin now you're in with the techno set. You're going surfing on the internet. Jesus. Oh, wait, did I just saw a white flash on top of that little save area? I can't believe. Oh my god, that's what Mark Zuckerberg wants to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what he first heard. Now you're surfing on the metaverse. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah, right there, right there. Where, where, right with the, the purple triangle in the middle of the map. The purple triangle? Oh! Right there, right, yeah, right there. Right I there. didn't even yeah, see I just, that. Yeah, yeah I just... <laughs> wow. Best daily saying, now with legs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that jingle's pretty old. That jingle, that jingle's about... I think that jingle is from the 90s. Hey Johnny, yeah, how much to ha how much to pay you to have a remix of that song on your channel? Whenever you just load up the what intro, the, what the your fuck? yeah, just put that as your intro now. <laughs> See, you were born oh, in in like the internet space. I was born in the cyber chase. <laughs> <laughs> when I was young, young the home. only browsers that were available <laughs> were Internet Explorer and Netscape. Netscape Navigator. Uh, <laughs> Now, granted, that is the earliest I can remember. This is before I had internet at home, because back then we had AOL. We had America Online. AOL, uh, net zero. Yeah. No Triforce, not Scooby doing the Cyber Chase, just the show Cyber Chase, the one that had uh, Doc Brown and Gilbert Gottfried. What's happening? Do you guys remember <laughs> net zero? Yeah, I remember it. <laughs> yeah, that was a thing. Wait a All right, I can't power bomb this because otherwise we won't have a phone. No, actually, wait. No. Yeah, you can power bomb it. No, can just no, because I, I need a foundation to step on to pull the gravel block out. I can't do oh, that. Yeah, in, I can't do that in midair. God, I remember the stupid ass AOL discs. <laughs> the ones they send you every month. Yeah. Yes. Like you know, th those guys went through Toasters. updates really fucking fast. Like at <laughs> at some point, it was like, all right, we got AOL 2.0. All right, cool. Like a month later, we're AOL 3.0. All right, well, what the fuck couldn't you do 2.0? That you have to do a 3.0 and a whole new damn trial disc, dude. You can still buy AOL CDs on eBay. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah. AOL version four gold, a hundred free hours, nine dollars. <laughs> can it still be? Re oh, what is this anime looking fucker? Hold on. I hate Hold that on, AOL what? still a thing, actually. Uh, it's just a, it's just a website now, I think. Yeah. What is this? I don't mean to keep AOL 8.0. What, like, what, what, at what point did they stop? Like, like when did the AOL service discontinue? What version were they on? Um. Uh... Oh, what the fuck, dude? Oh, I'm getting my wires crossed. Like I'm, I'm flustered. One second. All right. Why just, are you rolling into a ball? Hey, well, is owned by Verizon. Well, they were also owned by uh, Warner Brothers, early. Time Warner, right? For a time, where it was a yeah. uh, well, Time Warner. 
throughout the no, mid-2000s. You, you can't do a power bomb in pure, because otherwise uh, this foundation will be destroyed and I can't pull with the gravel beam. Um, no, the thing is that I have to be charging this. Why do I keep on rolling? Stop on rolling. Yeah, it's like, it's dropping a cross bomb here. Uh, and then getting back up here, standing here, and then pulling the gravel block out. We're going to be here for 20 minutes. The problem we? is I keep on rolling. I don't know why I keep on rolling. Yeah, see, like, I didn't unroll there. Keep rolling, rolling, yeah. rolling, rolling. What? If AOL's now original chat rooms continue to be accessible through AOL desktop gold, and some rooms remained active during peak hours, that chat system was shut down on December 15th of 2020. God bless it. For the AOL chat. Jesus Christ. I uh, remember fucking uh, Microsoft Messenger. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Do you I mean remember, MSN? Uh, I remember, I remember from yeah, AOL, MSN uh, Messenger. Yeah. AOL is the messenger was the first chat client I ever used. That's where I got my first breakout. Um, <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry. Here. <laughs> God, I remember back in high school, or I think it was like early or late middle school, early high school. I was dating a girl. Like it was like, yeah, I'm dating a girl. Yeah, here we go. And we didn't hang out too much because she lived like way far away from my place i live like in the countryside and then like one day she's just like messaged me on msn and be like hey i want to break up i'm like yo okay <laughs> oh my god um yeah my mom still uses aol she still has an aol email it's the same one she's actually had for over 25 years at this point i want to say i mean it makes sense yahoo runs the aol emails all right, we're done. Um, with Ferenia, now we gotta go. <laughs> no, 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 no. She was a real yeah. girl from my school. She was not an FBI agent. Uh, <laughs> although, like, looking back, like, because when I was first getting accustomed to AOL Instant Messenger, uh, God, I was only maybe 11, 12 years old. Uh, and I was hitting it up with this one girl who was probably 10 years older than me. Jesus and, Christ. and looking back, I'm glad I didn't pursue that relationship because I could have got that girl in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> or you could have been dead. <laughs> yeah, I mean that too. I mean, assuming it's a, assuming it was a, a mutual relationship or some other shit, but I could have gotten that girl in trouble. Uh, Every time I think of like old instant messengers, I think of that episode of South Park with Nambla. <laughs> oh. I need to go to. I need to go to Elon next, but I can't go to Elon from Ferenia, so I have to go to oh, Gafora first, and then, or Galvaron, sorry, and then go to the right. All right, we're almost done. We only we only got uh, two areas left, and one of the oh. uh, and one of the last areas is one of the, uh, the, the last one. So get the fuck off of the door, my guy. Remember Yahoo Music and like the uh, the days of having uh, music blogs, music blogs. Yeah, by uh, either using Yahoo Music for their like the, the Yahoo blogs or using uh, MySpace. Oh, oh MySpace. yeah, oh my God. MySpace is fucked. And that's then, how like, I learned how to use you open... HTML. Yo, yes, as soon as you open the blog, it just blasts you with fucking oh, music, man. Uh, so no, I didn't do that with because uh, I didn't I didn't make a MySpace page until it was about to be fucking defunct because Facebook would be introduced maybe like a year later. Um. But I used to have a live journal. Not a live journal. It was called Zanga. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Damn, uh, go face me back. <laughs> yeah, I used to have a Zanga page uh, in high school. And uh, I would use it as a live journal. Uh, eventually, I would just make it the home for, like, uh, fan fiction. Uh, no, uh, Emily, remember... it's uh, sp uh, it's spelled with an X. Anyone here remember Gaia Online? Yep. Yes. Do I, I still, still have getting... it? No, I, 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 I shut it down. Uh, years, 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 years. Oh, years my ago. god. So, hey Fonzie, so I learned literally thanks to Guy Online is where I don't where I learned a valuable lesson about not giving random strangers my information. Uh oh. Yep. You <laughs> <laughs> do. Uh, so I was I had like I didn't really have too much on me with some like random like expensive stuff that I got through uh, random gifts and all sort of thing, and this dude just like randomly messaged me. And, promote himself as a GM 
And again, I was a stupid kid. I didn't know anything. This is like the first time I had internet and all sort of thing. He's like, hey, man, so we need you to give us information and passwords. So that way we can restart your account. I'm like, okay, cool. So I gave him my email and password. And like a dumbass, he's a dumbass. Man, I mean, well, you, well, I, how old were you? You were young, right? Uh, yeah, I was young. Like, Yeah, I mean, you, you didn't know. So. 10 or 12, I believe. Yeah. And, and again, this is the first time I actually had internet. So I was still new yeah. to all of it. Yeah, you, you didn't know any better at all. Link but. just screaming at him whenever he loses his account. <laughs> like, <gasps> <Hater! laughs> dude, I felt like that. Like, like I was severely upset. Oh, that episode is such a weird one. <laughs> That's one way to put it. I bet we've all done mistakes in the first time we played with the internet, right? Uh, <laughs> I mean, I already uh, sure where you're going with that. Okay. <laughs> We've all, said some, we've all said something a little racist in our lives. I don't think so. No, no, no. <laughs> but, uh, like, in terms of the fucking family guy Oh, episode, okay, no. <laughs> we've, we've all eaten. <laughs> 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 okay, that's what you mean. Jason. Jason. God damn it, Jason. <laughs> Jason! <laughs> Oh come on, guys! We've all we've all eaten old lady pussy here. <laughs> we've all accidentally eaten. No, our nobody in -law, just right? me. Oh fuck! <laughs> oh fuck! Get <I'm> awkward. <laughs> oh fuck! Now it's awkward, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> Wait! Don't remind me. Remind me what? <laughs> I mean, I've changed a lot in the internet. I'm no longer that weird. 4chan uh, cringe boy who used to like throw out slurs like it was nothing. Thing. Um, Dude. No, so I, I, I never. I not. I, I never. Be, I was never slur boy. <laughs> oh. But uh, slur boy. No. I didn't. I, I didn't shoot the n word, but I did throw out the f word a lot. And I oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's. I was never slur boy. I was slurred boy. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, my God. My God. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to go through that, but still. Like... <laughs> Oh man, I, I still remember a story from 4chan. Uh, I'm gonna have that... to go down the other way. Okay. God, I still remember like one of the, <laughs> one of the terrible days on 4chan. superhero name. <laughs> 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 Great job, slurred boy. I really wish you stopped like calling me chat. that, sir. <laughs> Welcome so to DC's it? newest hero, <laughs> racist and slur boy. <laughs> oh my god. No, 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 that's right. First, it wasn't the Angel and Anaconda story. No, so this was huh? during. Oh, yeah, about the Digimon. That'll be another story for a little bit, but let me. <laughs> so I remember browsing Fortune one day, and. People were basically being hyped up about this next porn game that was about to come out. Mm. And you know me, I'm just like, yeah, you know what, I'll just try it out first try and stuff like that. But literally, when someone posted the download link, everybody in the fucking thread was just like, oh, dude, it's just, it just has dolphins. What the fuck? It's just nothing but dolphin porn. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, was it the dude fucking the dolphin? No, 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 This was actually a porn game, but people were just masculating it. It's just dolphin porn, and everybody was just like, Do we fucking download it? Do we do this? I don't know what the fuck to do! Everybody was just in a fucking panic. <laughs> <laughs> I think I still have that game downloaded onto my hard drive. <laughs> but I, I, I remember, like, for, like, Four hours, no one has downloaded that link, and everybody was just like, dude, this is totally a virus. Dude, no, it's not a virus. So just click into, click the link and download it. It's a one brave add-on, which is basically just like, oh, dude, it's just random ass porn. You guys won't like it. it and, the, and the whole entire thread was just closed off the moment he just said that. <laughs> no, I was never over that thing where I, I was openly open with my fucking porn habits or other shit, and I was not interested in anyone else's porn habits. <laughs> All right, but but the other story about the Angel and Anaconda one. <laughs> Hang on, let me pull up the thread real quick. Angel oh yeah, I, 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 I have the green. I have the green. I have the green text. Yeah. Oh, oh, you do. Of do you course, read I it? have it. I, sure, I'll read it for like the eighth time in this. Week. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How many times have I read it? <laughs> uh, all right. Here we go. I mean, I can read it for you if you want to. No, no, like. Didn't know at the time no, no, my no. parents' relationship was. <laughs> all right, it's like 
Angela Anaconda Digivolve to Angelamon. This short cost my parents a divorce. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you have my attention. How? Didn't know at the time my parents' relationship was rocky. I begged to go see the Digimon movie. Parents agree, but I don't realize for them it's to spend some time together as well. Get to the theater and excited about the Digimon flick. Can't even afford popcorns and drinks. Parents looks happy. Angela Anaconda shorts comes in. Parents also do not speak good English. My little boy mind can't comprehend what the fuck is going on. My parents are utterly confused by this Canadian fuck running around in a Digimon suit. I start crying and they pull me out of my theater. Mom and dad start blaming each other for going to go see the wrong film. Dad throws away the popcorn mom wanted. Lots of arguing and I'm still crying. Get out of the parking lot and drive off in a rush. Get into an accident in the parking lot. Dad moves out a month later. Fucking bitch of a whore, Angela and a condo in my life. <laughs> uh, poor Anon. <laughs> I thought of doing like just fortune green text voiceovers, but then I just become a regular ass fucking YouTuber. Yeah, there you go. Don't do that. <laughs> I'm here. God. I miss green text. <laughs> speed booster. All right. Where oh. am I speed booster? Even early on in the internet for me, I've always had to kind of be the, how do I don't know how to describe it, just kind of the, the, the one that has to babysit. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, let, let, let me read the beats real quick. Uh, uh, 1,000 from Remy. Thank you very much for the best, dude. I think my personal weird computer story was the time I accidentally bought a uh, Bible Black at Salvation <laughs> Army and had no idea what it was until the nurse certainly had a dick. My brother went through the goddamn roof and I was just a confused 12 year old. Oh, no. Anyway, it's Jay, dubs. yeah, uh, <laughs> it was sub and dub, dude. Oh, anyway, what about Jason? What were you saying? But uh, just for me, like early internet, or at least like preteen internet for me, was just having to be the goddamn adult in the room. Because like I remember in uh, in Star Wars Galaxies, I went and joined this uh, this random faction and shit, and um, there was a dispute that ended up happening where someone tried to leave the faction and steal like ten thousand dollars worth of assets from the clan. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I, had to, I had to be like, guys, come on now, it, it's not that big of a deal. Can you just stop? <laughs> and then eventually, the, the guy's just like, you know what? You're right. It ain't that big of a deal. I shouldn't be doing this, and you know, <laughs> ruining people's uh. I ruin these people's digital lives and shit, and then he finally gives the stuff back, and then I get a free gunship. <laughs> <laughs> and then, I don't know, I guess the only other story I can think of was, um... Oh god. My generation just had it really bad. That's when we started. Because, like... For high school would have been like the most impressionable years with the internet, yeah. right? Yeah. And unfortunately for for my generation, high school we had shit like you know kick, <laughs> and that oh, was God. really bad. <laughs> kick. <laughs> yeah. So kick uh, was, was like an anonymous messaging service. Yeah, it was all anonymous, so you can just fucking post whatever. Oh, yeah. okay. It was like an anonymous instant messaging slash dating service, and uh, uh, I see. a lot of fucking kids were getting groomed on there and shit. It was right, goddamn right, awful. Right. So I found no, another no, green no. text that was actually pretty funny. You want to read it? Walking home one night, mugger comes out of nowhere. Give me your wallet. I unload my FN 5.7 on him instead. Realize I used 20 rounds of 5.7 millimeter ammo. Motherfucker, I should have just. It would have been cheaper just if I hand over my wallet. <laughs> Best inner story might have been involving Halo 3. I posted a comment on a video looking up looking a group to do that Vidmaster Challenge annual achievement, and a group reached out to my Xbox Live account. We got the achievements and some harder ones afterwards. Well, I mean, that's a. That's probably a diamond in the rough story. Oh my god! I, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm glad I never had like the 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 stereotypical Xbox Live Arcade experience because I did go online a lot on my 360 uh, when it was new, uh, and I've done some live chats with a few folks. Like back when Resident Evil Five was new, 
Like, my God, I was online with that game almost every fucking day with just randos. And yeah. I never really had a, a bad time with anybody. Uh, it was that and Castlevania Harmony of Despair. Uh, when that came out for Xbox Live Arcade, this was like 2010, I think. I was online with that every day, and I was with randos, too. And it, it was never, oh, it was never a God. bad time. I'm about to say that. Black Ops. Modern Warfare 2 lobbies were wild. Yeah, uh, yeah. Black Ops was wild, too. Yeah, I only played like Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops with my brother Mark uh, and my dad, Steve. Better for you, man. Yeah, yeah. I was like, I, I, I didn't want to play with randos on that one because i i've been to midnight releases <laughs> like i've seen the people that pre-order and buy these games oh like, no. yeah it's like my oh god, my god can you I... stop thank you Ow. so speaking of call of duty Modern for two so we just recently had it's a minute release <laughs> yeah yeah we just recently had a minute release of Modern for two just like a few days ago and guess how many people showed up how many two. so we have a total of like 48 pre-orders only eight people showed up. Oh, boy. Nice. Damn. Yeah. Call of Duty's falling on well, hard I mean, time. Just because they pre order doesn't mean they're going to necessarily show up. Like, I mean, I really just some other shit, but. Well, or it's just like with like Call of Duty and GameStop, it's like bread and butter right there. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, that yeah. That shows we, the decline. <laughs> yeah. But also, you can literally download the game because quite literally, this is only like. Very oh, crazy. my God. Blue Dino. Your story actually just took me back. Uh, the closest I can remember to a first experience was looking at YouTube after my siblings told me not to and then looking up Pokemon stuff. This was the late 2000s, so it was just Pikachu, but cut up and bloody. That yep. shit lo that shit existed, like, day one when Pokemon was a thing. When Pokemon took off, oh my god. Bazook. Yeah, dude, dude, I know, because yeah. I, was I was actually kind of sort of tra traumatized by it. Uh, because I wouldn't know, I wasn't born. Um, I know. <laughs> Don't remind me of that, please. Uh, so, like, Pokemon here in the United States took off uh, big time. This was, like, 97 nine no oh, when, when did pokemon generation one come out here in america it was like 98 or 99 late late 90s late 90s sure. okay uh, i would have been one <laughs> okay uh 98 <laughs> um and like everybody was talking about that i fucking love that i love pokemon i still do uh but you know once you get attached to a certain series like that like that, that that shit is your child and you want you, you want all the positive vibes but because the internet was also a blooming thing around that time, you had a lot of parodies where it involved fucking killing these little creatures. And I saw a lot of that back then when I was first getting introduced to the internet. Flash animations. At, uh, uh, if you ever, uh, if you've ever heard of a website called Albino Black Sheep or uh, Ebama's oh. World, uh, that, those websites were full of that shit. And... Uh, yeah, it was like I don't know what it was. It was like it, obviously it was it, it was just a it was just an edgy parody mockery of things kids were enjoying. They did it with Barney and Friends. They did it with Sesame Street. Now they're doing it with Pokemon because that was the craze. But it, it weirded me out uh, because you know I was young. It was impressionable. It's like I just saw Pikachu get fucking massacred by a bunch of cops, <laughs> uh, and it was uh, it was quite an experience. Aunt, this is for you, by the way. Oh. Uh, because of your, your fucking green text shit. I own a musket for hand defense, since that's what the founding fathers intended. Four ruffians break into my house, the devil! As I grab my powdered wings and Kentucky rifle, blow a gold ball sized hole through the first man, he's dead on the spot. Draw my pistol on the second man, misses him entirely because it's small bore and nails the neighbor's shot. I have to resort to the cannon mounted at the top of the stairs, loaded with great shots. Tally-ho, lads! <laughs> two men in the blast, the sound an extra shrapnel set of car alarms. Fix bayonets and charge the last terrified rap scallion. Bleeds out, waiting on the police to arrive, since triangular bayonet wounds are impossible to stitch up. <laughs> ah, just as the founding fathers intended. <laughs> Is that a Greek tag story, by the way? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, there was a bit where I looked at old Newgrounds videos, and man, some of them have not aged well. No, just a lot like of them. The anything, of anything circa late to early two thousands have aged very poorly. Yes, because yep. our culture, our tolerance, or Black tolerance to off. intolerance. Yeah, our tolerance to intolerance has shifted so dramatically very fast and you go back and look at that stuff it was like what the fuck it was like this would never fly in today's age 
and the, the, best, the best way to see that is just you just got to remember it it's of its time like yeah that, that's, that's why I don't feel reason. that. That's why, like, cause, like, I, I'm speaking as someone who, uh, especially, uh, like, I, I, I dropped the R Wars so much as a kid, and, uh, and uh, fucking up until like my mid to late twenties, no, not not late twenties, because about like the mid twenties, I still was more aware of it, you know. And it's like, it's bad, but I'm not exactly gonna apologize for it because that was just my language back then, you know. It was also and, more socially, yeah, okay. acceptable. For lack of a better description, um, obviously I, I I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't I wouldn't press that on anybody today uh, because it's not socially acceptable anymore. So just don't do it. Um, at the same time, like I'm not gonna feel too bad about using that kind of language when I was young because I was just that I was young. Uh, yeah. I was young and impressionable. Where the fuck am I going? Between here? that and the way that the internet has changed today, where it's very easy to learn things now, when it's, back then oh my it wasn't God. as easy to learn it's about so, social norms and it's about so other different. people. And we were talking about this, I think, a couple of streams ago, where like I haven't been in school, like a, a public school, since 2005. That's when I graduated from high school. And Dude, at, the, at the tail end of that, you know, smart. Smartphones were not a thing yet. Uh, they were. We still. We had cell phones, and those were getting smaller. And we have also had flip phones, which I, I'm sad died. <laughs> uh, to 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 like a major extent, but smartphones were not a thing yet. Uh, computers were still something that you only had on a laptop, which not everybody had because they were still pretty expensive, or you had a dedicated desktop. But the iPhone and other shit was not a thing for like another few years. And you still had to go out of your way to learn shit outside of your house. But now everybody's got a fucking library in their pockets, which is so hilarious because math teachers were sure you wouldn't be able to bring calculators with you. <laughs> John, now who's laughing? I don't want to alarm you or anything. What? Well, there's a stink bug directly up on the ceiling right above me. What? Run. Did this motherfucking drop? Run. I was, you make me think I there was a stink bug. Scream. There was you made me you made me look up, you bitch, because I was thinking <laughs> there was a stink bug above me. And I didn't even question how how you even know that. But I instinctively looked up, you piece of shit. I hope that stink bug falls right on your head. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to scream if it does. <laughs> well, it's a stink bug. Stink bugs don't hurt you. I hate bugs. I mean, I do stink too, bugs but aren't like, real. stink bug. <laughs> they can't hurt you. Motherfucker <laughs> stole my bike. <laughs> oh, no. Da, 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 da. <laughs> da, da, oh, da, da. no. Yeah, we're talking about dated Newgrounds videos. Uh, stole my bike. But it's like. Jason enters the void when the bug lands. <laughs> <laughs> I thought the funniest fucking video in Newgrounds was the fucking. It was in Mortal Kombat one where Raiden does the I love the day! into like different fucking. Yeah, like, he fucking games. transitions to like different different. I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah. 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 And one of them was the Earthbound, and he goes through the tunnel, and then just you see Ness with the bike, and then you just see the yeah. bike. Ness, and that was the best shit ever. <laughs> what about Supersonic with the big ass sword? Oh god. <laughs> to this day, my favorite ever Newgrounds videos is Zero versus Link. Because it has Zero fucking Lincoln Park. No, oh my god. god. That was like that, that was that was like half of Newground animations back then. Oh, <laughs> man. Just Lincoln Park songs. A and B. Yeah. Part of my favorite like Newgrounds animations were Link, uh Four Swords of Misadventure. That shit was hilarious back then. <laughs> no. Uh, the, the, the issue with Newgrounds is that, you know, I was in elementary school, pretty much, and, uh, accidentally stumbled upon Zonton, and... Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Man, yep. I remember the first time I found that website. <laughs> I have, what is it? Zonton. Zonton. I have no idea what that is. Porn. You never uh, heard of, wait, you never heard of Zone? Maybe if you spelled it. Uh, Z O N E. Oh, <laughs> All right, no. So you, so, Cartoon so parody you know. porn. <laughs> Yeah, so you know we're no. like, uh, it's like Raven from Teen Titans getting fucked by Slade. <laughs> no, okay. Uh, how about um? No. How I'm about? Sorry. I'm sorry. No. <laughs> uh, how about? Uh, like, I, I didn't like watching Teen Titans when it was relevant. Why the fuck would I watch porn? 
Uh, there's the one where, uh, where Cyborg is giving Jinx a blowjob. No. Shut up. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the fuck? All is right, that Fonz, even legal? Stop I was gonna say, yeah, is that even legal? They're teenagers, dude. Like, um, like, no. This is like back in the 2000s. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, but no, I've not. I don't know any of that. <laughs> oh God, be God. I, I forgot. About I feel that bad shit. for the Why? for like the the creators of the the show, because like you, you got to think about it from their their time. What they wouldn't have thought. You know what? We're gonna change the Titans and then turn them into teenagers. Yeah. And then the internet's just like, and then we're going to draw porn of them. You're gonna what? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> that's 100 percent by the way i'm not oh, gonna yeah. talk about the fucking teenage robot one i Yo. said enough hey, hey oh Bill. thank god we fucking talk stop talking <laughs> hey, <Amy. laughs> oh thank christ thank you very much for the oh, jesus christ <laughs> dodge the bullet there uh hey Amy, oh, thank geez. you thank you for the raid uh party of 20. uh we're just about to finish uh, 100% of the next <laughs> Oh, that's 100%. Uh, yeah, it's actually, I think we're done. Uh, I think that's all the items, right? Hold on, yeah, it looks like it. Everybody! Hmm. You sure you want to nod? No. Fuck up, Fuzzy. Shut up. Stop talking. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no, the you failed to look. You peeked behind the curtain. <laughs> Fucking Nintendo and Super Nintendo. Oh, I remember those. Hi, two people were just talking about his eye. <laughs> oh, for the love of <laughs> <laughs> You idiot! <laughs> just stuck in the fucking traffic. <laughs> 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 Come on, we've aired actual audio of porn in this screen. Yeah, before. yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I mean, <laughs> most like of it is chicken. jazz. I mean, <laughs> no, we're talking about the Wizard of Oz parody porn. That's right, Travis wasn't here for that. Oh, oh, right. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. Trav, I think you would actually like it because it's actually a really good song. Huh? Yeah, it actually yeah, it goes actually... really hard. <laughs> yeah, it goes Pun intended. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, oh, I forgot right. the There's another one I was wanting to show you. Show you oh, guys. yeah, there is Let's another one. Let's see if we can still find it. You forgot the fist? Oh, the North Star. Yeah. Koopas. Oh, yeah, they're real good. Yeah, Koopas! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, here we are. Here we go. <laughs> And this is a Michael Jackson thriller fucking porn parody. What the fuck? Oh, actually, here, here now. This is just Motown. The hell are you talking about? <laughs> Yo, I'm getting down with that song. Uh, is there no save point here, or do I have to leave this area? Uh, the only leave save the point area. is right before. Uh, oh, right here. Okay, yeah, I can save it here. Oh, never mind. I was yeah, fucking yeah. wrong. Oh, can I not save uh, it? No, 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 I can't save No, it. that's an ammo restore. Oh, yeah, there's a save point here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's cool. We're good. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Getting bad. <laughs> <man. laughs> All right, that reminds me. I actually got Shay working on another emote. Let's go. All right. We are just about to approach Ravenbeak, hard mode, which means he's gonna probably rock my shell and just Hard mode, mode, huh? Ravenbeak has a fat cock. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that Ravenbeak hot? Oh wow, that guy's weird! Go, 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 I love that. I love that. <laughs> when you, I'm waiting for season three because it ended in a fucking cliffhanger. Amy, thank you very much I for did. the raid. And please, get out of here. <laughs> yeah. Get out of here before it's too late, please. <laughs> Tell Derek I said hi. <laughs>
Uh, give my love to Kai as well. I hate that it ended on another. <laughs> it ended in the, the weirdest video. fucking cliffhanger because fucking just out of nowhere a UFO appears and then the zombies are gone. Silent Hill too. <laughs> <laughs> I oh swear if they change the canonical ending into the dog ending. <laughs> I hope they bring that back for the Silent Hill remake. Oh wait! I still need to play that game! What? Silent Hill. Which one? Uh, uh, not too much. To be fair, I've you. also never played- I've never played a Silent Hill game either, so... Play Shattered I Memories. Know. Yeah, Shattered Memories is actually... Pretty good, just from uh, uh, an outsider's ob uh, observation. I never played it myself, but I watched LA play. Is that the Wii yeah. one? Yeah, that's the Wii yeah. one. It's also on take phone calls from your Wii. Yeah, <laughs> Wii boat. <laughs> I mean, it was also wasn't it also on PS2 and like PSP or Vita or some other shit? Yes, uh, I could have sworn that yeah, Shattered yeah. Memories was just a, a Wii game. No, I think it was on different consoles. I think. Oh no, looks like it was on PS2. Okay, yeah. Initial release date 2009. All, all I know is that, all I know is that I need to play Silent Hill 2 on the Xbox version because they changed all the font to Comic Sans. <laughs> oh! <laughs> it released on Wii in 2009, and then PS2 and PSP in 2010. A oh, PS2 game in 2010. Yeah, that makes sense. Wasn't like the last Parasite Eve game also like late on PSP? I guess. Like the third birthday, I think it was called. Yeah, that was. Uh, no one liked that one. The last PS2 oh. game I can think of was like I think a FIFA 13 or something that came out roughly the same time as its PS4 and PS3 counterpart. Also, uh, I hate the random, the random shot of a uh, Samus in the the tube. Because whenever I think of a uh, woman in a latex suit in a well, like a white latex suit, I think of the Beauty and the Beast core. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> huh? <laughs> no, Alright, awesome. if, I'm, if I'm playing this smart, I should be counting the missiles I'm shooting, because if you... No, like, you don't have to. Uh, yeah, no, no, because if you pump him with a specific amount of missiles and then do the QTEs, you skip his golden phase. Yep. Uh, I did it during the race, actually, with Trav. Because uh, uh, when, he's, when he's golden, he's invincible. You have to just wait it out. Oh. Draven shot her in the face of the rocket launcher. She took her clothes off. <laughs> I'm creeped out, Draven. She's trying to hug me. I don't know what affection is. <laughs> Yo, so badass. Oh, I fucking love the. I, I love the Twitter about that. It was like get humped and like the boss dies. Draven. <laughs> That was that was Golden Gorilla. She ate cement. <laughs> she ate cement. That's right. That was <laughs> you love that. That is so goddamn true for uh, Guns of the Patriots, man. I don't know why she drank toilet water. <laughs> so if there are some stories that are better off just left. Untold. Uh, yeah, rip and piss Metal Gear. Whatever. <laughs> I, I'm tired. <laughs> you know what, Fonzie? I'll play Metal Gear Solid 1 for you so you can judge me. Play 2. And just play the worst version of 2 that you can. Wait, which, what's the worst version? What's that? Probably the Xbox version. Uh, there's an Xbox version? There's indeed an Xbox version. I keep, um, I'm drawing a blank on what the fucking thing is. Her name is Shrieking Sheep. <laughs> when she was a kid, she tried to put no. gorilla glue oh, in her I hair. Can't, I can't fucking Oh my god. I can't concentrate, man. I'm fucking this piece straight up so hard. <laughs> God, you remember the story of the, of the woman that tried to use Gorilla Glue for her weave? I do remember that, actually, yeah. <laughs> Christ. Wait, 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 what about Gorilla Glue? 
that a woman tried to use fucking Gorilla Glue for her goddamn weave-in. And why? Like, it got stuck, of course. Had to shake the whole thing off, and even then it was still a pretty smooth after job. Yeah. Oh. Ah, oh, God, that hurt. <laughs> So, uh, do those grow back? <laughs> Sam is referring to death. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. They grow back. No, they don't. Oh. Her name is Angry Bird. One day, she had a Happy Meal, but there was nothing in there. <laughs> That's what, uh... She also just murdered a whole town. <laughs> God, that's a beautiful shot. Why well, Mercury seem to make more games like this? <laughs> she also walked out an orphanage. <laughs> why? Is she, why is she trying to hunt me? I don't know about that one, man. <laughs> Let me try pulling out your camera. Maybe she'll dance for you. Nice job, okay. GG. <laughs> I love this fight. I did not mean to say that right after the camera bit. <laughs> <laughs> now don't die in the final part. Oh, uh, I've done that before. What? Yeah. Her name okay. was Corrupted Corgi. As a child, she fell the victim to Ligma jokes. How it feels to... Wow, True and Fog, it feels like I'm getting asphyxiated, dude. <laughs> No, like, I legit love the Raven Big Fight. I think it's really fun. Yeah. It is fun. It, it took it me fucking amazing for, boss fight. It took me, like, a, two hours to beat him. <laughs> yeah, same. Uh, it kicked yeah. my ass my every first, time, but yeah. it's like, my I knew time. what I was doing wrong. Like, I was like, I know what I did. I could beat him. Yeah, same, actually. Fuck it. I missed. Fuck it. I missed. <laughs> Fuck it. I missed. <laughs> Her like, name I need is to go Dreaming Dingo. As a child, she fell for an NFT pyramid scheme. <laughs> <God>. <laughs> ah, that is a super villain story. <laughs> John, are you ever going to stream Metal Gear? Uh, at some point I want to. Hey. Hey, it's just, just going to get really problematic okay when I get the fucking guns to the Patriots. <laughs> what are you talking It just becomes a riff track move. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> I mean, cutscenes aren't as bad as I uh, remember them to Rats! be until you get to the Spare end. Rats! <laughs> She's going nuts, man. She gave him the good suck. <laughs> suck the whole fucking spaceship, dude. That's not the right type of hand job. <laughs> <laughs> This is not what I meant by handy. <laughs> That's her nice dad. Time. Even better. Oh, God. Oh, Fuck, man. No. I wish this suit wasn't just for this part. Like, there's like, I I'm hoping the it's next so game, cool. I'm hoping the next game we can go into the suit at will or some other shit. Like, It'll be like start... going into phase on mode, right? Or something. Just going into Metroid. Just have it be hyper mode. <laughs> yeah. Just be like a temporary power up mode where you just go full out Metroid. And, like, you can. You get you absorb health of any enemy that you kill in the like in a short a lot of time, that sort of thing. Ooh. Without getting hit. Without times? yeah, without getting hit. You also can't enter cold areas. Oh yeah, I was gonna say they probably might show up in Metro Prime Four. No, why would I? I thought I got canceled. Uh, I mean, I mean, I mean, to be fair, if you can expect Prime, like Prime the take, this is the other side of the timeline. There's a timeline. I'm you can actually your spine. You can end this fight faster if you let. Uh, what the fuck are we calling this thing? Super Craven Beak. Yeah, Craven Beak. Yeah, Craven Beak. Yeah, I, I, I kind of like that. Craven Braid. Craven Braid. Cra 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 what, what, what's Braid? <laughs> I mean, the indie game. I'm not craving that shit. Uh, <laughs> Just call him Braid. If you let him take like about three steps forward before you shoot the gun, you'll actually kill him faster than just shooting immediately. I don't know why that works. Fred. I can't believe you just sell them. 
Also, Samus is a nice ass in the suit. Hey, hold on. <laughs> and I did it my <laughs> way. I'm killing you. <laughs> that was you say when I blasted him in the fucking face. <laughs> Samus just pulls out the German quotes. <laughs> I'm surprised they didn't lower the time limit for hard mode. A fire in my laser. Blarg. God, I still remember that being like the funniest joke ever. What? Was young. <laughs> the funniest I'm joke a fire in my laser. Oh, oh, right. no, my, my favorite awesome. one was the what the fuck? Oh, the explosion, yeah. <laughs> What oh, dude, I remember coming home and watching stick figures on crack on loop. Stick figures? Stick figures stick on Stick figures crack. on crack. Nah, no, i never seen that. I hate myself now. <laughs> no, 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 it sounds crap. Crap, it's, it's okay. Nah, I know what you're talking about. about. Don't talk to me. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I don't need your pity. <laughs> I kind of want to, like... Emulate this game and just play the whole entire game with hyper mode. <laughs> just see how no, I think that get boring really quick. I'm speaking as a guy who loves going through like Resident Evil 4 with Chicago that type. That sounds so familiar. What was it? Uh, Forest Fire 101. I think that was a really old YouTube channel. Forest that Fire sounds so familiar. <laughs> Fall down into it every single time. Yeah, cinematic slur. Five spark. Fuck. <laughs> Did you say cinematic slur? <laughs> no, shine spark. <laughs> cinematic slur is just a, slur. a Tarantino films. <laughs> All right, we got the Dutch angle. Now give me a wide shot. Bird's eye view. Spectacular. <laughs> cinematic slur. <laughs> oh, that's what slur boy okay, superpowers. Is. Stop motion Lego <laughs> Batman guy, probably. I love the claws. <laughs> Big, meaty claws. There's no meat in those claws. Fucking, this guy just shows up like, you got games <laughs> on your phone? <laughs> Yo, you got games on your phone? Yeah. Fucking die. <laughs> hey, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna join you now. <laughs> <laughs> just fades. <laughs> like, what the hell was that about? Anyway, I can't, I can't touch the ship. Look, no time to process that shit. Alright, I gotta get the hell out of here. I like the story of Shadow of the Hedgehog 2, by the way. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> killing you. I had to fight my dad at the end. He <laughs> oh gave me his God. blood. <laughs> and then I turned now Super Now I'm Shadow? the ultimate life form. And now he's trying to make a bunch of clones of me. <laughs> oh my God. Hey, Lady. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I hate that oh, show. by the way, my dad's an alien. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually appropriate that you bet your shadow the hedgehog because that is the next game we're doing. He uh, is black, by the way. Too. Is, okay, cool. I wasn't sure. <laughs> what I feel that. I feel, I feel that's that's not my place to confirm that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, our next playthrough is going to be all a rank shadow the hedgehog playthrough. Are we doing all three hundred sixty-five deaths? Mm, fuck you. I'm what just asking. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. you for even asking. What version are you playing? Uh, GameCube. Fair. There's different GameCube. versions? Yeah, PS2, Xbox, and GameCube. Oh, I forgot it came out on... Yeah. Wait, was it on Xbox? Hold on. Yeah, Xbox is yeah. the original. Multi-platform, just like uh, Heroes. Is the back of it lying too, like Sonic Heroes? What does it say in Sonic Heroes? It, remember, it says it's a 720p game, but it's not. <laughs> Well, on the GameCube itself, I guess? Maybe no, the like component? On the, the, on the, the Xbox, Xbox version. Itself. Man. Oh, I don't know. Maybe it's because the 360 was already a thing when that game came out. Maybe. I don't know. Sonic Heroes? No. Oh, oh God. Oh, Hero, like Heroes. 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 Okay, I'm sorry. I thought you meant Shadow the Hedgehog. Ew, someone's... Yeah, 50 bucks? Fuck that. Never yeah, mind. what the fuck? Hey, Ryan, thank you for the bits. Holy shit. Like, I'm not even uh, contributing Jesus. throughout the stream, but thank you very much. Uh, and here is your bounty for a mission well done. This series is wonderful from start to finish. I'm happy to have been able to follow it. Thank oh, you. Oh, yeah, this uh, is right. the last game in the series. Okay, save that for the charity, my guy. <laughs> because uh, next Saturday uh, into next Sunday is our Crash Team Raising Charity event for Extra Life's Game Day. Uh, we're once again raising wow. money for CHOP, 
the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, which I know is like, Jen, you're in Georgia now. It's like, what well, fuck you, bum? You know, homegrown Philly. So I'm gonna hey, raise your part family. of your proceeds go towards your local ch- uh, children's hospital. Yeah, exactly. So we're gonna be playing Crash Bandicoot games for 25 hours. I say 25 because the daylight savings time ends in the middle of the event, as it always does. So it's technically 25 hours. But Are we, we gonna save the full 25, 25 hours? Probably. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, otherwise, I mean, the only, I think the only time we didn't commit to it was Mega Maniacs. We cut that stream short by, I think, I remember that. three hours because I was not feeling good. Like, I was, I was, Pac-Man uh, short? Hmm? no, Pac Man went uh, the full 24. Okay. Yeah, I think Mega Maniacs was the only one we did not commit to the full 24 hours because by the, because I was playing almost every game for that uh, marathon. Because uh, Ben had no experience with Mega Man, and one of our own, one of our other guests only requested to play like one or two of them, I'm sure. So I had to play all of them, and I was just fucking done. And by the time we got like to the, and it didn't help like one of the last games I was playing was Mega Man and Base. So I was not only oh, playing yeah. a game I absolutely hate, but I was also not feeling. It. I, I'm just like thinking of like the Majora's Mask guy who was just like, yeah, let me just close my eyes. Yeah, he just I wish like falls asleep. <laughs> To do X2 for you guys, or Mega Man 2, or 4, or 6. I would or... love to do uh, an X-related uh, charity event, because we did it for classic Mega Man. Gibbs on X4? Yeah. I could do I'd be down. half I'd be of down. that shit. I, I, I can do all of it, except for 7. Die. Uh, I, and... could do, I could do X4 and X1. Now, now, the thing is, do we include Command Mission? No. <laughs> Fuck you. No. I'm just asking. Not Command Mission, no. Chameleon Sting! Chameleon Sting. <laughs> I hate Maverick Hunter X, man. What? <laughs> Farm as Tornado. As be, the audio. Oh, okay. Well, all right. I like Maverick Hunter X. Shotgun Ice. Shotgun Ice. Sword Tornado. Penis. Hey, at least we didn't get to the later games. Freeze Cracker. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then you're like, every time you shoot it, like you just hear it in the background, like, can I say that? <laughs> it's the only weapon he doesn't say the name of when he shoots it. <laughs> oh god damn it. Have I heard of Shadow the Hedgehog Reloaded? Was that supposed to be like a mod to make it better? Uh, no, I've never heard of that. No, oh, it just adds clips a to turd? It, it just add it just add clips to the gun, so you actually oh, have to reload. <laughs> oh, you actually, oh, fuck. <laughs> that an extra step. Uh, no, I've not heard of that, JC, but we're going to be playing the game raw for uh, the, the next playthrough, so. Christ, reloading in Resident Evil 4 VR. Damn, Damn John. Pick it up. Good job, Johnny. I was kind of panicking there for a second. The completion was going to be 99% again. Uh, <laughs> so we died a total of seven times for our hard mode playthrough. I wish I showed you Emmy parries because I was on top of my game for that. <laughs> I parried a lot of Emmy attacks. I was actually pretty proud of myself for that. You know what? For someone who's going to do the best of clips, make sure you track that. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, so do we Ooh. get all the images for the gallery? Got the Metroid Fusion one. Look at that's the fucking JoJo image, dude. <laughs> jo- jo- oh, you're approaching me. I can't <laughs> keep your ass from getting closer. And with that, ladies I- and gentlemen, we're done, and we unlocked Dread Mode. In this Woo. mode, everything kills you in one hit. I can't freeze and stun your ass without getting closer. <laughs> Well, that, that, that sounds like you need a long beam <laughs> upgrade, my, my guy. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we unlocked dread mode. Uh, everything's it's pretty much. I think it's like the equivalent of like Dante may Dante's Dante must die mode or some other shit for Devil May Cry. Yeah, everything kills you in one hit, uh, and you just, just gotta do a no hit run basically, or at least you no, know, do enough of a no hit run until you save scum <laughs> past everything. We'll do that at one point, not now. Because um, I Metroid out, and with this There's done... There's no more Metroid. Yeah, and with this done, we are finally finished our <laughs> originally Metroid 35th anniversary... Uh, yeah, it was 30, yeah, 35th. No, 25th, 20, 35th, 35th. Anniversary celebration. Uh, 
hullabaloo because this originally started to celebrate Metroid's anniversary last year and we were playing every fucking game in the series, most of it 100%. We didn't give a fuck about Prime Hunters and all that, but this has been <laughs> quite an enjoyable journey. I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves as well. And if you have not played any of the Metroid games and you followed this series along, I hope you now have some understanding of why I love this series to death as much as I do. Uh, that said, is there anything else we want to talk about besides Zone? Uh oh. No. <laughs> Oh wait, yeah, we gotta check the we gotta check the Chozo gallery. Um, where do I go for that? Do I gotta uh, go into your file and then press L? Okay. Take that L. There we go. Extras gallery. Ooh, ooh, oh. Is there like a hidden teaser here too, or is that probably not? It? No. No. Okay. It would be nice if they did, just and for like. Rewards. I'm assuming like the other ones are for like completing under like two hours or some other shit, or on uh, dread mode. And that's just the uh... wait. What's this? Oh, that's really nice. What? No, just like Ooh. that's it's a, it's just a, a collage. You got Raven Bee, Kray, yeah. Mother. Uh, oh yeah, man, that's Gimme. a that, that's a fucking ant dude thumbnail. Uh, huh? Wait, what? No. Uh, Oh man, that, that detail on crate is superb. Oh, oh my fucking god. What? AI is a mistake. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, Sponge just stepped out here. Shining on a rock with a really soft beard. Now I can't see what the cloud up here. Square pants gonna start a drop this year. Wow, he has a rap career? Oh, you gotta be Kevin here. There's no way that he reps it's here. Gotta be crap, no slime in the ear. Oz gotta make sure you're white, dear. There are just a couple things I gotta make clear. Sponge still good like the re and cheer. Sponge is related to the great Shakespeare. Month that you're square and I got my cake near. I hear him, I declare that you have a great beer. I this in the air so you have to wait here. So make sure you're there when my cake break beers. <laughs> Kind of slaps. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, yeah. I, <laughs> I'm not sure I was going to get the bot taken down, but I mean, it's going to the stream archives anyway. But no, that okay. wasn't, that wasn't uh, tagged in anything. Okay, okay. Also, can you go back to that image of like Photo 4? I've never seen that image of all the Chozos. Yeah, these are the. Um, I think this is when the. No, these aren't the other battle. These aren't the other Mockins, right? I think it's the Toha tribe. I think it might be um, Toha. Yeah, yeah, it's the the Thoa Toa. The uh, uh, yeah, when they're getting uh, fucking ransacked by the Mockins. Yeah. Yeah, because this is like, this is like the beginning of it. I think this is when Ravenbeak uh, discovered the Emmys, and that's when he uh, th he's the reason why the first Emmy is in the state that it's in. Uh, this is them, I guess, capturing Kraid, who just happened to be on this planet. Uh, this the is... agreed upon idea is that they captured him immediately after Samus killed him in Super. Yeah. Like and they just, just plundered the planet before it exploded. Yeah. Uh, and this is Quiet Robe uh, studying creatures. It looks like I don't know what he's studying here specifically. That's the uh, the experiment. Oh yeah, the boss experiment. Fight. Yeah. This, uh, the yeah, you're right about that. You're right. Um, this is. I don't know why I thought you were talking about experiment. These are. <laughs> I, was. I I'm assuming this is. This is Mockins going through a trial or some other shit. Because that 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 shows that shows was fucking ripped. Like holy shit. I think that's supposed to be Raven. Is that Raven Beak? Like oh yeah, look at wait wait, wait, wait he's yeah, yeah, he's yeah, got yeah. a twelve. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's got a twelve inch guy. <laughs> yeah 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 yeah. Look at his armor set from below his waist. It actually looks like his armor. It looks or the same as be. the other ones. So yeah, I wasn't sure. Out of the way, nice cock. Uh, and this was when the X parasites revealed themselves because one of them infected one of Raven Beak's soldiers and they brought yeah. him back to the planet and that's why the base has been I love how the one dude sitting in front of Raven Beak is like oh shit what oh, the fuck, fuck. <laughs> yeah Raven Beak is like well <laughs> this you sucks. fucking yeah, idiots yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, and this is uh, Raven Beak learning about the Emmys and how to hack them and do their bidding for them oh, I just noticed that little like, thing of Samus on the left over there okay. Exion? oh I guess it's because they're, they're looking uh, programming them to find Samus's DNA Okay, mm -hmm. uh, and this is uh, well. At this point, they're already ex-parasites, so they just. Oh okay. my god! You know, you know what? Okay, okay. Hear me out. I would love to see a Metro game that basically me takes too. place with the Chozo games. You just basically take part of like one of the Chozos from one of the tribes, and you're basically well in the past where they're basically getting this warrior spirit and stuff like that, mm. but in the style of a hack and slash game. Uh, I mean, it could work. 
Yeah, and I, then I, I, personally, I personally would still like a Metroid origin story. That's not Zero Mission. Like, at yeah, Samus I, I, learning the Chozo ways. Like, when she first got the power suit. You know? Um, wasn't, that, wasn't that the first Metroid game, though? No. When she was just basically learning? No, no. Uh, no, no, we mean like when she first first gets the power suit. Yeah, like, well, like it starts. She's learning like, how obviously, to use the beam like it, it obviously starts after her parents' death and when she's taken in by the Chozos. And the game like takes in it, the, the time span of the game takes place throughout her training. And like the very tail end of it is like when you get the powers. It, it, it could be the game's hyper beam moment, basically. Yeah, yeah you know what? Like, like you get the I, regular suit and you fucking go to town, whatever it is. You know? And that's how you can basically see Samus just kind of like crawling around, kind of like looking into like these crevices yeah, and trying to find like a secret warrior. items. I mean, I'm, yeah, exactly. I got, I'm gonna be real. I'm basically describing Tomb Raider with spacesuits, <laughs> but uh, I, I, I think it'd be pretty interesting. Uh, I think that's a pretty interesting venue to explore because even though this game was 20 years after the fact, it does feel like we've reached the conclusion of an arc that we've been longing Finally. for for a long yeah. The end of the Xehanort saga. Wait. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, that, I believe this guy. But I don't know where you go from here. So the question is, yeah. do you go from here or do you go backwards? Or do, you know, whatever. You just have to tell a new story. I guess we'll, we'll find out. Another. I guess we'll find out for sure with Prime 4. Yeah. I'll Prime, see you in six years. Yeah. <laughs> I'm hoping we get some sort of teaser for next year. I'm not, I'm not holding my breath, but still. Uh, either way, Let's wrap it up. Let's um, let's find someone to rate because this this stream has gone on long enough. It's almost five and a half Did hours. Did you say rap? Rap? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what that is. <laughs> it's rap god. DK sixty four. Oh okay. Never mind. Uh, let's find someone to raise. Any of my mutuals rating? Okay, no, we're not. All right, we're gonna rate a random. Uh, Ooh, let's play Metroid. Yeah, so let's rate a random playing Metroid. Metroid Prime 2. Are you going to play KH tomorrow? Uh, yes. Uh, we're going to start that around... Oh, yeah, and I finally got my new hours, so and I'm going to be off at 6 now. or 4 o'clock. Mm -hmm. uh, because... And I'll be hosting yeah. SRB2K in 9 hours. Oh, yeah. shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, why did I let him go this long? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let us re who's, who's streaming the game? Uh, fucking. No, stop. <laughs> Almost like you're going. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate it here. Uh, let's no. Rate this We're not doing C bet. <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, we do need a raid hashtag. And his name is John Seabass. <laughs> oh my god. Hashtag bunch of words. Bunch of words. I don't know what that... Oh, that's what Trav said, right. Uh, okay, whatever. You guys do whatever you yeah, want. Yeah, let's... Yeah, no, probably not. Please do that. Uh, probably not. God. Somebody. Yeah. Have a good night, yeah, everybody. I'll do nap snack. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that's what nap snack. Oh, <laughs> 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 Bye, everybody.